Hi, chat. Hello, chat. How do you do, chat? Hello, hello. It is me. Well, there's a lot of trash in the room again, and a floating phone, but here we are. <laughs> Why are we always on the 10th or 11th floor? Why is this my life now? It's the worst. Uh, it's too much. Too much, I tell you. Also... Well, that's interesting. They... changed things. I like someone was stuck in the elevator. Oh, hey, uh, Tessa. Hi. What's, are you all right? 
Uh, yeah, I gotta do something here. Come with me. Oh, okay. Uh, where is it? Right over here. All what right. happened? Watch my back, all right? What? Okay. I have a knife. Oh, fuck. Wait, hold on. Oh, what's happening? Shit. Um, hold on one sec. I didn't save something. One sec. I need to be worried. What's happening? Oh, yeah, no, no, there's nothing to worry about. Everything's going to be just we, fine. Do I need to put the knife away? Um, no, you can have it open. Okay. All right. You ready? Okay. I'm ready. FBI, open up! Oh! Oh, God! Oh! What? Perfect. All right, thank you, Tess. I wasn't sure if anyone was home, what? just in case they got upset. Oh, okay. April's right around the corner, so I figured I'd start practicing now. Uh, April Fool's Ryan. jokes? Uh, this is Brian Knight. <laughs> How can I help you? Are you trying to call Nino? Oh, um, <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, yeah, for some reason, his phone comes to my phone sometimes. I don't know why. <laughs> yep, yep. Who is this? That's awkward. All right, okay. That was a sus call. What? What do they want? I don't know. They thought I was some other guy for some reason. Oh. I well, think it's something weird. to do with like, uh, yeah, yeah. I don't know why it happens. Um, how have you been? I've been all right, you know, just kind of exploring the world and seeing where I fit in it. You know, cause oh. I'm, I'm not coming back to the PD or anything, so. Wait, really? Why? Uh, a lot of reasons, but, uh, well. Is it because of what I did with that EMS lady, like, five years no. ago? No. Oh, thank God. Well, some of that contributed, but not... Oh. Not because you did it. It's more everyone's reaction to everything. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, it was chaotic times, you know? It's, uh... Yeah. It was pretty miserable. And I don't think I want to repeat it ever again. I mean, everything's uh, so much better now, you know, with Pre President Davis running the country and all that. Um, you know, he's got a great vision for the United States. You know, I, uh, I, um, yep, politics. I think things were better back then. Okay. Oh, Jaeger? Jaeger? <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. I heard his voice. I did too. Well, regardless. Yes, it was good to see you. Yeah, it was nice to see you. And um, good luck with your April Fool's. You know, it's January, right? Oh, yeah. Like I said, I got to get ahead of it, you know, because um, you only get one opportunity like in the morning on April 1st to like do it right. Because if you kind of mess up, people are going to catch on that it's a joke. You want to get them right yeah. before they forget, uh, before they remember uh, what day it is. You know what I'm going to do? Oh, I'm gonna, what's that? I'm going to go into Juno's kitchen and I'm going to tape down a little um, hose on her sink. The little shower faucet thing that you pull out on the tubey thing. Okay. And so when she turns the sink on in the morning to get a glass of water, it's going to spray her. Oh, that would be good. Yeah. That's my go-to. Works every time. One. Isn't she going to see the hose, though? Well, no, that's, that's the beauty of it. Because most of the time they've got, it's like pushed into the sink. So it's... 
It's not like oh. out. Yeah, you just tape down the little lever. And so it thinks that it's being in use. And so when you turn the sink on, it, it just sprays you. Holy shit. Yeah. It's the evilest thing I can imagine. I mean, it's it's funny and it does it's kind of harmless. Yeah. And that's, you know, that's what it's about. Oh. Are they trapped? Hello? Y'all good in there? Hello? Oh. What? Oh. oh, well, it worked. Sorry, we heard tapping in there. Oh, okay. Well, Tessa, I better get to work before someone uh, steals a gun off oh. me. Oh, okay. Good luck. All right. Thank you. You take care. You too. <laughs> oh, my God. The timing of Jaeger, honestly, that was so funny. <laughs> Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, three in pink, thank you for the four months. And Machiavelli, thank you for the gifted sub. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Elevator's still bugged? Yeah. yeah. I think it will be perpetually bugged. I don't think anyone's gonna fix it. <laughs> I don't think there's any way to fix it. If they haven't figured it out by now. Uh, Frederino, thank you for the prime. Oh, yeah. Darth, thank you for the biddies as well. And yes, we are going OG today. That's how I'm feeling. Take that out and put that in. <clears throat> Whee! So much trash. Tessa with a knife. We've always had a knife. 
We're always strapped. People better watch out. Oh god. You pay to watch El Tesso versus Max in the ring. <laughs> I think the um synced emotes have an added bonus for me of uh allowing those kinds of fights to last a little longer. Although I think Tessa vs. Carmine yesterday was actually really good because um, they're both ped models and they both do the same general amount of damage and they both have lower HP. This whole city is corrupt and I'm standing here with Yeah, I love that. I do love that he ran away. I love Chains. He's so funny. And I love that Carmine is willing to take an L like that. You are going to arrest me for throwing for, thing I never threw. Yeah, for throwing trash at a group of people. Yep. Facts. Hi. Hello. I'm a man. Oh. Jesus fucking uh -oh. Christ. Hello, how can I help you today? Hi. Um, could I please get a uh, four orders of French fries and a sprunk. Yeah, that's not a problem. With ice. Moment, sprunk with ice. Got it, got it, got it. 
All right, it's going to be $21. Just swipe your card right there. Please do not beat up the machine the way you beat up all your enemies yesterday in the ring. I'm making no such promises. All right, I'll, I'll keep it in mind then. 205. Thank you. And your order number is 207, by the way. 207. Okay. Oh my god, hey! Yeah, hi! It's good to see you. Looking good. I just hungry. I'm gonna hi. die if I don't eat food. Hello! Mm. I was just saying hi to a neighbor. I mean, I'll pay for it, and, and then you can give me free. I'm just so. You can just give. You can just charge me. If you're about. No, if you're about to die. I mean. 206. Uh, thank you. Yeah, that's oh god, me. Thank you. Hey, don't nurse me. All right. I owe gifted. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I, no, I'm okay yeah, I'm, for now. I'll get through combo. Full of beans. Now I've heard your voice. Okay, okay. I'm in the big wide world and spring into action. Spread some positivity and energy. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, um, pass that energy on. Catch you uh, later. It doesn't really matter. Put whatever on it. I just care about the meat. Just get a random. Did you want one or two? Two. Uh, am I able to work back here? I'm just yeah, putting random things on there. You want to fry Fuck some? Fuck it. Okay. The two french fries, two... two sprung. Two, uh, seven. Uh, light eye. Oh my yeah, goodness. I deserved it. I deserved mm -hmm. it. I get it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you want me to pay for your meal? I got it. Oh. No, I got it. Let me just pay for There you go. There you go. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Hey, what's up, guys? You too. Okay, okay. How long you gonna work for? I don't know. It's only at 50. Are we good with the stocks? Are we, are we looking? Yeah. 30. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'm okay. Not good or good? I just got off the train from hell. <laughs> Can we get a stock check, please? I'll start shopping. Today, At least bro. it's better than the plane ride from hell. Oh, really? Hashtag WWE. Hashtag Ric Flair. What you mean? I look like oh, fuck, a Did you see him? Oh, no. Oh, no. it's like what a famous wrestling like story of how. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a. Yo, what up, man? Fuck. Yo, uh, I hear the people getting drunk and high with concussions. All right. I will not say that. I promise you that. Okay. Have a good day. Your dad is a criminal and a crook. Not Flappy Bird. Oh. He said 450. Tessa! Junar! Alright, you wanna hang with Luther? Put that knife away! Sure! Who? Hey, What's going on? Have we met? Who? Hey. Uh, you know, I think we met a long, long time ago. Probably but arrested I don't me really... at some point. Okay. Dr. Kane. Doctor now, oh. you know. Okay. I've never seen well? you at the hospital, so I imagine you don't get hurt a lot. Uh. Well, I am kind of accident oh, no. prone. I did have a concussion oh. yesterday, but I'm okay now. Did he oh, just yeah. talk to Timo? I don't know. Timo was the worst. Burger and medical. I'll let him go. What the fuck was that? Oh, he's just a croak. Oh. You can hang out with Tessa and Lucer and I if you want to. Oh, all right. Oh yeah, I'm gonna grab food. Thank you so much. Maybe a thousand dollars of damages because of my knees. Cool. Oh. I had the doll under control, see, I, he was trying to stab me, but I de-escalated it. That's, that's great. Yeah. Glad you didn't get stabbed. Exactly. Hi, can I get two yeah, cheeseburgers, two but, fries, you know, and two chewy with ice? Yeah, reason. what do you want in a cheeseburger? Everything, nothing pain. but cheese. I would be do you need a circuit board? You know, 30 yeah, feet off a ladder. No! Yeah. You sure? Because I don't need it. I don't, I don't need one. They took it to the How much is it? Mm -hmm. I just take it. I don't want it. Oh, okay. I don't have the floor in the hospital. Thank you. 
Okay. You're welcome. Just swipe your card right there because you pour out the pay for you. Still consider that career. Hi, how can I help you? Here, order number two one zero. Hey, I have just a regular meal dealer's choice, you know. Mm -hmm. Alright, alright, I'm just gonna pick random things to take off. Alright, sounds good. Okay. Alrighty, you want fries and you probably want some Frunk with no ice because it's better that way. There you go. Alright, can you just swipe your card right there for me, okay? If you're too poor to pay, I can pay for you. I have, I don't have a problem. Hey, if you're off the clock, can you look at somebody who got punched in the face multiple times? Be really helpful. I'm pretty sure I got punched in the head. It might be a fist mark in my. I'm not sure if it matters because I did put a band aid on. Yeah. You need more bandages? It would be very helpful. I get punched a lot. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. Oh shit, it's Tess. Be careful, okay? Come back. Beat up the machine. Yo, Yeah. I realized that, you know, all yeah. this muscle okay. needs a lot of water, so can I get two Ooh. waters with ice? That's not a problem, not a problem whatsoever, oh, okay? And you don't beat up that machine when you're, when you're... Whoa! I don't know, I'm feeling a little spicy, I might just have to beat up this machine. Oh my god, you are looking so buff! No. Not Thank you. Thing. No, they're literally what? people who believe they're oh rats, but aren't, you know... Furries, you know, as, hey, a, uh, no, as a fan, I'm paying for your order today. I can't, I can't even accept it. Your order number two one two five. Oh, you don't uh, ha have no, to do that. I can pay either. for it. No, I had, to, I had to. I'm a, I'm a giant fan. Okay, I saw what you did in the ring yesterday. Wait, ring. Well, what thank you very much. You're welcome. You're Maybe welcome. Maybe they did. There was a update for you, eh? I want to tell oh? you, we're gonna soon get the falafel machine working, eh? <gasps> Really? Yes, fresh falafel. Oh my you, gosh. You like meat stuff, so you know it's gonna be great, eh? Have you ever heard That's of perfect. Thank you for the update. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You're welcome. I just want to tell you, eh? Amazing. Thank you. 210 or 211. I don't know this one. Hey, no more fries all the time? That's gonna be great. Probably. Yeah, I mean, I've been surviving on them, so it's gonna be great to have them. Hey, Fiona. Like in New York City. Like in New York City. A thousand miles away, but now. girl, tonight you look so pretty. Yes, you Thanks. do. Oh. Times Square don't shine as bright as you. You know it's true. Hey, wow. there, Delilah. Hey, baby girl, you okay? Um... I'm a lesbian. Hey, I want to apologize. I'll buy your food, okay? Tessa, are so you two twelve? Is, so so is it two waters? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's me. Is it not my sister? It was so beautiful. His singing was. It's, it's very good it was singing. But he lives right to there. I think you might be barking up the wrong tree. I can't hear him. Is he, is he speaking? I, you still gotta, I think I killed him. I'm sorry. Yeah. Rejected him so bad it it, it killed him. Yeah. <clears throat> no worries. I was just singing you a song, love. I weren't trying to get in your pants. You say you were going to buy my food, did you, Harry? Oh, well. Yep. Hey, no more. You, mo you kind no of send the wrong down. message when you call oh, a random woman, woman, baby girl. Hey, dog. What? What's your name? Uh, yeah, if you search my name and then scroll down. Can I get two combos, please? Actually, just one combo, please. I won't be cheeky. No, 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 no. Do you want anything on oh, it? Oh, shit. Uh, the you did that? Uh, yeah, can I just get cheese, please? Hey, can I get a start set? Hey, get two combos. Yeah, you fuck that guy. Do you gave Bobby Charles the same tact face as you as Max? Yeah. Because it's just me. Oh, my God. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? Calm the fuck down. He tried to kidnap me, so I, I thought it was I'll cool. I'll 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 you the fries and E. Cola, please. E. Cola, you want it with eyes and noise? I'm sorry, do you uh, want me to ice, take please. the registers since you're obviously very terrified of this customer? I shit together with Karma and they both, both know what I know. It's good on you. What was your name, Timo? Yeah. It is taking him to my power not to yell at that guy. Do I sound British? I think he'll get what he needs to get. You know, that works in a yellow shirt. He you know, is all of I wouldn't worry about it. Right now with the red hat. Yeah. Are you Janus? Really I feel like you're Janus. I'm not Janus. You're, you're being Janus. Mm -hmm. When, uh, do you want them to do something about it? Yeah. Did you hear what he did to me? Mm -hmm. 
What did you do to you? I'll he came up and sang, hey there, Delilah, to me. And then he said, what's up, baby girl, you okay? And I told him I'm a... Hello. Hey there, Delilah, what's it like in New York City? Every single muscle in my body is clenched because I'm cringing so hard. Who, who is this? Alright, put the horse Both down. of you. Come on, you don't have to. Alright, relax. It's okay, I got it. I got it. <laughs> I told him I'm a lesbian and he just kind of sat there for it's like harassment. 30 seconds. Alright. I'm gonna have to oh, calm down, you know. You're embarrassing Why is there so much drama? What drama? Well, if you want the police. 213. Let's do 13. We're just laughing. I can't stand the drama here. You have no evidence. Yeah, I got my food. Okay, you're... Alright, we'll see. Team... Let's, let's get it. Oh. Got you like a fish. Oh. Yeah, that was a, a strange interaction. Fuck you, Friday. Jaywalking, 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 jaywalking. So? I haven't been out of the hospital in a while, but it seems a lot less chaotic than it used to be. You just jinxed it, loser. Oh, hopefully, man. <laughs> I don't want to drive. I can Within. drive if need be. Oh, I don't have a license, though, so. Oh, oh, okay. We didn't know that. Oh, I gotta take a quick nap. Can you guys mind waiting like one minute? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, thanks. Are you guys nervous for tomorrow? What even is happening tomorrow? Uh, they're doing a protest. A oh. protest? Oh. Oh, yeah. Denny oh. Six. <clears throat> I'm going to be doing something else tomorrow, so... Unless we do it today, Tessa. You want to do it today? Should we? Is today better? I kind of want to see this process. <laughs> Vivek has been talking about it to literally everyone. I've been following okay. him around. That's fair. Max. But does everyone who needs to be around... know? Um, we can talk to... the person that we need to talk to about it. And see what they think. Engage um, who's around and stuff like that. I know that there is a party tonight. That Gigi's yeah. attending. Do you know what, you what time the thing tomorrow is? It's at, at 8 p.m. Eastern. I'm not oh. sure because I'm, I might not be in at that same time. So, so. Clock, it's, I never changed it. I, I just I just thought, look at it the same. Whenever I was, you know, abandoned here, I, I never changed my clock. It reminds me of home. It's okay. I think our thing was supposed to start at 8 tomorrow, too, so... We might need to reschedule that. And I think it's better to push it back than move it forward. Okay. You know, you know who Tim, Timo sounds like, Tessa? Who? You know that one game, Control? And, and, yeah. and Wake 2? There's this one character that's in both those games and he sounds exactly like him. And the game company is based in Finland too. Well, that would make sense yeah, if it's based in Finland. Mm -hmm. What do you do in the games? I don't play many video games. Oh, it's really difficult to describe. So I'm not even going to attempt to. I still need to play control. 
Oh my god, please play it. Please play it. Please. I only play this game called Counter Striker. Oh, I started playing that recently. Oh, I hope you do not have your voice communications on when you play it. No. no. Yeah, that... Oh, <laughs> I agree. I That's no... probably not a good idea. I have not spoken once. Where do we need to go? Uh, you want to go to the clothing store? Oh yes, let me get a suit on. I look on. I look more professional that way. Oh yeah. Still gotta play. We were here. That's yeah. You should play it. <clears throat> All right. When? I don't know. Eventually. You know, I believe, um, what's his name, Speedy is around right now and he's been wanting to talk to Max, but I don't think they're like, the schedules line up, if you want to talk to him about the campaign. Um, can do, I can try and give him a call. Are all you guys part of Max's cabinet? I wouldn't really say I'm part of his cabinet, but I'm, like, I'm helping his campaign. Hmm, okay. I don't know if I have, like, an official position, you know what I mean? Oh, uh, right. I'm, honestly, I'm wearing it for Juno to make sure she gets a uh, solid position. Okay, well, that's good. Yeah. And help her where she needs it. Oh. Wow, you look great, Timo. Oh, no, thank you, you. you also look great. I like your face <laughs> a lot. Like, I really like your outfit. Yeah, I like the shirt, <clears> right? <throat> what, what would the outfit look if you had those tighter pants? You know, the suit trousers? Which ones? You know, the, 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 suit, the, the suit trousers. You know, the, the tighter suit Let me check, actually. Yeah. Uh, these pants don't match that bad. I mean, that, that good. I actually, I don't mind these pants at all. Oh, the, this looks better. I think so, all right. Yeah, but this isn't what I was talking about, but this looks better. Like the tight, tight suit pants? I don't know, yeah. is that my style? <laughs> okay, then go for this. one, this, this. Probably, this is definitely oh, not my style. Oh, it does look good! With the it looks horrible. Suit. No, look no, like no, a, I think, I think I it needs like the baggy Bravo ones. With those pants on. <laughs> Did you know, those were veto pants. I, I think... No, those are like the only pants that I like on men. Not that I look at that's, the tight ones. That's why I'm calling them veto pants. No, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely not a tight pants guy, honestly. Okay. A tight yeah. suit. Jesus fucking Christ, you sound just like him. Uh, let me just quickly speak to Tester real quick. Alright. Um, you know the thing that you called me about yesterday? About the Bobby stuff? Mm -hmm. can, you, can you, like, uh, like, refresh my mind about it because a lot happened yesterday um okay so i was with mr k he got on the phone with max and he said that uh bobby he he took so bobby and carmine broke into his house right uh they were arrested they were brought to pd i presume and mr k had a book on him and he said he took it off of bobby uh to max and he said that in the book, uh, it was kind of like, a, I hate everyone, but these people I hate more. Um, and basically he, his wife and children were on the list. And then uh, it said Max and his goons. And then I think below that was uh, Timo. And then below that was Mr. K said something like, I hate Mr. K. I'm gonna let Timo know this. Um, yeah. Thank you. Oh. Hello? Yeah. Hello, how are you? Yeah. I like the chaos, you know, it's fun for me. Yeah, I mean, he is running for me, yeah. yeah. No, you'll be, have your hands full. Do you make a lot of money when you get patients? No, I, I used to have a 
Roll, rolling income, essentially. Are you gonna pitch? Uh, are you gonna pitch the text messages? Page, it'd be, it'd probably worse. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. I think a lot of doctors would just have a lot of animosity towards each other. Each other, maybe. Oh yes, probably. You know, this yeah. is my patient. No, I saw him fall. This yeah, is my exactly no, that kind of part. shit, right? We ain't nothing we can't deal with, man. Usually pretty straightforward. Do you work with Tessa? Yeah, she's my best friend. Uh, I know all about this. Yeah, yeah. Oh. So, what do you do around town? You gonna be a doctor? Yeah, yeah. I'll reach out to her. Uh, I'll let Max know about this, and then I'll reach out to Tessa about it. All right. Yeah, are you? You're not working. Okay, bye. Like a car or like a house or something. Oh, I really got an advertisement call from your company, eh? I'm sorry. Get me off the I, Get me you gotta off pay. Processor. You gotta no. pay. I'm your best friend. Well, I can't just take people off or get fired. Uh, I've been in oh that temple that a couple times now. Um, <laughs> Timo, are you aware that you're on a hit list? Of Poppy Charles? Yeah. Yes. Okay, alright, cool. Yeah. All right. uh, make I'm sure. also aware that I dumped him in a you know, tub of acid a couple days ago. They don't it, want you know, me, they. The the thing did mention that I think. Yes. Oh, I think I was I was the there when that police was out. found. See, uh, it's a funny story. He tried to kidnap me. Rami saw it, then Rami stopped him from kidnap kidnapping me, and also found the book. Yeah. So what's your beef with Bobby Charles? Aside from him being a piece of shit. Oh well, well me, me and his personal beef go go, go along, you know couple weeks back but also mm -hmm. it's because he's trying to he's trying to ruin Max's campaign and he's you know he's been a well, let's just say he's a liar of sorts you know he was made a deal and he didn't honor the deal but oh well you know some people just go against everything and I, I'm pretty sure that's Bobby and Carmine for you yep yep they never learn their lesson I treat karma like three times a day. <laughs> At least. Can you just like lock him up in a room forever? Listen, I'm try I'm trying to keep him in a bed in a bed as long as possible every time he comes in. I sent him rest? out of the ring crying yesterday. Jesus. I saw that. That was that was something. Yeah. Well you were confused too. I remember bits and pieces of that. I don't when know. You him in single combat, yeah. I don't know why the medics away. told me I was okay to fight after that first fight. But it's okay. I think I bit someone's ankles. Hmm. That's hot. That's an effective fighting move. No, that's hot. Oh, well, I mean, yeah, yes, it could be both, you know, right? Mm -hmm. Does it, is it hot to watch people fight? Or is that, you know, do people no, watch the, the UFC? The biting. Oh, oh, the bite. Oh. Yeah. I prefer a spitting mode. Oh. Well, oh. <laughs> you. Sorry. I'm sorry. Well, where are we right. next? Yeah, what now? <laughs> Oh, what do you guys want to get up to? I want to buy a I'm rock. I'm whatever. You know, buy a buy rock? A, a rock? A rock. I know, I know a woman who sells rocks. I don't know. I know a woman who's trying to sell a rock. I want to go hiking. Let's try the That's rock a, option first. She's selling it for a rock. For a lot of money, though, yeah. it's an expensive rock. Hmm. Shit. How expensive? The last time she told me it was a thousand dollars. Jesus. Oh, well, I know what I can do. What we can do? Um, we can go around putting up flyers because I haven't done that. We can go to. Uh, Timo, I'm gonna send you this flyer.
Um, we could go around, we could do out of the apartments, at Senior Buns, at the hospital, here at, uh, the rental place, um, this clothing store, basically everywhere. I'm gonna start. Okay. Look at that. There's going to be a trial today for Vivek. Yeah, there is. I was just on the top of Another one? Hi, Penny. We are two guys up. We're hanging oh, out. Just meet me at the goddamn coding. Alright. Yes, really. Bye. Is there like something Alex, concerning Pilbash? Sorry. What's up? What you hanging out? Um, or is it like what you guys do? Um, is he in trouble or is he making trouble? Oh, I believe the one, the it's the about Pilbert trying to murder yeah. him. Or I, no, I, we were I trying to murder Pilbert. Oh, horses. God. He uh, left out the horse stickers on his posters? I don't like that. You can say it's, oh, yeah. you know, yeah. felony yeah. number two. The case is not looking too good for him, honestly. Oh, okay. No. Unless he can get Rami to flip. Yeah, I did. Yeah, she did. All right. I'll see you around, Penny. Love you. Love you, call me if you need me. Same goes for you. <coughs> Let's stick it up at the rental spot, and then the apartments, and then the hospital. And I know a lot of people are probably going hunting now, so we might want to head up to Plato and stick it up there too. Mm -hmm. uh, so cool. Group 6 also is still people do it uh, in crime. Yeah. Actually, the head of crime or like the... uh. The man who's running the place, Gomer, is uh, working for my Max as well. So hopefully okay, there'll be a lot cool. of votes. Oh, I feel old. Laundromat. God, so many rentals, man. I still want to know about the pawn shop. So what do you do aside from the mayoral shit? Um, well, I've been doing a lot of uh, advertising stuff with connected mm -hmm. telemarketing. I work oh, with Mr. Okay. K. That's been a lot of fun, actually. Alright. I'm supposed to be well, making so a jingle, but uh, P-Money hasn't really I'll started on it, I don't think, so... How about you? I need the music okay, before I can do the so jingle, I food. think. Oh. I've got a so few ideas. What's the K marketing thing, or what? What, what, what is the business? Oh, um, it's basically an advertising company. So we will um, we have a database of a lot mm. of different phone numbers and stuff, like over four hundred contacts, and uh, we do SMS blasts to people's like phones, and so they get targeted advertising that people pay I'm for. Go for the real quick. Oh, okay. Yeah, so if you know anyone who's got like a business that they want to advertise to the whole city, um, it's a little better than the Yellow Pages or Twatter because it's more um, direct. And mm -hmm. uh, I'm in the Cat Facts division, so if you have anybody that, you know, might enjoy receiving Cat Facts, I do uh, five messages in a day, uh, uh -huh. 10, 15, and 20 different price right. points that's a good thing i'll keep that in mind yeah and whatever mildly annoys you you can mildly annoy them back mm. all, all right. right um we can go to some new buns or we can go to the hospital first either or well maybe we uh go to senior buns because it's closer yeah, than it's the from hospital. The corner. i think i saw one of the signs up at senior buns already oh, okay uh if it's up there we'll just go to the hospital then Another service that they offer that's really useful is uh, if your SIM card gets stolen, we'll uh, mm -hmm. we'll get you a, bet a new one with contacts on it already. Oh, okay. Isn't that the same thing that uh, that LSD thing? 
What's that? The one that Siggy's on about. Oh, I, I haven't heard of that one. I'm sure we're not the only ones doing that kind of thing, but hmm. it's useful. We'll, um, we'll All also right. clone SIM cards, so if you have one that's got contacts on it, we can make a new one with the same contacts. Okay, that's convenient. Not the same phone number, unfortunately, but, you know, close enough. Yeah. Alright, it'll be a oh, minute. Oh. Hello. Hey. What's up? Uh, not, not much. Oh, but... it's the Ben Forehead guy. What's going on? Hey, come on, I... Sorry, um, how are how, how you doing? I'm great, how are you? I'm doing pre pretty good. Um, <laughs> your, uh, uh... Which car is it? Crown looks nice. Thank you. I like yeah. your socks and sandals. No, normally, I would this. correct you, but yeah, they they are socks and what, sandals. What would you call them? Wh whatever you want. <laughs> what do you mean? Um, not nothing. So, um, you c come here often? What? Yeah. Oh, me, me, me too. I all the time. Work here. I do too. Oh, oh, wait, wait. you coming to work a shift? Maybe. Oh, well, me, me, me too. But maybe later, but maybe. Yeah, you know, right now it's really packed. Um, <clears throat> ni nice to see you. Goodbye. Hello, ma'am. Um, you, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. That was kind of <clears throat> tough to watch, but I uh, have a good day. I Goodbye. Agree. That was a pretty rough watch. Yeah. I think that he was... likes me, but... That was oh, really rough. And that's it. Yeah. That was rough, man. I broke his heart. Oof. Yeah, I had to tell him. Barking up the wrong tree. Damn. Alright, well, did you get your stuff put up? Yeah. Alright. Okay. Chaka. Got a mind's home it is. Oh, Where's I that? heard them saying that they're gonna rob oh, the hospital, Carmine's home. Oh, Wait, what? what was that? I'm just saying the hospital is Carmine's home, you know, so stays there for most of the time. Yeah, he loves it, man. He, he loves that night? shit. He just keeps on going in there. Oh my god, someone just sweated out saying Carmine and Bobby are the woke mob. What does that even mean? Isn't that what Vivek is fighting against? Wouldn't that make them Vivek's enemies? They, uh, Carmine and Bobby flip flop, like... Every oh. Hello? Yeah, yeah, um no. <laughs> uh and, um hang on, I'm 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 going to the hospital and put up some flyers when I get there I'll get out of the car and then uh continue, hang on. Right at the hospital? Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah. I see you. Alright, okay. Uh, a couple minutes here. Good thing, man. I right, check inside real quick.
Do you know of, of any raccoons in this area? I was in that bush scouting and I feel like a raccoon based in it. Oh, um, I mean, could be anything real. It could be a stray cat, could be a raccoon. That's true. I must examine it further. Okay. Hey, Hello. We're, we're checking if a raccoon peed. Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, gotta check that, yeah. Back out, let me come this way, gotta check that. Yeah. It's definitely some kind of urine. I'm sure of which kind. It could Do you be. Think there's any distinct, distinct, you know, smell of urine when it comes out of. Ah. Uh... Well, it really does depend, but generally speaking, uh, it's it's very um, potent. It's generally cat pee, but it also could be people. It, 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 doesn't, it doesn't smell any different than, you know, my basement. What did you pee here? Oh, actually... Now that you're reminding me, I think I was drunk here one night. Uh, let's just move on from this object. Oh, okay. Gross. Well, you know when you get drunk, you just have, you have to go. Oh yeah, believe me, I know. Are you hungry? What? Are you hungry, ma'am? Um, that depends. What are you selling? I got some burgers and fries and a drink. Um, I think I'm okay. Maybe someone in the hospital might want some. Okay. What about you, man? You hungry? Thank you, ma'am. Mm -hmm. I'm a little hungry, yes. You want to buy some food? Uh, for how much? I'll give you a burger for 25. I don't have... You well, have an ATM? I can give you a, a little bit of money. Quite, quite a bit. You, you hungry, man? Are you... Me? No, I'm good. I'm good. Give me a second. So you you want to go to the ATM? Oh, I, I think I'm fine. I, I think, you know, if I, if I need to eat, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll find some fresh food, you know, rather than bite from... Uh, Better. Okay. All right. You guys take it easy now. Yep. I'll ah, buy your you... food. No, I mean, I don't want you to, you know, get scammed by $25. Like, uh, a burger costs what, like five at senior buns? Yeah. So, you know, you would be, you would be playing like five times the price. I guess that's fair. I'm sure somebody in the hospital would see the value in it, though. Yeah, I mean, uh... They don't get a I've chance got... to leave very much. Yeah, don't they have vend... Uh, do, they, do you guys have vending machines in there? I don't think so, no. Oh. I guess you guys have to make food runs at some point. Uh, yeah. I'm surprised no one has stepped up for that. I don't think we have anyone doing that. Maybe you should. Food runs? Fuck no. I'm gonna get stabbed at Senior Sally's. Maybe I could do that. Could be a good idea. Open up like a, you know, a, what's it called? Uh, what, what, maybe not like a, not a homeless, but like a food, you know, um, what is it called? You know, when you, there's just free food. Is food it a bank. charity? Yeah, yeah food, food bank. bank. Yes, open up a food <clears throat> bank and deliver food for uh, working people. Good idea. Oh, either one of you rich? No, no I wouldn't say I'm rich. Not at all. Oh, that lady is looking for a sugar daddy. Oh, oh. Maybe, oh the lady. Maybe she has Hello found there. one. Hey, what's up, Ron? Hey, Tessa. Hello. This is my, my new friend, Margul Snatcher. Hello. She wants to be a doctor. 
Hi, how are you? What's going on? Good. She wants to be a doctor. She's Amish. Or was. Yes. Was. I have a PhD from my Amish community that I left recently. She has a lot of interesting Amish medical techniques. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's interesting. Good. It's pretty standard. I can, uh, I can send you an interest, bro, if you want. That would be great. You can what? Send her an interest for her. Mm. Is there no one here to interview her? Uh, not now, no. I don't know where all of them lied. went. I'm scared of that guy. Go? I don't know. Kian always lies. That's a brick. For real? No, not brick. Uh, the guy in his I arms. Share this shit. Oh, that is like... Is that guy keeps, you know, scanning me and trying to get right, my gadgets. Great. Let's see documents. Like, I think he wants think... to exchange me for he credits. Sees, he's... Yeah, she's trying to exchange everything he sees for credits. Even people. You know, my credit score actually went down because... You know, he tried to take things from senior bunch and the police stopped him. Then he looked at me and was disappointed. And then every time he would look at me and scan me, it went you down from 20 the, the to 15 to 10. Apparently, I'm worth I mean, zero it's credits pretty now. standard stuff. I you guys know. get that, by the way? Oh, God. I, think, I don't know um, if that's a good thing or not. Did. You see I'm that worth 10. Document? Well, let's see. Okay, you don't have to flex on me that you're worth 10. I'm s well, maybe mine will go down. I don't know. Maybe mine will go up. Man. Oh, yeah, okay. it's like the Let's stock see. market. I got it. Yeah. What is this document? Oh, it's just a yeah. doctor interest form. Oh, okay. Any of you guys hungry? Uh... Hi. What's up? The poor guy. What happened to him? Um. I'm good, how are you? I'm pretty good. Someone tried to kidnap me. Damn. Yeah. Well, good guy tried up. to freaking steal him, so... Some lawyer kicked his ass, actually. Hey, Glorion. Hey, Rod. What's up? Not much. Trying to work. Oh my god. Oh. That was aggressive. Timo, dude. I'm sorry. He's my, I'm sorry. He's my coworker. Our coworker. Hello? Hello? Hi, Lottie. Hi, what are you up to? Um, I'm hanging out with Juno and Timo and uh, Luther, and we're just kind of putting up flyers. Juno's doing her thing for a campaign. And, oh. uh, yeah. Okay, do you want to do anything? Uh, like what? What do you got in mind? I don't know. I'm just, uh, bored right now. Bored? Um, mm -hmm. alright, well... Uh, let me... Let me, uh, meet up with Juno and let her know that hey, I'm what's splitting up? off. Hello. Okay, you don't have to, you know, what's... Oh, nice no. What's that you want to do? Now. Oh, gosh. She okay? This is Tessa. Yeah, uh, she's a little nauseous. She's she's starving okay. a lot. She's yeah. Oh jeez. So. Well, feel better. Yeah. There was a guy selling food nearby. I don't know where he went off to. Is it the taco truck guy or hot dog? No, truck guy? I think it was Mr. Borby. Oh wait, is that? Yeah, I got this. Hey, okay. Do any of you guys have any extra food for my friend here on the ground? She's starving really badly. I do not. Anyway, um. Let me, let me see where Juno is, and I'll let her know that I'm kind of splitting off from the group. Okay, you don't have to as well. Um, if, if, if oh, you no, want I, to go do that, I can go totally fine. find something else. I, we're not really okay. doing anything. She's just hanging out, and I'm... She's putting up flyers, so I don't really have much else to do. Okay, dog. Okay, but yeah. Well, um, yeah, give me a call. Do you have a car? Uh, I have to... We have to get to my car. It's at Senior Buns. Senior Bun? Okay, I'll start running out Okay. Way. I know Fifi right. is working there right now too, if we wanted to do a shift together, but I don't know. Well, yeah, I'm not opposed to that. What? Yeah, I'm okay with anything. Okay. Alright, let me, uh, okay. let me see if I can get you, no. Okay, dog. Okay. Hey, I'll Goodbye. see you soon. Bye. Did you guys get food? Yeah, we got some fries. Okay, alright, yeah. good. Thank you, Tessa. You... Do you know how to do you know want how to help check to the bag? Uh, uh, 
I can't move, so. Um, can you flex? Oh, she's. Oh, yep. I think she's she did in it. the bed of shame. Yeah, I'm so tired, Tessa. Are you okay? Kind of. I've been awake for like 22 hours, 23. Oh, honey, you need rest. It's okay. I have to make it to this event. Which event? Two hours. Two hours. This is a birthday party. Oh, yeah. Gigi's planning it. Yeah. Hey, guys. You need help? <laughs> um, we're looking for a friend. Uh, Emmy? She kind of checked in at the front. I think. I don't know where she went. Out of what Kate says on these first awesome. four. Like I said, um, be careful on that leg. You know, it will cover fairly quickly. Uh oh. I'm still kind of throbbing though. He's making oh. me check it out. Yeah, Kate, do you me, know where your patient is? Yarn, that guy didn't. That, oh. that guy didn't get the cops yeah. calling him. He might try and kidnap you again. Yeah, let me fix that head of yours there. Yeah. It is, uh. There is some well, bruising on that. I'm head. sure Ray will find her and bring her in. Oh, she was still the oh there one. she is. Yeah. Hello. Okay, I can't wait. Oh. He's got a um alternative uh, way to the bed and place there in it. Hey Bjorn. Oh, um, all right. All right. And Oh, oh, there's okay. the tricks. Oh. 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 I'm not sure what's going Listen, I'm just going to take a quick nap, all right? Okay. You can throw her in a you, car. Uh, if you put her in a car as well, I, uh, I think. You can also carry her, and you should be able to. Carry? Yeah. Got to sneak out of here. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, gosh, I'm seeing. I think she needs to be put yeah, in a car. I'm sorry, this is interesting. Wait. Nope. What the? Guys, oh, oh, there, there we go. Do the trick. Does flexing your, your E muscle not work? No, I'm just. Oh god, it my credit go. value went up. Oh, Finally, Jesus. Better. Sorry about that. Hello. Hi, um, Tessa. Yes, I forgot to. Hi. So I a Hi. Um, you wouldn't want to go hunting, would you? No, I do not. I have no interest in that at all, whatsoever. Uh, okay, okay, never mind then. Uh, okay. why is someone else going hunting? Because if you want um, to, I don't want to disrupt that. No, no, you're 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 coming to hang out. I I want to I want to do that. It's, it's you know. Did someone else it ask time. you? Uh, it is a Papa Cheesy and a Steakman and Fanny and someone else. I did not know. Did everyone go? Okay, um, I see you here. All right. Okay. A phone's gonna get stuck, dude. Oh, man. It already is. You're always on the phone. Help me. Where's Juno? I don't know. She vanished. I have no idea where Juno went. She was with the uh, man <clears throat> who was here. And then they walked off. I'm about to clock in back in for a bit, alright? But nice seeing you guys. We'll hang yeah. out more later, okay? Oh. Take it easy. Good meeting you. Hey. Hey, where are you? Um, I just got a chat to Vito about uh, something. Um, the trial is soon I, I as well. wait for me. Uh, I will link up okay. again. Well, yeah. Luther just went to go f work his shift, and Lottie just invited me to go to Senior Buns to work with her. Okay, alright. So I good. think that's what I'm gonna do, and uh, maybe Timo can come with us. Okay, yeah, yeah, sounds good. I, I or maybe go to the court trial. case, if he wants to. Yeah. Okay, alright. Okay. Um, alright, can we post it in, in, in all yeah. that? Alright. Right. Love you. Bye, I love you too. Okay. I do need to go get food before I go there so I don't starve. Alright, well then, if you don't mind bringing me to Senior Buns, is this our car? Uh, will she need a ride or does she have a ride? Oh, sorry. 
Okay. Uh, she she's good. She doesn't need a ride. But yeah, you're welcome to uh, join us at Senior Buns, or you can go to the court case if you want. I'll go see the court case. I don't know if I'll stick around, because it's, it's not as important as, as the last one, but mm -hmm. I, st I still do want to see what happens. Yeah, keep me posted. I'm curious. I don't believe I have your number. If you could uh, slide it to me, I'll keep you posted. Hey, do I have your number? There you go. It's also in the yellow pages. Hold on, I'm making sure to uh, save it. You like, uh, what, what's his question? You like working at Senior Bunch? I don't mind it. I Honestly, I really don't like working in general. I don't like being stuck in the old grind, you know, but it oh, is yeah, what it uh, is. What I do for oh. work, yeah. Oh. Hi. You guys okay? Oh. You need a ride? Hi. Yeah, we need a ride. Oh, all right. Okay. Yeah. Just, uh, is he okay? Kidding, Adam. Where are you headed? Oh, we need to go to the, um, the rental spot. All right. Yippee! My name's Adam. Who are you guys? My name is Demo. Hi, Demo. I'm Tessa. Hi, Tessa. Hi, Tessa. Hi, it's Valdo. How you doing? Horrible. We killed a man today. Oh. I'm kidding, Tessa. Oh, well, I mean, I'm not a cop, so it doesn't really matter. No, you but you don't go body. around telling people you kill people. Come on. A lot of people do. You'd be surprised. What? Oh. Okay, Adam, let's go. I killed a man yeah. today. What? Right in his heart. Uh -huh. Yeah, he called me baby girl and I told him I'm a lesbian. What? Oh, okay, Wait, so that's he died from that? Then. Well, he died inside. Oh. His heart was broken. It I was think that's out. beautiful. I think people should love any person they want. He should have been like, nice. Thank cool. you. I'm, that's good. I don't see the problem there. Yeah. Look at the trash bag. Okay, well, you guys have a great day. You too. Well. Don't kill nobody else. I cannot promise that. Same. I don't mind work, because uh, what I do is, you know, I get to talk to a lot of people. Yeah, security work, I think, is, uh, you know, it's a good business to be in, especially right now. Oh, yes. It's might, it might not be very financially stable, and my drinking problem has uh, got some problems with my bank, but... Uh, it's, it's enough for me to live, you know? Yeah. Well, I'm going on five years sober, so I, I can kind of relate, but... Oh, yes, of course. Yes, my, my drinking is just... It's just a hobby. And do I get some food? Tomorrow. Yeah, I'm sure you can stop at any time. Yes, of course. I think I'm going to park this across the street so it doesn't get towed. Park it next to mine.
Daddy! Hi, Tessa! Okay, does Hello. Say if we can work, or do you want to do something else? Um, I'm open to anything, really. Doesn't okay, matter. Me too. Eh. Earlier, it wasn't too busy. Okay, yeah, let's try. In a couple of hours, I do want to go to that party. Yes, I, I got the... Okay. Uh oh. Uh, it seemed like there's Q. Yeah. Oh, but there's room to work. Hold on. Walked in, walked out. He came okay, let me try. Um, yeah, you tried too. But because there are people earlier in queue, yeah. if, if they are here, we sign up. Yeah, that's what that guy said. Look at him just standing out there behind Okay. Well, we should probably get dressed. Yes, yes. Um, yeah, we attacked him and he started crying. Let me, let me ask manager. He's just, look, at, look, 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 look. look at he, why won't he leave? Why won't he leave? Why is he hiding behind the bushes? I don't know, dog. He's chasing the fuck out of place. 246 in the window. Is manager around? Yo, you hungry, dog, or what? Okay, no, I'm good. Um, Did he use any uh, managers? What's his name? Okay, me and Tim don't work, but we see there is Q. Is and, but security, people can security, uh, clock in right now. Uh, I mean... Wait, why? I, I mean, if there's no managers around, I don't see it'd be a problem, right? Sure. If there's sure. fucking spitzes and if there's no Q. Okay. Um... Uh, do you know if people in Q are around? Okay. How do you see on the clock? I'm sorry. Are you gonna see, bro? Are you gonna see, bro? Okay, uh, we can change. Come on, come on. Okay, uh, back, uh, okay. back the yeah. Come on. I don't really know what's going on. Can we get change him back? Okay. Okay. change back here, you know? No? Okay. Oops. Oh. Hello. Hi. Oh, hi. Can um, we get changed back here? No, you can't. I mean, sure, if you want to, but we don't have a closet. Okay. Um, okay. Okay, thank you. Darn. Um, you know, I... You all bastard. Um, you know, I'll, I'll turn around, you know, if, if you try to get, get changed. No, I, I think I need to go to a clothing store, probably. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah, 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 that would make a lot of sense. <clears throat> well, that guy really likes me. Oh. Well, anyway, I got a car. Look at that. No, I, I, I just want to be clear, you know, if you want to go hunting at any point, that's okay with me. As long as it's happening humanely and, uh, you know, people aren't being wasteful, I don't have an issue, right? Okay, yes, I, um, honestly, uh, to me, this is like any other job. Um, yeah. I, uh, had to hunt a lot when I live in woods. Um, you know, so it is something I'm used to, but I also um, don't necessarily like to do it for no reason. If that yeah. makes sense. I think right now for me it's that uh, what I heard is that people are being very um, yucky about it. And I, I don't know if I want to see that right now. Uh, inhumanely doing things and overdoing things. Oh, uh, okay. Jesus! Like running things over with cars and then leaving the oh, carcasses oh, no. just everywhere. They 
it is not good, yes. So if there's something else you would rather do, like trash or anything, this is fine as well. I'll give it anything. Okay. Well, I think Fiona's over there, so let's go see yeah. if we can still clock in, and if not... Uh, you know, we can maybe grab her and, and do some sanitation or something. Okay. If you want. We really don't have to work. I, I'm just... I don't really yeah, have don't much else I got else. going on. Actually, okay, okay. Hold on, I can't really... Oh! Okay, so the other thing too, that uh, Gigi was talking to me about... Um... But do I talk to you more about this? I forgot. Um... But it was selling ice cream at a red party. Because I need oh. catering. And they said that we could do that. I just don't know if I'm prepared though, because you know, we would have to cook ice cream quite quick. And I don't have jangle or anything. What do you think? Well, I don't think we need a jingle. I think uh, you know we could we could probably manage. Okay, I also tell you now that I go with him too, though. So, um, I need to talk to him because I don't. He already has that, but I still say I am second. Date, so I don't know. I don't want to he has a date, but you're gonna be. Hey, that's his second? I don't know. Ah, uh, what I don't the know heck? I know, right? But uh, apparently it is all water under bridge. Yeah, that's what I heard yesterday. Mm -hmm. I think you'd gone to sleep, but uh, Tiny kind of told people yesterday oh, we, okay. we had a little meeting. Okay, he actually called me one second. Hello? Wow! Maria, congratulations! Machiavelli, thank you for Just the uh, gifted sub. Appreciate it. Wow. Oh, wow, that sounds intense. No, I actually... Okay. Um, well, okay, so a couple of things. First, I see Benji, um, at the senior bun, and he asked me about... Yes, he asked me about talking to you, right? And I said that you call, so I don't know yet, and he said, Yes, I'm sure he wanted to call. This is what, um... What does he say? He said, this is what the suspicious people do. Um, so it seems like maybe you are a trap. Um, also, he tell me that, um, I, I ask about what kind of chopping and I hit this car and he say, no, it is, it is, it is something on chopping block. And I don't know. Okay. Why? Oh dear, okay. Why, why, why does he need me to testify about this? Okay, I, I don't remember what question he asked me. So, so earlier today, he called me, right? He called me and he asked me a series of questions. No, 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 it is okay, I like him. Um, but, uh... He... Oh, what was the question? It was something like... Uh, something about bed? Um... Yes. Oh, how is it now? Is it more comfy? Yeah, sure! Okay. Mmm... Okay, so he asks. There is something about bad. Uh, what other question does he ask? He asks about you 
and he keeps saying, tell me the truth, right? Um, oh, they raise their person. But I always kind of tell the truth. Yes, exactly, exactly. Um, but the questions were very, um, insignificant. So I don't remember exactly what they were. I didn't... Okay, are you okay though if they kick you out of gang? Isn't that a big deal? Oh. Oh. So it is... Okay, it is you wanting to leave the gang. Do you wish to leave gang? So why would they be worried? Yes, I guess I would be stressed too if I, if you were to leave my gang. Yes. Well, no. But I was... Am I allowed to? I, I don't know if I can. Because I'm kind of with Italian pay Say a little bit. Oh! Oh! <coughs> Oh, okay, so this is complicated issue because, you know, um... I... Don't... Know how I feel about those things. Right? Uh, like, um... Okay, hold on, Tessa. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. It's okay. Oh. and talk to Fana and figure out what you want us to do and then I will do whatever. Oh, Judo's calling. Okay, perfect. Oh, no, no, no. Hello? Hey, are you... Do you have a moment to chat? Sure, what's up? Oh, I think something's wrong. Like, what do you mean so, with Vito or...? Yeah, my... Can I explain the situation? Can you tell me what you Okay. Think? Okay. Is that, is that fine with you? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Uh, I gave him like, um, like a TLD or everything that, that happened. Um, the Bobby stuff and then, uh, the Uno you know, stuff and some other stuff. And then I told him, so Jack Kettleman wants to meet with Max and I told him that Jack, uh, didn't contact me yesterday. Um, and uh, I convinced Max to have the meeting, even though he was hesitant at first. And then he asked if uh, Max is around, and I called him. And with Max, he's always very, like, upbeat and, and happy and stuff, so I just reciprocated that. Um, and, and then, um... And then I hung up, and it was like, and then it was like, was that Max? And I was like, yeah, he's like, oh, okay. And moved on to the next topic, and um, he dropped me off at City Hall for this court case. And then uh, he sort of just rushed me out of the car. He's just like, okay, bye bye. And then I got out. And then I was like, okay, stay safe. And he just sort of drove off. And then I called him, and I was like, is everything okay? Are we, are we good? He was like, yeah. Yep. Like, you know the way that I would react to stuff? When things aren't okay? Yeah. Like that. You think he's jealous? If it's jealousy, I would understand him not talking about it and reacting that way, but if it's something okay, else, bye. I straight up asked him if everything's yeah, yeah. okay. okay. And he said yes. So, it's nothing else I can do. But it's really fucked with my anxiety now. Yeah, I get okay. that. Oh, oh, can you can you give me a minute? Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah, that's. 
I mean... So if you don't think it's jealousy, what do you think it might be? Just a continuation of what we talked about yesterday? Uh, I don't know. I, I would hope not. I don't... He's not the type of person to... To... To not speak his mind if it comes to something personal. Especially the relationship. So I feel like... If he's suddenly shifted on that... Then there's a greater problem than just me receiving consequences. It's, uh... Our relationship too. Well, just fucking with my mind. You remember what I said yesterday about the consequences of what... He's doing to you. The anxiety, yeah. Well, not just your anxiety, but... He's... He's realizing, maybe, that... Pushing you away is pushing you towards someone else at the moment. For comfort, for... Friendliness, for... You know... How you're feeling right now. You're my comfort, Tessa. Yeah, but you just my displayed... You know, a, a different... Reaction... To Max. Right in front of him. Subconsciously. Yeah. But he sees that. And maybe it's making him think about things. And realize that maybe he's not right to be doing what he's doing. I just hope he doesn't think I'm doing this intentionally because I wasn't even aware of it until you just pointed it out. Yeah. Well. Maybe it's something you need to think about. I don't know if necessarily jealousy is what I'd call it, but... He needs to realize that he is pushing you away right now. And your reaction is to find comfort elsewhere, to find friendliness elsewhere. Because he's not that for you right now. I just hate that I feel guilty about this. You shouldn't. I feel guilty for just being myself right now. Well, you shouldn't. It's, it's his issue to figure out. And if that's what's going on, he needs to be communicative. He needs to talk to you like a boyfriend would. Not... Not a... Leader of the family. Because that's... His issue to solve. Yeah, I mean, But I if it's like something him. else, I mean, I, don't, I can't really say, but that's just what... I am assuming... It is, because that's what it sounds like it is, given what context I have. And the thing is, it's like I just told him that my life is basically in jeopardy. And that's how he ends our meetup. We just, alright, yep, bye bye. I think he was mocking me with a bye bye. Now that I think about it, because when I hung up on Max, uh, you know, my bye bye, that's what I do. Especially, like... Yeah, he's jealous. 100% he's jealous right now. It's up to you whether you want to talk to him about it. But... It's... The bet he made. I'll text him, I'll tell him that I love him. Okay. Reassure him a little bit, if that's the case. Uh, if he doesn't react, then... It is what it is. Yeah. Alright. Well... Um, I was having a good day until this. I'm sorry. I don't think he realizes the consequences of this consequence is fucking with my head so badly. And this is a prime example he of it. He should realize that. And maybe maybe what he just witnessed is is giving him a little bit of a wake up call. Because it should. And 
and I'm, I'm not trying to be harsh, but... No, I... I, I he he needs that. He really needs that right now, and... You know, I know you still love him and, and everything, and you want to make things work, but... I don't know. I just think he needs to figure out what he's doing with with the relationship here, because it's not good. He's also one of the most stubborn people that I know. Yeah? Well... Tesla, he's not gonna realize this unless someone tells him. You want me to tell him? No. Okay. So I was just opening a whole different can of worms that he doesn't need. You want me to check in on him? Yeah, I think I'll be good. I mean... I asked him about this whole Bobby thing, like... What now? He's like, don't worry, I'll handle it. But... Okay. I don't know, I was... I was hoping... That he'd maybe ask a few more questions than just... It's not every day that... The person he wants to eventually marry has their life on the line. Yeah. That was, um... I felt like a little bit of a knife to the heart. But I think you checking in on him would be good. Okay. I, I'll, I uh, appreciate I'll that. I'll give it a little bit so it doesn't seem like, you know, it's... Something we yeah, talked about, but... Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll check in in a little while. Are you going to the party later? Yeah, yeah, um, okay. and I are planning on going together, but, um... Alright, well, I need to get ready with Lottie, if it's okay. Um... Yeah, what time is it? Is it 9 Eastern? I wanna say 8, but it could be 9. I... You might check anything... with Gigi. Yeah, okay, I'll check with her. If anything okay. changes, do you wanna... You wanna be my plus one, even though you're probably someone else's plus one? I'm not anybody's plus one. Okay. But yeah, we could we could go together if he's busy or something. Okay. Okay. Well, I gotta go start planning. But um, yeah, uh, if you need yeah, anything, then... let me know. I will. Thank you. All right. And go Bye. Love you. Bye. Love you too. Bye. Sorry, Lottie. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Just, okay, though. you know. What? Girl talk. Everything okay? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, do you want to go check on Fiona? Yeah, sure. See if she's still there? Yeah. And then, um, I guess, I don't know when the party is. Do you know what time? In an hour and a half. Hour and a half, okay. So we got some stuff we gotta plan if we wanna do the ice creams. Oh, I forgot to ask him about the ice creams. Oh, you wanna oh. call him back? I'll go check on Fiona. Okay, okay. <laughs> because I have to make it perfect. Jerry, I'm checking Jerry. with everybody, and everybody oh. told me why. Hello. Hi. I don't know. Hey, that's 
Lisa. Yona. Hello. Me and the uh, me and Lottie might for a little bit, but we also were gonna start planning for the uh, thing later. And we were wondering if you wanted to come with us. Yeah, in an hour and a half. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be going. That's my daughter. Yeah. Yeah. There. Yeah. Look, I'll come with you guys. All right. Well, yeah, I, guess so. I think she's making a phone call, but let me go clock in. Yeah, yeah. Oh, excuse me, Sorry. Uh, go, go. I don't think we're... I don't think we're... There's too many. Buddy! So... And there's so many people clocked in, so we can't really work right now, but, um... If you want to, we can, like, get outfits planned out, we can get our, um... Ice creams stocked up. Maybe get some waters, too. And then figure out pricing. Yeah, 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 okay, yes, and we need to uh, okay. get, you know, start uh, making the ice cream. Yeah. Okay, dog. Okay. I'm Laura. Well, let me tell Fiona that that's what we're going to do. What? 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 I don't give a cat, man. Don't what the fuck? What? Uh, Alright. Okay. Um, Lottie and I are going to get going and do that now. So if you want to come, you're welcome. What is it you guys are going to do? Um, well, we're going to bring ice creams to the thing. So we have a lot of planning we got to do. Um, go start planning. I'm almost ready to clock out anyway, so I'll okay. give you a call in like probably like 10, 15 minutes. Alright. Okay. Yeah. It would sing, but now, now yeah, you like, like, yeah. like 20 yeah. minutes ago? Well, I yeah. remember too. Alright, Fiona's gonna catch up to us later. Onward. Onward! To make an ice cream! I don't know how to make gelato. You're gonna have to teach me. Yeah, it isn't too hard to make. Alright, so let's maybe... Do you want to get dressed first and then we go buy the yes, ingredients? Yes, we need to find ice cream outfit. Okay. Do you want to wear that to the party? Like ice cream outfits? Oh. Or do you want to look nice? Mm, I don't know because... Uh, uh, hmm. Hmm. We can make ice cream outfits, but we don't have to wear them today. Okay, good idea. Okay. Let's do that. Hello. Hello. Hey. Uh... Hi. Okay, we need to have like little and um... I like the shirts. I wonder if there's different Oh no, never mind. If we can find one that's just like pink and white or something. Uh I have like a good deal. I struggle with pink a little bit. But okay. I don't want you to worry about me, because I can make whatever work. Cause I have a white Shirt and a red, blue, black, and that's pretty much it. Okay, maybe white. But I also have, you know, some other stuff that I can work with. <clears throat> Not that.
This is about all my pink. I do have oh, this. Sauce. Yeah. And this. So that's pretty much all I've got. But I can make I can make anything work. I just need to, uh, you know, to know what you're going for. Okay, I was thinking like kind of milkmaidy, like you know the normal uh, when people scoop ice cream, you know like uh, teenagers at working at ice cream shop. <clears throat> hmm. So I do have this. Oh, that is. Oh, look at how the ice cream on this. That is <laughs> yeah. perfect. Okay, so like white, oh, pink, and blue. Okay, this is good, like a uniform. Okay, so pink, blue, white, okay, and yellow. Okay, this kind of color, okay. Or maybe we should wear dresses that is like, okay. That's cute. Yes, it kind of looks like yours. It's just showing a lot of skin, though. We are going to a party. Oh, yes. Well, I said I'd get ready with, uh, you know, a little bit, but I can look for stuff. I always take so long to get changed. Oh, yes, I guess so. If we were, if we were this at a party, it would make sense, though. These look very similar. I wonder if there's well, anything if we, with similar if we print. what we wear to party, shouldn't we wear like red? Since that is red party. Oh, is it a red party? Okay. Yes. The, that was a cute. That's this was candy at first. 
It does look like candy. I thought this was a little gumdrop. This is dye. I'm disappointed now. Okay, we need to change this to oh, red. There we go. I do have red shoes, but I kind of hate them. Well, that's kind of look like your dress, but uglier. Oh. Yours look a lot cuter. No, you look cute. <laughs> you couldn't even say that's a straight face. No, what do you mean? No, just because... I, I blush when I call a girl cute, you know? And I just... It's yeah. hard to do that. Oh, really? I think you're cute. I call you cute all the time. Oh, shucks. Mm -hmm. I'm spooky. Ooh. Oh my god, that's so scary. Uh... You should wear that. That is great. I actually really like that one. You look really cool. That's a cute one. No, I don't think I have red foot bracelets. They're pink. Plus, I think the necklace is better. Tessa? Mm hmm? I'm starting to feel a little rough. I don't know um, if I can commit to ice cream and doing um, no? catering and things. Oh, well, that's okay. We can just go to the party. Okay, okay. Yeah, I, I, I got no issue with that. Doesn't... Okay, I tell him so he doesn't have to... He doesn't look for it. That's no problem at all. Inventory. Yeah, I don't. It's like forcing them up into the.
lots of parties you wear dress, right? Or do you wear a um, skirt? Generally, you can wear a dress. You can wear a skirt and a nice top. Okie doke. Okay. To be honest, you could wear whatever you want, Lottie. It does not actually matter. I'm not very good at and I don't think anybody would judge you for what you're wearing. Because I guarantee you there's going to be some bozo showing up not dressed up at all. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, I don't want to do that. That's a bit embarrassing. Okay, 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 okay. That's I cute. Wear... Yeah, I can wear this top. Oh, wait, but if it's on red, I have to make sure it is red. Okay, yes. Yeah. Oh, I guess I'm supposed to wear deep red too. Okay. A oh, deep red? Yes. Oh. Is mine too bright? No, no, no. I think, uh, you know, just tell, tell me to wear deep red. Okay, but I think everyone else wear normal red. Oh, look at this. That's cute. Oh. Oh, that's perfect. Red. That's That's a perfect okay, okay. match. Okay, perfect. And if you want, you could even do like a black uh, bottom if you want. Oh yeah, okay, okay. That's me. Um... But that's that's only if you feel like it's too much red at once. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I think she clicks things in the menu a lot. She doesn't use the arrows to sift through things quickly. Which is what I would do. I... is this a lot of skin, though? No. Okay. You look wonderful. Oh, thank you. Okay, I need to find show. Mm-hmm. Right? You could probably wear some nice flats, or, um, if you want to wear heels, you can. Oh, no, I don't like heels very much. But I'm sure... Ooh, those are cute! Is there, like, a good matching one? Oh, I bet there is. That is okay. Just the, the black ones are good. This? Yeah. Okay, I don't know. They, they kind of have my... Pulls out. Okay, one second. Let me. That's make okay. Sure. Okay, this is good option. She needs to find the Rachel shoes. Those are the flats. Those are cute, too. Oh, I'm not a big fan of... Oh, these are so no. cute, though. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm not a fan of heels. They're so cute. They're so pretty. Okay, no. Wait, what are you seeing? What is wrong? Um... <laughs> You're not standing on your heels when you put those on. Oh! <laughs> so your foot looks like a banana. Oh, yeah, I've seen that before. That's pretty silly. <laughs> Honestly, if you want to wear Converse... I was kind of thinking that too. You can get away with it. Like this? Yeah, whatever you're more comfortable in. Okay, I think I'm more comfortable in this. Okay. <clears throat> and then I need to change my backpack. Hello? Hi, do you guys still need help? Or, uh, um, 
we I think we're nixing the uh, ice cream idea. So what we're at, doing right now is just getting our outfits together at the uh, clothing store. Oh, okay. So if you want to come by, we're uh, still here. We're at the one by the apartments. Okay. Okay. Maybe stop by. You have a car? I'm with Carlo. Okay. Yeah, you guys can come down. Okay. Okay. Be there soon. Goodbye. Bye. I don't know if my phone's scuffed. I, I'm not... I'm definitely not seeing... Numbers come through. Odd. Ooh, a cute little necklace. Yeah, I was thinking about that, but um, I don't know. Um, that one's cute. But is it too much though? I kind of like it without no. it, you know? Well, if you like it without, then you do it without. Okay, we do it without. I like wearing my necklace, because it just... I feel kind of bare without it. Oh, okay, yes. Uh, but... Does it um, mean something to you? Uh... Yeah, it's uh... I mean, I use it as an accessory these days, but it does have a meaning. It's the... Name tag of somebody that passed away. Oh. Yeah, hello? Hi, Tessa, you called. I got shot at the lumber mill by the local lumberjacks. They oh hate my me. god. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Well, oh. I was just calling to say hello, and I hope you're doing well, but I also wanted to hear about your LSD thing. Oh. Okay, yeah, um, I'm, well, <laughs> doing well is, I'll be honest, I've, I've hit a new low after everything, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah, new rock bottom. I, 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 I didn't Ziggy? think, yeah, it's, you know, I started, I've start. you know, I took up a, a potential stripping job again. It's, you know, I've, I've oh. been over the past, yeah, over the past month, I, I did a job for some, fucking psychopath named the sewer king and i waited waist high through human shit uh, um it's yeah it's been a it's, i've i've had a bad couple of weeks that's uh, that sounds terrible yeah it, it has well, been um yeah i was just kind of checking and i also uh i wanted to know uh mm -hmm. if you lottie do you want to step outside for a minute So, my friends and I are doing something. Are are you um trying to reapply for the PD and stuff? It's, it's funny. It's funny how you worded that. Uh, no, no, I'm not. You're not. You're just not interested, or? Uh, well, I'll I'll be honest, Tessa. You know, after after everything that you know, me, you, and Clarkson did, uh, go and going up to Beaver Bush and seeing everything, you know, boarded up and shut down. You know, I just, I don't hold any resentment or anything like that. I just, I just, you know, I don't know if I can bring myself to, you know, pick the badge back up. I still care about the work, but, you know. Yeah. Anyway. You know. Well, I tell you what, some of my mm -hmm. friends and I are planning, um, it's, it's me and Juno, really. We're, mm -hmm. we're planning to help our friends with some stuff, uh, in like an academy of sorts mm -hmm. coming up. And, you know, I'm, I'm sort of seeing who might be interested in coming along to help teach some people their rights for things. And, like, uh, kind of like, I don't want to say a criminal academy, but, like, just so right. people know what to say and what not to say and how to handle the cops and things like that. Mm -hmm. But okay, you'd be yeah. welcome to come uh, if you're available when we do it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'd, I'd if, love, I'd if love to help. If you're interested, I don't. If you don't want to come, that's fine. But no, no, I, I'm, I'm interested. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'd, I'd, I'd be up for it. When, when do you do? You guys have like a a day or anything you're thinking well, of doing it? We were thinking of doing it tomorrow at eight Eastern, but uh, mm -hmm. I think that protest is happening then, and I don't think that's a good 
Uh, time. Yeah. So yeah. we might be pushing it back maybe to next week. But Okay, fair enough. I was thinking of maybe inviting um, Bison and Jenny as well. Just so it's mm. not just me and Juno. Oh, but, Jenny, Jenny, Jenny would be up for it. I know yeah, that. I'm, sh I'm sure she would. But, yeah, yeah we had, um, you know, just a, a little incident. And it made me realize that none of the people that I'm hanging out with right now know how to protect themselves against officers trying to yeah. do things. And yeah. I kind of want to give them some pointers and, you know, teach them that they have rights and they should exercise yeah. them. Yeah, I, I agree. Hey, hey, Cleb, how you doing? Sorry, I was on a phone call. And like, not, even, not even not if they're doing crime or anything, it's just in general, mm -hmm. they should know that they can yeah. say no to a search, you know? Because some people are apparently under the impression that they can't, which mm -hmm. is... Mm -hmm. That's nutty to me. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, it's, it's kind of yeah. like a lawyery thing, but also we're, sure. we're going to teach it like it's a PD Academy almost. Okay, perfect. It's going to be okay, a univers yeah. university. We're going to do make them do laps if they act up. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's yeah. perfect. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to help. Cool. All right. All right. Well, uh, the, the whole LSD thing is it's a... It's a, you know, it's a phone book uh, directory where you can, you know, make sure if your phone gets stolen, you have all your, you know, contacts you can get back and stuff. But okay. Anyway. That's uh, what me and Mr. K have been doing. We've we've got the connected yeah. telemarketing stuff. Yeah, I know uh, Andy, uh, she said that she was, um, she had mentioned that she was working with them. I'm selling her phone books. You know, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cool. All right. Mm. Okay. All right. Well, it's good to see you. Yeah, if you're working with Kay, you don't need the fucking phone book, so you should be fine. Yeah, probably not. Yeah. But I was curious. Yeah. I wanted to see how you're doing as well. So I'm sorry you got uh got shot up. I hope you feel better. Yeah, that's me too. Fuck. Uh, okay. Right. Yeah, so you take it easy. Be safe. If you need you anything, too. you let me know. I'm. I'm. Oh, you I know, will. I'm. I'm around most most days. So. Okay. Well, I'll Bye. talk to you later, Ziggy. Take care. Bye. Bye. Where the heck are Fiona and Carlo? At the mall. Thought they'd be here by the time I finished that call. I would think so too. I hope they're okay. Well, they were coming from Senior Buns, so there's a 50-50 chance they've been stabbed. Oh, oh dear. Especially Carlo. Hello? Hey, Tessa. Hey, how you doing? I'm, I'm alright. How are you? I'm good. Good. Well, what are you up to? Uh, well, me and Lottie were getting ready for this party that Gigi's hosting. You and Lottie, okay, perfect, perfect. Uh, I was gonna ask, there's um, there's a job opportunity with this party right now, and it's totally okay if you say no. I just want to make that abundantly clear before I ask, okay? Okay. Um, they're looking for security, and I offered security a while ago to Gigi. So, you want to do security? There's pay involved and everything. If you want to do that, that, that there's a there's a spot. In fact, there's three spots. Um, I don't know if I want to. Okay. Okay. Perfect. All right, I, that's it. That's I appreciate it. you be... asking. I, I might say yes another time, but right now I, I think I kind of want to go with Lottie and we, we made matchy outfits, so. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. No problem. Okay. Just checking in on, on you if you wanted a spot. It's a yeah. one spot, yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, Are you doing okay otherwise? Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, why? All right. I'm just checking in. I don't know if anyone's checked on you. Well, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. So, yeah. yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. All right. Well, let me know if you need anything. Uh, I, I know you probably could use some security, but if you, listen, if you can't find anyone and you're lacking, just let me know and I'll, I'll change. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Appreciate okay. the uh, the offer, though, all right? And, um, all right. well, I'll see you at the party probably, so okay. I enjoy it. Bye. Right. It's okay. I'm gonna 
call Fiona and make sure she's alive. I ended up just going to another clothing store and I'm going to be here for three hours. Oh, oh I see. I don't know how to, I can't dress myself. <laughs> you want us to come back? <gasps> Um, we're at the one, uh... Fuck, where am I? I'm at the one next to the old burger shop. You know that one in the, yeah, like, the alley? Yeah, I know oh, where that yeah. is. Yeah, I'm at that one. Okay. Well, yeah. we might head over that All way right. then. Okay. See you soon. Okay. Goodbye. Bye. They went to a different store, I think. You wanna go with them? How you feeling? Uh, I'm okay. I'm still not feeling the best. Uh, hopefully I can make it. Well, it starts in one hour, so you've got time to kill. Did anyone tell you about the, um, academy thing? Uh, what's academy thing? I think you might have missed the meeting, so... Uh, we were gonna do it tomorrow, but I think because of this little protest happening tomorrow at the same exact time, uh... We might reschedule it. But, basically, we're... Me and Juno are gonna teach the, uh, the boys in the family their rights. Oh, how to, uh, idea. how to handle police when they're in that situation, and what they oh. should and shouldn't say. Okay. I think it'll be good for them. Yeah. I can't dress myself. This is a really good idea. I like the dress, Lottie. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. I just... I just can't not wear black. That's okay. Good. Red and black is good. Mm -hmm. I'd probably have, uh... Is this like... What? Is this like sexy red? Enough sexy yeah. red? Or do I need red shoes? Hmm... No, I think the sh black shoes are good. Okay. What if you did... a red necklace? Okay. Let's see. I have to make the choice between a necklace and having my nails did. Oh, oh. Well, maybe never mind then. Mm. I think you both look great. Thank you. Mean it. Yeah, you're matchy matchy. Just like me and Lottie. Sort yeah. of. My red's a little bright, but I can't help that. Yeah. Perfect. I guess this'll do. Yeah. I got one of those too. Oh my god. You what never kind of... know. That was fucking creepy as fuck. <laughs> so you didn't finish drinking this. Thanks. Oh. Nice. oh my gosh, Lottie. How many times have they were? Oh, no one's from the sewer. Oh yeah. Ew. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I guess we're good. Wait, Ryan just texted me. Oh. Is she going to the party? Ah, I just asked her. I don't know if anyone's interested, but Vito did say that they're looking for security. Yeah, he asked. <laughs> he did. I just wasn't sure if I wanted to, to be honest. 
Yeah, I wanted to look cute. Yeah. Where is it at? The party? Oh, that's a good question. <laughs> I good have library. no idea. Is that Liquid Library? Maybe. Either that or Tequila Law. Oh, it's not going to fit how many people are about to show up. It's a liquid library. Okay. I don't have a gift either. Well, do we need a gift? <gasps> we yeah. need to go buy a gift. We need to go buy a gift. Then you need to bring a date. Okay, Did okay. Do you have dates? Yes. <laughs> what? I mean, what uh, are you supposed to get as a gift? Who are your dates? Hey, Lottie, who's your date? Uh, well, it is you know. Oh. You know, also go with GG. Oh. Damn, you Jesus. Know. It's my, that's my son. Okay, and what about you, Tessa? Um, I don't have a date. And I didn't know that was a requirement. Well, maybe you can just come with us, too. Oh, yeah, on, you know what this. Watch, watch out, watch out. Back up, guys, back up. Pose for me, Tessa. Pose for me. Oh. What's this going on? He's definitely twatting it. What? <laughs> Wait. I got you. Oh, I my got God. You. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. I don't know about that one. Ah. Uh, well, well, it's happening. I, I mean, I can find somebody. It's just, I gotta look around. We got 55 minutes. Riley Shy say, I'm so lonely. <laughs> Three minutes ago. Carlo? Oh, God, no. <laughs> Carlo. What? We trap, we trap, we trap. I think, wait, I think, um, Rai is coming here. Yeah. Hey, are you coming, Raya? The clothing store across from Burger Shot? Which road? Uh, it's the clothing store right off of San Andreas Ave. I don't know which, what this one means. I guess. What do you mean? No. I don't know if I'm wearing too much black. No, you're fine. You look great. Great. I think you match Carlo really well. He's got a lot of black on, on his. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That clothing store sure. behind the bank. Well, I think it looks good that way. Oh, I said close to Burger Shot. Oh, no, no, no. I was, I was talking about the actual Burger Shot building. Uh, yeah, yeah. Back in the day, there used to be, yeah. Uh... The cousin's here. Get a lot of ice cream. Yeah, we gotta figure out a gift for her too, because we don't know. Yeah, we need to all get gift. Yeah, just come. Just come oh, here. We could get her a rock. Marty, this is your oh, cousin. Good idea. Okay. Hello. Hi. Oh, <coughs> hi Hello. Hi guys. Uh, hey, hey. Goodness, you wear you wear a cute hey. hi. So beautiful. Yeah. Hello, it's me. Hi, Hello. I'm I'm Raya. You're 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 beautiful. Oh no, you're beautiful. No, you're beautiful. No, you guys you're beautiful. Hold on. You guys are cousins. Let's... Wait, what? Ah. Oh. Wait, do you want what? to be tested? Cousins can call each other beautiful. W what do you mean? What do you mean? This is Lottie, your cousin. Hello. That, that's Tessa Hi. over there. She's your aunt. Yeah. Hello. Mm hmm. Oh, you're my aunt. 
Um, Hi, Ed. I maybe I don't know what. Yes. Who is what relation? Um, <laughs> sorry. Can I hug you guys? I can't believe I have a family. Oh, <laughs> come in here. All right, bring it in. Bring it in. Okay, come on. There we go. I can't believe I have a family. Oh God. Oh, come in here. Okay, hug. Come on. All right. So, are you guys going to the party? Uh, yeah, I need to dress up for it, but I don't know what to wear. Oh, are you two going together? Uh, we um, can. Oh, you can you go with Tessa. Bring a date. I need oh. to bring a date? <coughs> mm -hmm. I mean, sure. What? She no, that's no, Raya. A ride. Oh. Oh, you like oh. backpack too. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh, I always wear a backpack too. I keep all my things in there. Oh. You know, I should probably get changed. This is red, but... You know. Seems like they're getting along. Is it red? Sorry, one second. Oh, rise, rise, my kid. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I was very it's confused. Kid number four. Yeah, we cut it yeah. off. It's no more. Actually, five's the cutoff. Oh no, it's five the is the cutoff. I'll be honest yeah. though. The only two that actually feel like kids are Glorion and Raya. Oh, you know, I talk to you know a lot. That's fair. It calls me like every day now. That's fair. And Raymond hasn't met her, the rest of her family, so... Raya's the golden child, though. Okay, Raya's your golden child? That's okay, she, I have one of those, she, too. I don't know her who, enough who, yet. Who else is the golden child? Do you have children? Glorian lives in the sewers. Um, sort yeah. of. Who's your children? Hanathan. Hanathan? Yeah, Hanathan Yolo. Hanathan? Yeah, Hanathan? Yeah, he's my son. Oh. Yeah, he used to be Jonathan Brown, but, um, so, a Bobby Brown and I go way back, you see, and, uh, you know, he used to always call me his baby mama, and Jonathan and I, you know, the only logical thing we could think of, uh, because of that was, uh, that he just is my son, and then, so I, uh, have always just said he's my son. Please add that to my family tree. Yeah. Oh, you get spoke for this. Good, 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 good. Mm hmm. And I have some adopted sons, but I don't know if I'd qualify them as much as I do Jonathan. Um, but they do give me Mother's Day cards. It's my clown sons oh. and clown mom. How many kids do you have? Shatterbox and Bon Bon are the main ones. Yeah, it runs so. in the family, the adoption fucking problem. Yeah! Well, duh. Yeah, some, some adopt a lot of people, right? And that's just where but everyone I, is I don't, to I don't treat it like a legal thing. It's more so, you know, chosen family. Me neither. No, I am daughter. I don't care on legal or not legal. It is... It is this. No one does. Yeah, I don't. I don't really recognize anything else. I I call myself Clown Mom. Chatty and Bon Bon send me Mother's Day cards, and Honathan is my son. I'm not gonna have enough pages in my book for this. Oh, I got a, I got a new, I got a new picture. I got a new picture to spot out. That's a... What? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. What are you doing? <laughs> ah! ah! No! <laughs> Darla! Stop, please! <laughs> oh my 
my god. Oh god. Reclaiming. Cease. <laughs> oh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my hey, god. Up, winky face, love heart. I would never. Is that how you riz? No. <laughs> I have I don't I don't do that. Riz is not a thing in my vocabulary. Oh my god, can you not? Uh, Snites, thank you for the sub. <laughs> what? I should have included her number. That's a good point. <laughs> oh. I misread. <laughs> it's too fucking heavy to fucking try. <clears throat> Hello. Hello. Oh, God. oh my God, Carla. <laughs> What do you mean? <laughs> oh god, I appreciate it. Thank you. I'm I don't have any issue going alone. Not uh, really, you know, I'm just there to have fun. Oh my oh, god! I'm oh, right. so sorry I tripped ah, I'm so sorry ass. I tripped. I never wore high nice. heels before. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't think fine. I should be wearing high I'm heels. Okay. Um, yeah, don't wear high heels. Oh, thank you. Yeah, probably not high heels yet. Um. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to lay down a bit before the party. Um. So okay. I, I will uh, hopefully go to sleep uh, and wake up in time. Okay. 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 I'll see you in a second. Those look like flops. Well, 
I don't know what to. I don't know what to get it. I got people are still responding. <laughs> <laughs> Help me. Who is that? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm just gonna buy a SIM card just to spam that to people that think that a bug is a, a phone is a. Virus. Oh my god! Do not. <laughs> Just start texting every number of yellow pages that ass. Oh my god! <laughs> no. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, oh, if we want to collect Fiona. We can start driving around looking for like. Gift ideas. What if, what if I write our daughter a poem? I... Oh, please don't. What do you mean? Please don't. Um, she likes knives and money. What if I write a poem? <sighs> Are you good at writing poems? <clears throat> I, don't like, I don't like that. No, it better not be like my poem. I'm not gonna talk <laughs> about fucking, fucking my daughter. Yeah, what the that's hell? my son. Okay. Who's your son? Chatterbox. Oh, that's oh Chatterbox. God. Some Chatterbox's aunt. Uh, oh you God. don't. You don't need to consider oh. yourself that. I would. Okay. I would treat that as like a very minor thing. Um, the. I. Treat. I would say you can say you're an aunt to Honathan. Okay. Uh, just a quick heads up to Eugene kind of except just took me on as his daughter, so, uh... Oh, yeah. God. I can't. No. <laughs> yeah, he's my dad now. I oh, hate I gotta, that. I, I, gotta read. I, I gotta hate everything. I gotta read the poem I wrote for you. But you oh, know no. what? It works out perfectly because Raya is uh, Eugene's granddaughter. <laughs> Anyway, what? and then Eugene adopted that, me as his daughter, okay. and I adopted Raya already. So You've already yeah, made it a works re. Out. You've already made a family. No, it's re. perfect. No, it's perfect. It's a fucking shit show. How y'all doing? Hello. Good. How are you? Hello. Suffered. Well, do you guys want to go looking around for gift ideas? While Carlo reads me a poem. Do you want yeah. to read her our poem? Yeah, I'll read it there. Sure. Okay, we'll need to go get it. Um... I mean, you can write her a poem if you want. Um, I'm just gonna give her money, to be honest. Because when I asked Yuno, he said she really likes money. So I'll just give okay. her money. Yeah. Can you guys take me to the, um... I want to say it's the Mega Mall by the South Side. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. I think, I think Raya's coming with us. Oh, okay. My God, she, she really is my daughter. She takes forever in the clothing store. Mm-hmm. Well, I think it's, uh, you know, it's a good thing. She looks great. Oh, look at those two. They're getting ready. They're going. They know. They're going. Enjoy the party, Ari. Yeah, likewise. Thank you. He sounds so miserable. They're always so grouchy. Yeah. <laughs> the age thing. I think it is. They weren't that old. I look, look at him. Look at him. I mean... It's, it's not... I, it can't be that bad. I called him an old man the other day. Oh, God. <clears throat> hey! Look great! Hey! See y'all at the fucking shit-ass party. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's so grouchy, I don't know. Wait, Mr. K, look at Mr. K. Just... Oh, no. What happened? Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, oh no, he's bad. coming! With oh, me. Your... oh, let's go! Let's have to get him a date. Uh, hello, Mr. K. 
You want to say hey? What's going what's on? Up? Tessa, dipping your toes into the herp world or something? Uh, n- no, Taking I'm not. Taking adventures. I like to see oh, it. Oh, God. Okay, get out of your comfort zone. Oh, do it. Oh, Lord. Um, Live a little. I, listen, I just didn't have a plus one for the party, and it's all, and, uh... Oh, okay, okay. All right, well, I don't either, but I'm actually being paid to be someone's escort, so, uh... You know, money talks, money talks. I'm up for bid, though. I'm up for bid. Oh. Matter of fact, you just gave me an idea. Um, What's up, Ryan? A date auction? Hmm? I don't, I don't, uh, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, if you pay me $1,000, $1, I'll be your date. I don't have that much money, Mr. Wait, K. I if gave all my money. Dollars, I'll be your date. Yeah, you did. Okay. Mickey's paying me 500 bucks. Let me see if I can get a highest nice bidder. Oh, my goodness. What? I'm going to need right. money. I just bought a second investment property. What? Really? Yeah, we uh, pulled together my... investors, no, no, no. He's, and uh, we're going to turn it into a triplex and rent it out. Date. He's like, well, that's could be awesome. my grandpa's grandpa's great Yeah, we're good. We're going to see, uh, you know, lock this one in, and then we're going to try to do uh, a couple hey, more hey, deals. Hey, Maybe hey, if you have money in the future, nice. we'll get you another one of them. Make you some money. Okay. Yeah, well, you know I appreciate yes. that. Maybe, uh, maybe that can be your uh, little favor to me. When I said sing me yeah, we, we can do that. We can do that. She said, "Where you to sing?" I said, "Sing for okay. She said, "What is well, that?" Well, well, uh, we'll be in touch then. She said, what "Okay, is sounds good, Mr. K. I'll see you at the party." Um, All right, you have a good one. It's not, it's Goodbye. A cells is what it is. It's not oh, even a baby. Are you guys going to the party? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you guys look so good. Thank you. Thanks. So, am I old, or is she just not even a human? Did you get your date? No, he wanted me to pay him a thousand dollars to go with me. Damn. Uh, I'll, I'll do it for free. I oh. mean, oh. um. Oh. Yeah. Well, oh. Uh, aren't you going we... with her? No, uh, no, no. Nope. No, I, nope. I don't approve. Nope. I don't approve. Oh. I don't approve. Nope. Why? Nope. No, I wouldn't. No. I would never let him take my daughter on a date because she is like a, a literal two-year-old. <laughs> he would go to jail if he oh. did yeah. you know. Yeah, we got more of that. Oh, oh she's, no. my, she's probably got more money in her bank account than you. Hey, well, well, yeah, but in assets, hey, I'm looking pretty good. I'm just saying. Talking about that your, your glow name in is the dark, Tessa, right? You're talking about the highlighter yes. car you drive around. What do you mean highlighter? Okay, that is a hot <laughs> car. <laughs> it sticks out in the fucking. Yeah, because I wanted you, to. You, you know why? Because I want people you. to look at it. Me, I'm in the car. That's what I want people to know. <laughs> Uh, Cajun, right, thank right, you so much yeah. for the sub. I appreciate well, it. It works. Yeah. Yeah. The mission accomplished. Uh, Miss Tessa, I know. Into. Okay. All righty. Look, I, I, I am, I am a professional getaway driver at this point. All right. <laughs> Ask her, Raya. Did we get away from the police today? Yes or no? Well, it took us like two hours, but yeah. <laughs> literally, it took literally three minutes. The police, it took literally three minutes. I don't know. <clears throat> Look, <laughs> Mr. Sa, I, I don't know if you would what have me, but if you have nobody and you need somebody, I would be honored. Um, then sure. Really? If, if you, you uh, I, uh, sure. We can okay. we can go to the party okay. together. Yeah, that, that would that would be great. Yeah. Wow. Thank you. Uh, okay, all right, let's thank go. You. Come on, I mean, let's go. You're welcome. This is so awkward. Whatever. We got 30, let's go. We got okay, minutes. yeah, let's go. I need to go buy a rock. Um, a rock? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, 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 so, aren't you gonna ride for? with your date? Um, yeah. Yeah, I'll go ride with my date. What? What? Hey! Yep. What? What? Open the door for her, you, bro! You, you didn't what even you give me the doing? keys. Open. Oh. You didn't give oh. me the keys, okay? <laughs> oh, Jesus. You're, oh, my bad, my bad. Kind of embarrassing in front of your date. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is kind of embarrassing. Really embarrassing. Yeah, really really embarrassing in front of your yeah, date. It is pretty embarrassing for you to not give me the keys. Car? Really? You're supposed to have it. You're the one renting, uh, not me. You, uh, okay, I don't have keys. I I had keys. I. Well, I don't. Right, look, I don't look. Okay, listen, Mr. Delta, they fell into the gutter. Hold on. That's embarrassing. F Fiona, I'm so sorry. Could you drop us off at the apartments? Pretty <laughs> Shut yeah. up. <laughs> yeah, Thank get you. in the trunk. I'm sorry. Look, 
My car's not the Embarrassing. Shut up! Whatever. You like? Wait. Was that our? Was that? Was that not the car right there? We literally just. Um. Oh, this. Oh, wait. Wait. Yeah, wait. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm God. sorry. Yeah. I'm wait. Back? I think the other I'm one sorry. was my car. I don't remember. Oh. How did I get here? Guys. Where am I? I don't even. Guys. What year is it? I don't know anymore. <laughs> ah. Well, thank you for opening the door for me. Yeah, oh my sure goodness. Red Anarchy, thank you so much for the okay. hundred Alrighty. gifted. You are amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, would I was, like uh, I was contest that? yesterday. Like get... oh, what, that must what be happened? why I didn't realize. Oh, well, I got into a fight. Oh. At the fight club. Should I see the other guy, or...? Oh, he ran away before I could beat him. Oh, well then you are the winner. Yeah, I am the winner. The first fight I didn't win, but the second one I did. You know what? I, I give you props. Getting up after a loss is difficult. I got yesterday, I'm gonna so move in really here. I got you, don't worry. Um, oh my gosh, thank you so much, Red. may hurt you, and I would recommend <clears throat> you exit the vehicle for a, a moment. Only okay. Oh, thank you, appreciate it. <laughs> also, King, thank you for the 10 months. Welcome back, and... Uh, Madrid, thank you for the gifted, and Machiavelli as well. Thank you for the gifted. You guys are awesome. Rocco. I'm so grateful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. To maybe push this car out the way so I don't have to smack it. Yeah, that would be amazing. Because <laughs> Valet is a bitch. I'm gonna. God, this is not ideal. God, this is a mess. Oh. oh my god, wow, I can actually... God damn it, what the <laughs> fuck, motherfucker! Uh, Malta and Michelle, thank you for the Jesus thousand Christ. biddies as well. Oh man. That just got us over 2,000, which is insane. We haven't been there in so very long. You guys have been uh, showing me so much love lately, and I just get in I, I don't have words for it. Out. Come on, please, guys, please. This is a nice car. Yeah, thank you. Hi. Let them get their cream one out, and then we'll go after them, Jacob. All right, Jesus. Okay. What's our most subs? Oh All gosh, right, where I, did your I friends think. Go? Actually, I have no idea, but we don't have to follow them around. Let me oh. let me check to see if this is them. Hello? Hi, Tessa, sweetheart. It's Sunny. Hi, Sunny. I'm kind of um in a last-ditch effort here. Um, I typed in cop in the yellow pages, and you said, I'm not a cop. Which makes me think that maybe you have relations to some cops, if you have to pre specify um, that. Do you yeah. happen to have anybody's phone number? <clears throat> Specifically, I'm looking for Cornwoods. But um, I'll take anybody I at this don't, point. I don't have Cornwood's number, but I can get you somebody's number that maybe Yeah, has I've got it. Slacks. He don't answer, but that's because I think he might be in a court case. Okay. I'm going to call them. Do you think that they would, for a community event, possibly, um, there is a, a abandoned taco truck that's been sitting out there for months. Do you think that they would possibly help me commandeer it for a food truck um, for the, an event? I've made sure to that? check it that nobody owns it. Nobody comes by. That I don't know about. Um, I can send you a couple numbers and you can you can check in with them. See. Hi, darling. Okay. All right. Perfect. Thank right you back. so much. I appreciate you, darling. Okay. Yeah. Let me. Oh, do okay. That you can stand you. back here, sweetheart. Okay. Thank you so much, darling. You going to the party? No yeah, I am. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, I'm catering for it. So that'd be oh, real cool. fancy if I could have a food truck. Okay. But unfortunately, yeah, they're not for I sale yet. Okay. Thanks, sweetheart. Okay. Bye. -bye. Okay. All right. Ta-da.
Uh, Madrid, thank you for the gifted, and, uh, just JDM, thank you for the five gifted as well. Uh, someone asked what my, like, top subs were. I think we made it over 5,000 at one point, long, long, long time ago. Uh, back when, you know, my stream blew up and I was able to go full-time. Uh, and that's why we're able to have so many emotes on the channel. But, you know... Things happened, pandemic happened, uh, you know. Let me see. But it's great because it lets us have so many subs, or uh, not subs, but um, emotes in the channel for you guys. And I love my emotes so much. All right, I gotta get some gas and then we should be all good. All right. Whoa. I think we can stop by the um, the Mega Mall down here. Uh, of course we can. What you need? I don't know if it's still open, but I want to check something. You know what? I like the way you think. A friend of mine said that, uh, he got a rock from one of the hardware stores, and I don't know if this one's still open, but uh, I think the other one is maybe on the, the highway. Oh yeah, the one up north. I am dumb, I think I... Did I, I can it? never find this thing. I, I think it's... Is it not on the street, or...? Where is it? I must be dumb. Where, where is this thing? Um, maybe it's not here anymore. Is it not where Mosley's is now? Maybe? Oh, is it? I think it is because oh you know you might be right the, the grove street gas station used to be right next to it yeah you're right yeah because gosh i didn't even realize wait, no it, it, it was this i think i think this is where the hardware store was this complex oh yeah all right I'm, I'm well, pretty sure, because okay. I, you know, when I drove very legally through the alleyways, when there were lights flashing behind me, I remember it, the Grove Street yeah, you're gas right. station being there. All righty. Well, I mean, still have time, I think, if you want to go up north and get a rock. Is a rock a bad gift? I think from you... Anything would be appreciated. If you don't mind going up north, that would be good. I would love to. And it could be from both of us. Since you drove me. You know, sure, why not? Hi! Hello! Hey! What's up, y'all? Oh, not much, hey. just trying to get up north. By get chance, a rock. do you have Cornwood's number? Yes, I do. Miss Sunny's wanna... trying to get a hold of him. Can I... Can you I'll send it to, it to me? And, yeah, absolutely. Uh, are you on the yellow pages? I am. All right. My God, Tessa Lamb. That's me. Not a cop. Yeah, that's not the same. It's not the same anymore. I was Hello. with you. With you. Are they, you enjoying it? Yeah, it's been nice. Huh? I'm going to a party. I was invited. All my friends are giving me shit because I didn't go with this one girl, but I mean, it's no big, no big, you know? Oh. Uh, let me get you this cornwood. There you go. 
Did Thank you, you very that? much. Yeah, I did. All right. Have a good one, Tesla. Good seeing you. Thank okay, you. Hope you're doing well. You too. Hey, I'm not to be doing nothing to my car. You better not to be doing shit to my car. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, Mr. So should be detecting you like soon. Um, yeah. Great. That's a horse. Is that a car? Yeah, a dead person car. You want to do it anyway? He's dropped. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Bye, Miss Sunny. Bye bye. Sorry, were, were those trainers about to do something to you? Um, I don't know. They just drove up to the side of me and said, do it, do it, do it. But I don't think they would do anything because Gigi was in that car. So. Mm. Wow, there are so many police. This feels very strange. Having to drive the speed limit? I mean, look, normally I would not. <clears throat> I don't know how you would. Yep, no, that's fine. Right lane, left turn, got it. Um, I don't know how you operate, and I'm just trying to be respectful of what you may want. Oh, well, I really don't care that much. To what? Yeah! Well, in that case... My seatbelt is on. You wouldn't mind if, you know... There were some flashing lights behind us that we had to get away from, would you? Um... I mean... If that happens... I'm putting a mask on, but... I'll probably I comply with them because I don't really want to get a ticket right now, but... Well, good for you. You wouldn't get one anyways. Yeah. I am pretty recognizable, so I probably could get a warrant. You know, you definitely stand out. Yeah. In a good way. Oh, thank you. So, uh, random question. Mm hmm. You know that, uh, that tree we were talking about a long time ago? Yeah. Is that <laughs> like a, a non negotiable tree or. You living in um, the forest, or...? It's, it's a little bit non-negotiable. Uh, you know, I just, um... I don't think... It's gonna change anytime soon, and honestly, even if it was... Uh, you know, I'm... I'm married to... Myself right now. You know, I don't blame you. Men are disgusting. No, no, men are complex and beautiful creatures, but they're not really for me. And honestly, neither are women. Oh, I see. Right. That I cannot agree with. Oh, that is new. There's another bench up here. And the rock. <laughs> you know what? I'll, I'll get a repair. Why not? <laughs> Oh. 
Not really. I, I got her a barrel, you know? Who could be mad at a barrel? Actually, you know, that's probably a good thing to buy, but I don't think I should buy it now. Why don't you want to get it now? I'm going to get a second rock. <laughs> I need two rocks. Uh, is there a reason for the second rock? Because I want one. Alrighty, well. Hmm. Uh, Mr. Uh, how much uh, you carrying a lot on you right now? Not really. Alrighty. Why? Why? Well... Um... Why don't you take that in the glove? The, the ice cream is probably melted, but... You can... Use the barrel for whatever it is you've got going on. Oh. Well, thank you. I just didn't really, you know, I didn't want to have anyone steal it or anything if somebody decides to be, you know, dumb at the party. But thank you for the ice cream. Yeah. Oh. Did you want one of these? Oh, no, I just, they might be melted. Nah, they're fine. Alrighty. Well, consider it a, uh, a gift. I feel like when you go on a date you should probably bring something it's not flowers but it's a barrel so i could put flowers in the barrel you know what there you go really green flowers oh you know i think that's a good idea i love gardening You know, this is a very thoughtful yes. Thank you very much. Of course. But yeah, I'm um, I'm just I'm not really looking for anything right now, and even if I was, I I don't know what I would be looking for in that kind of thing, you know? You know, I can respect that. I've never really been that good at, um, dating and, and stuff, you know, I'm, I like to think I'm a nice person, but I don't know if I'm, um, I don't know, dateable, I guess. Wow, we have so much in common. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, no, nothing. Oh, uh, well, I'm sure you're just fine. You know, I'm starting to wonder about that. What? Ah, no, we, we don't have to talk about that. Okay. Well, let me call Raya and see where they are. Oh, she is on the phone. You see if Fiona is in the yellow pages. I can uh, call her. That would be good. Might be more fun to shop with everybody. And there's a lot of white stuff on the ground. What is that? Hey, Tessa. <laughs> what did you guys get up to? Um, we're just waiting in the car park. We're probably gonna head in soon. We're trying to find Raya a date. Oh, um, alright. Mm hmm. Well, I feel a little bad now. Oh. Okay. She wasn't well, going with him. Okay. In sealer date away. Okay, I, I hope I didn't. No, you're good. You're good. Okay. Well, <sighs> um, it's at the liquid oh, library. Mr. K. Right? Yeah, it's at the liquid library. Okay. We'll head over. Okay. Okay.
Okay, goodbye. Bye. Oh. I got any of a siren on. They're trying to find Raya a date, but they're at the car park at the Liquid Library. I mean, that should be very easy. You know, I, I feel like with voice like hers and voice like yours, it should be, you know, people lining up outside the door. Well, shucks. Banana Panda, thank you for the sub. Welcome. So here, or... Presumably? I, I think. Oh. Where are... Is that... No. Oh, this is where it is. Yeah. Oh, well, where are they? She said they're at the car park, so I assume... Oh. Oh. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Oh, I'm having a headache. All right, cool. That was a big crash, so I need to save that. Okay. Let me just get that put in real quick. Sit tight, chat. No, not that. Tessa picked up a Britishism from Juno and Fifi calling it a car park. Um, I mean, I don't really think that's too outlandish. I've said car park before. To me, they're kind of interchangeable. Car park, parking lot. Yeah, usually in America we say parking lot. Parking lot, or if it's uh, like a, a... One of the ones that are like stacked, like a building, uh, we call those parking garages. But that's one I think car park I've I've heard not just people from uh, Europe say.
You've had Americans act like you're an alien for calling it a car park? I think those people are uncultured. <laughs> it could be could be regional um uh, here's one that i was baffled by um how show of hands chat how many of you know what hush puppies are Now, I am from, originally from the state of Washington. I was, I was raised there until I was about eight, and then I moved to Missouri, which is in the Midwest. And I lived there for a long time, but then when I came back to Washington, uh... I discussed hush puppies with someone. And it was it was a bunch of my coworkers. I I worked in an office with like 12 other people. Not a single one of them knew what I was talking about when I said I liked hush puppies. They had no idea. And I was like, how how have you guys never heard of these? Because it was just it was so weird that Every single adult in the room had no idea what I was talking about. And I'm pretty sure at this point that it's not something that's available up here. And I didn't really know that. But yeah, there it's basically like a deep fried cornbread ball. And it's typically served with uh, seafood and, and butter. But they are delicious. And I, I just, it fascinated me that people didn't know what they were. <laughs> yes, it's food. I don't know why they're called hush puppies. I don't know. Oh, my head. I mean, look, you didn't want to be my data. You know the face of Jesus. Oh my god. Look, I get it, I get it. I would you never. It's fine. This looks like their car. They were here. Yeah, they may have had headaches too. Oh. They were here after you though. Do you want to give them a call maybe? Sure. Oh, the park is like now. Yeah, we'll probably just head over. Yeah. I feel like I'm asking to get told the parking right behind this guy. Yeah, you might be, but that's okay. Is that a car door? <laughs> it's his emotional support door, don't worry hey, about sir. it. 
Yeah, no worries. Hello. Yeah, do, do your thing. This is my emotional support rock. Oh, you got one? Oh, that's nice. Does it have a name? Um, I'm gonna call it Jeffrey. This is Dora from the Explorer. That's a nice <laughs> name. Thank you. Jeffrey, I choose you! Alright, I'll see you soon. Goodbye. What's okay, party all about? It is, I believe, Raymond's birthday. Raymond's birthday. Yeah. And I got a feeling a lot of us are gonna be quiet here real soon. Mm-hmm. Hey, what's up, Sal? Me. Hey, hey no, good to see that, you, Sal. That, that, that me. <clears throat> How you been? I'm good. Good to see you, Sal. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is not a good venue to pick, I think, for this. Having so many people in one enclosed space is probably not the best idea. It's gonna be fun. Have so much fun. What's up, Dingo? Come on, guys. Um, what the fuck is taking so hey, goddamn are. long, man? We were doing that place. fucking I getting cold. Do my jacket, darling? Are you okay? Okay. Shut the fuck. Is that ibuprofen? Yeah, you know what? I might, I might actually be able to. You think? Yeah, I'll wait. I won't go without you. You okay, Dad? I think so. Oh, you you look you great. To you too. Said again. <clears throat> oh, I don't think I stand a chance. Then. Hundred dollars. Uh, Hello. I don't think so. Hello. This is Life of Luxury <laughs> Casino. We currently have one spot available for blackjack. Please respond yes for a location or speak to an agent. Um, is no an option? Thank you for your input of no. Have a wonderful you. day. You too. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yes, yes, it's me. Yes, uh, I, I am here taking the cover charts. Yes. You like blackjack? I so, love uh, it. Sorry. The problem is, they invited me, but they try to get people to show up now. Yeah, it's not the best timing. Yeah, they, they didn't really take this through. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's fine enough. That's fine enough. Where's your day? Oh, right here. Tommy, uh, can you grab Vito? Oh, hi. Oh, this is hi Mari. There. Have you met Mari? Hi, hi Mari. I uh, met her in passing. Oh, well, I think she was in the car and they brought us from with her and or someone else. Did you, do you have a wasp? What are you looking for? Yeah, I do. I have one. Oh, uh, Somewhere. Uh, Sir. No problem. I only collected these. Oh, no, you did not collect the cards, and I saw oh, lots of people enter, man. 
Yo, oh, what? did I miss hand over the bag? I'm dyslexic. Uh, maybe it was food? Right. Um, hand over the bag. I put like a red dress on. I don't want to have it to fuck up, man. The thing is, well, I don't fuck. Hey, did you want to kill his hand over the fuck money over the bag? I'm fine, great conversation. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Please leave the restaurant. That's the problem. Yeah, go for it. I'll be here. You better save my spot. I will. I will. Go for it. Be back. Yeah, there you go. Uh, this is, this is GG. I think she only needs what? to put on like a red skirt. Can I, can I go back in? Uh, go red anything, isn't it? Like, yeah. yeah, she'll be fine. She's just running across the street. Oh, you weren't green? Yep. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Some people look really good, good and some people look bad. Give that coming through. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Yeah, 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 don't worry about it. Hmm. Damn, um, you you have that on lock. You figured it out. Oh my god. Oh, you were ready, ready. Must um, I was ready. Oh, but I just get. No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. You can go. Thank you. I think this is okay. Hello. Hey, Tessa. Hey. hey. It's just a group of us. How much? A hundred. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, let me see. I'll pay for you. Hey, I'm doing. Sorry, what was that? I'm doing my own thing. What? Hello, sorry, I'm at fucking yes. I'm doing work. 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 Uh, hey, Tommy, can you escort him inside to the ATM and just make sure he has some $100? Alright, alright. Follow me to come. Enjoy the party. Hey! Right here. Hey, Benji! Yeah, this is, uh, Juno has to run security now, and Vito is doing the same. They're no they don't get to spend time together. Oh! Go check oh, out the go. the music. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh god. That was big flick. Mm, remix. Hello. Oh my god. Oh my god. Next song is Dancing by Tony. You alright? Yes, yeah, lovely. I hear everything. Yeah. Clean up. That's that's fine. Yeah, she did. <laughs> Doing sign language now. Pretending yeah. like we're we're having a conversation. Are you performing? <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah.
Yeah, it's pretty. Do you guys feel like it's stuffy in here? I'm yeah. Trouble. Yeah. Well, who'd you guys vote for? The president. <laughs> I, for Thanks. one, am not a liberal. You know what's wrong? No. Abby? Abby? <laughs> this is just gonna turn into a bigger circle with more notepads as time goes on. Yeah, gonna be a dance. Thank you. Please, food over here. Hey, over here, man. Over here. Okay, I don't want to go on. I mean, I'm being a juice. I thought we'll see 
It's okay. It's okay. I can't believe it. Yeah, you got fucked up. Oh my God. I can't believe it. I do what I can. She tried to get me. Oh man. Definitely need one. She do me dirty right now. Oh, oh, sorry, oh, sorry. You looking good as shit. Oh my god, Naomi. Oh, Naomi. Oh, girl, I can't. I girl, you look good. I don't know. Oh, hey, girl. Yeah, look amazing now. Think about that. Listen, I have key face. Yeah. Your mom has key face. Oh my god, the audio is atrocious. Hey. Are you doing this to me? This is Sunny from uh, Senior Buns. Oh, hey. Oh, I just got some food. Thank you. Okay. Okay, sounds good. Appreciate oh, actually, it. Actually, Sunny, can I have a burger? Yeah. How much? Hey, darling. Uh, oh my god, thank you. Oh, I'm a little hungry. Oh, Mr. K live performance. Wait. Yeah. Hey, you're darling. Thank you. I want to talk. Hi, Tessa. You guys look beautiful. What's going on? Thank you. Um, I think I think I'm good for now. Okay. Anybody else need food? Um, Daphne yeah, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Because we we're the best and we make people mad. You make people mad. Yeah. <laughs> Nutcrackers destroy nuts. You don't make nuts. Yeah, we we made them not, and then we destroy them. Right, what about the nuggets? Oh, 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 I think there's like way too much going on. We should go in front of people. Okay, wait. Watch this. Yeah, me too. Oh, damn! Oh, oh, oh. Damn! Look how nice it is. Like, you know what? Watch this. Look at this. <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, Maxine, who's this? I need a drink. I need a drink. Oh, oh shit, is that Maxine? Oh, oh Maxine. Oh, we get to watch this, guys. Where is he? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. That, oh my god, that's a. That's oh god. Oh, Damn good. That's what the cops are Jenny. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I yeah. those were red parties. Those were red. Oh god, it's awful up here. Yo, Marco. Hey, uh, don't get covered to me. So many mumble. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh yeah. Here we go. Some of our best vodka yeah. as well for you, ladies, because you deserve it. Time to talk to, uh, right. talk to, uh, right. to uh, right. Gigi. Absolutely. Right. You could get five shots of vodka for right. you to grab. Look at this. She look at Oh, 
like that. It's cute. Thank you. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. For more soul. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Yeah. Hell yeah. Oh. Yes. Hell yeah. Woo. One second, I'm performing. Hell yeah. It's you. great. <laughs> wow. And many more. Thank you. Okay. Yes. Hell Everybody, yeah. Everybody, happy birthday, Redman. Happy birthday. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <sighs> How did I sound, girls? That was amazing. amazing. Good job. I mean, Thank I you. you. I was really so good. nervous. Are you an old fashioned, oh, please. Oh, yeah. oh, girl, that was I didn't say anything, but they, they exclusively asked me to sing Happy Birthday. They told me that. Can you Thank still you up there? there? I don't Thank think you. anyone asked you that. Oh. 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 oh, no. Who's in charge? Um, GG. This is a clumsy punch. Hello there! Ladies and gentlemen, uh, can we everyone to move in the library room? Oh, here we go. Oh, the performances here we go. will be starting soon. Thank you! And a single file! Please don't hurt each other. Lasagna, yars, lasagna. Oh my god. Brett, you look so different. My goodness. Where's, where's, um, where's Amara? Where's Amara? Where'd she go? Amara? I wonder if her mouth is going up. I'm staying, you know. I'm gonna be a fucking bubble. It was very, very Thank you. Yeah, where's Kiento? Surprisingly, when I thought I had to I'm so sorry. I didn't know. What? Hello. 
Hey, Tessa, I can't hear your friend here, sadly. We're, the music we're, trying, <laughs> we're trying to keep our voices down, so we're using Why? mo pads to chat. Yeah. Hey, party girl's drunk, guys. You guys did a good I job. Uh, I would probably say it's probably going to start after, like, the main stuff. You know what I mean? Okay. Uh, but it, it'll be soon. I, I do know that. I, I think they're trying to give it so that the, they can perform <laughs> yeah, a little, just, you know, just, and then right and then now, you guys can come to you. Case, man. Yeah. <laughs> if you guys like, I can let you in and you can see the, the room where you guys sit. If you guys want to pick out some seats for yourself that you're interested in, there's a lot of table, a lot of table space. Um, yeah, we can. Alright, come on in, come on in. <clears throat> Now you want to make money, huh? Okay, okay. So this is, wow. this is what we'll be working on. Right now, we do some death uh, I'm doing security so that way you guys aren't, you know, welcome, losing welcome. your money or anything yeah. when you guys are in here. But yeah, uh, it's just going to be death roll. And yeah, and as much as you bet is what he was saying. Okay. Um, yeah. Is it all right if I'm in here and not sitting at the table? Uh, I think I just hang out with him, I think that'd be fine, you know, as long I'll, as... I'll be quiet and stuff, I'm not gonna be disruptive. I, I know you'll be Tessa, you know. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna watch performance and stuff first. Before we yeah, start. no, they were just asking some questions. Actually, you should yeah. probably talk to Marlo to hammer out the more detailed ones, if you guys have any. Um, yeah, you got questions? I mean, I don't really have any questions. I was just wondering if it was okay if I came with, uh, Jay? Yeah, yeah you just wanna watch. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna right. start after some of the performances. Yeah. Alright. Nice. Come on, Jay, we're starting after the performances. Come on. That you, you know? Yeah, yeah. Hi. I'm, I'm wearing my dodgeball outfit. What do you think? Yeah, you look good. Oh, hey, how's it going? I heard there are some death <coughs> roulette. I'm gonna go watch people lose their money. Yep. Oh, well, you'll find out. Hey, you know, I agree. No, eat. eat at a drink would be great. If you have anything. I've noticed water? that these yeah, kinds of events, so the music always tends to be way too loud. There, it's always too loud at parties. Like yeah. they don't want to talk to people. Maybe it's some kind of brainwash. Thank you so much, Sunny. You're welcome, sweetheart. You guys have fun, okay? Be safe. Well, you want to go dance? It looks like everybody's dancing. Yeah, sure. Let's go. It's not fun. Oh my own. Some dedicated. Yeah. You put on your own. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Up. If you got a drink, go ahead and chug it right now before this one, okay? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yo, yes, I'm just shut up my mind up here. Can we talk? That'd be great, man. Sir. Somewhere what? that's quiet. Hey. Is you you to <laughs> we'll sit in silence in Let's the dance. dark. Hey, hey, yeah. Yeah. That I need you here with me. So I called you. Hey. We're just getting like pushed into each other. This bunch of dorks right here. Are we great? Oh my God, pop off! <laughs> uh, Taco yeah. Vendor, thank you for the 30 months, by the way. And Kyle Lion, thank you for the 17 months as well. And listen, yeah. for this next one, I hope you can all hear me when I say this. I'm going to need everybody, I'll need everybody to lap dance three, okay? <gasps> okay. Okay. Oh, shit. I'm, okay, I'm going to do one All right, better okay. see you dance, Wait, though. Okay, okay yeah, everybody lap dance three to this shit. So I better see you dance, though. <laughs> he says everyone has to do it. I'm not going
excited, but there's no point in disguising now. So why be quiet? It's time that we just went down and out. It's fine. Told you I want you when, why and how? Cause I'm looking for you like I'm trying to find a vowel. How about the whip and the camera snapping? I'm blinded by flashes. Designer up on me with you on my body? Like it's a new fashion. Oh, I can imagine a private life, anything but that. And honestly, I'm past it. If they want to show, let's make it dramatic. Should be grateful, I'll give them something to talk about. Must be so entertaining, can't keep my name out. Uh, keep it a stack, this is the hard for me to swallow. We move, walking around them cameras, put that on the follow. I ain't that bitch in all red, yeah, I'm who they follow. Baby, don't lose your head like this, some sleepy hollow. We birds of a feather, hearts don't skip a beat. This love was a stun lock, shock, stop, no EKG. This is sorry, we're taking to the tomb. Cameras flashing like dynamite, tick, 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 boom. Amazing. Not in Thank time. you wow. so much, everybody. Wow. My name I is have Dudley. Your face oh, can... Thank you so much, Ray, for letting me play tonight. Remember, your everybody, tell tonight. Ray Mond happy birthday and give her all your money, okay? Love you guys. Well, yeah. Woo. Hell yeah! Let's say a round of applause! That was beautiful! Wow. Beautiful! Now, let's get the next performer coming up here. Just want to say, this is sponsored by Connect Technologies, where we connect you to the world. Don't forget, happy birthday, Raymond, and we hey, can clone your sims right now. All right, let's get the next performers coming up. Who's the next performer? All right. The icon herself. Lizania. Yeah. 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 Welcome. I just want to say happy yeah. birthday, Raymond. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. Fucking, you are so beautiful, girl. You look so gorgeous tonight in that dress. Everyone, just make some noise for how good the fuck she looks right now. The fuck? Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Well, you know what my favorite thing about that dress is, girl? It looks expensive. Oh, my God. Um, sorry, I meant to say happy birthday, enjoy the rock, oh, thank you. and um, I, I love rocks. you can throw it at someone's head if they bother you today. Okay, thank you so much. Enjoy. I didn't realize I was muted. <laughs> Period, bro. Me and April spend the money. 
money to the pockets empty. No, I came here to collect. So for me to check. VVS is on my neck. Don't want nothing less. You're missing the music. Just to have a chat. Sugar baby represent. What even is this? She said April's not here. Aw. Tonight, I got two more songs for you guys, and this one is because right now we're having a motherfucking ball. Okay, okay, okay. You better cunt, 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 mother. Got a big account, and now you talk about murder, my big account. Real fact, in a birthday, birth, you can just say, mother, no drama. What you talking about? How you ain't saying nothing. audio please This last song is very special. Hey. I want to dedicate this song to someone out there in the crowd tonight that is very special to me. Oh. Aquarius Johnson, Big D, my boyfriend. Every <laughs> time I see you, what? it's hey, falling in love D. all over again. It's a vicious cycle. <gasps> yeah. I love this song. <laughs> Psycho. We can't stop it now. We can't stop it now. We can't, 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 can't stop it now. 
Former headed up. How's everyone doing? Hell yeah! Happy birthday <laughs> to Raymond. This this bash is going Woo! crazy. Now, without further ado, after five long hard years, the industry was missing something, and now they're right, back. Yeah. Introducing the Ben Mos. Santa. I'm Shannon Gucci, and this is Naomi Scott, and we have Brittany Hendricks and Amara Bellavo down below. I just want to invite everyone in the library who isn't around the circle. We invite you to come. We have choreographed a beautiful dance routine for everybody, and we are just so grateful to be here after five long years. Stay bimbalicious and hot and sexy. And happy birthday, Raymond. Are you gonna mistake her? Don't drink enough. You could. I'm a good boy. Hey, You can mistake her for a mom. What if he was sticking oh, tomorrow? You gotta sync up, Liam. You gotta sync up. What are we events? You pick, we gotta sync up. We have, we have, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the Bimbos Sex Drive. Yes! Sex drive, gotta need to feel alive. Do it on the bed and on the floor. Begging for more and more. Got a high sex drive, gotta need to feel alive. Do it on the bed and on the floor. Begging for more and more. Did the paparazzi get a pick when you came? All the magazine covers will be the same. With the shock and titles, the public so entitled. Baby, trust, I don't care, you're mine and I don't care I look to my front door, walk right in Fuck me in my bedroom, or my kitchen For scandalous celebrities, with a lot of chemistry What could go wrong, let's go and fuck to our song. Got a high sex drive, got a need to feel alive Do it on the bed and on the floor Show 
know a girl about bandos. I got cars and trunks full of bankrolls. She wanna ride, bare back. If she's gonna do it, I must be banjo. Speaking of sex life, man, put legs in the air like doors of the ammo. Fuck in a bedroom or in the bathroom. Switch scenery like Mando. We could do kitchen, stirring, mixing, loud as fuck, no whispering. No time for the movies and no spooning. Just get straight to the whisking. We ain't gotta make it a big thing, but if you put your lips here, it's a big thing. Slop and slurp it, work it. You won't find these jobs here on LinkedIn. Oh my god. Sex drive, gotta need to feel alive. Do it on the bed and on the floor. Yeah, I love the choreography. I love that they do that all in sync. I want to know what dance uh, Penny's doing right now. We are now on to our next song, Stuck on Repeat. Vintage, thank you for the six months. I appreciate it. Sup, little D? Hi. Hey. All right. Okay. Oh, I can I can breathe a little bit. For you too. Oh. <laughs> hmm? I can breathe. Yeah. It's so, fun though. Yeah. It does to you. Gamble. Uh, I've never really been much of a gambler. But, you know, I'm... I'm willing to put a little money down, but not a lot. Really only I, I have what I got on me. Which is seventy five dollars, well, and I doubt that is enough. You. Oh my goodness! Okay. Are you sure? I wouldn't have given it to you if I wasn't. Well, uh, thank you. Hey, I'll go on. I'm just trying to get people up here right now. Go for it. Oh, 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 how do you want to do this so we don't overwhelm you or confuse you? Um. Wait, what do you mean? Well, like you talking you about know, like, I, like the money and stuff? Yeah, because we're gonna be giving you money. It's gonna be different. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll open a circle and I'll just I'm gonna write it down. Alrighty. The whole point is kind of like blind betting, so other people don't know how much you're putting in. You know what I mean? All right. Yep. No worries. Okay. Just don't not fuck you up. No, no, we should be as long as people ain't just running up to me throwing money. You know what I mean? 
heard that many people already left. If you want to go to the video, we can do that. <laughs> yeah, those days behind me. Yo, yo. Fucking bug, bro. Bug's death. Oh, shit! What? Oh, oh my god! Oh, shit. That motherfucker oh, just got sliced like a piece of shit. Oh, god. Wait, why'd they, why'd they fuck this guy up? What happened? Uh, it looks like, that, like, his like thing. Bobby. Know, he, he a knife like he, or something. He's into that or what? Is that Eve? Why did Eve just... You coming or what? I don't know what you're talking about. The, the, yep. Never. I don't know what he's yeah. talking about either. Yeah, never mind. Sorry, who are you? Um. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's my sister. That's my old roomie. Oh. Yeah, a long time ago we bought a house together up in Polito. Probably like. Eight years ago, I think. He was driving a car earlier while I was doing sanitation and he purposefully rammed into me and broke my leg. Oh. Hey, I mean, you know, we can go. Oh. Completely understandable, uh, but uh, a lot of people just saw that. Just FYI. I don't think it's going to be a problem, but... I mean, I'm not going to say nothing. I'm pretty sure our old groupie agreement is still intact. Hey, look, as far as I'm concerned, Eve, there's nothing in the fridge. You saw nothing, I saw nothing. So anyway, uh, death roll, right? Yeah. Gambling too? Yeah, I think so. Is your leg okay? Lottie gave me a splint earlier. And then okay. I went to rest it for like a few hours. Is she still around? No, she said she wasn't feeling well, so she um, took a nap. Okay, I wasn't sure she woke back up. No, she, she said maybe later, but uh, she really wasn't feeling well. Okay. Alright. I'll just get that, that back. Okay. Okay. What's, what's that? Give it back. The knife. They have an amazing gift for you. Uh, out here, who's uh, who's gambling? Are they all? Uh, I will, and I think Jay will. Yeah, the other guy okay. Okay. You, you gambling? No, not right. No, got you. All right, so we got you three, four. Hey, let's make a circle. If you gamble, so start making like a circle. If you, if you gamble. Alrighty. All right. How can uh, make a circle here if you gamble? <laughs> what is that? Oh yeah, no, no, sorry, I was talking to Pigeon. Apologize. to see it. Where's uh, where's <laughs> you know? Get them in. Oh. <laughs> Okay. There's line of vision. Bye. <laughs> you see how quick Luciano went over there? Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you about to need that cane for a real reason. Uh huh. I watched that guy. 
somebody already. I think he's already in prime mood. You watched him what? He stabbed somebody at the gas station. He's already ready to go. Yeah, which, I think everybody saw that. Yeah. Oh, the, the Italian guy. Oh, uh, if you don't mind, just don't go spreading that around. I don't need spreading to spread around. it. I already saw it. Okay. What if we hadn't yeah. seen it? All right. Well, you're not cops. I realize that, but you don't know who you're talking to. Okay. You never know who's listening. Yep. Illuminati. Understood, though. Or worse. I just, you know. Just be careful. Happy that. Okay, well, uh, Circle has been destroyed. Yeah, I think hey, we forgot to do I've heard green pie too many times in my life. I'm ready to yeah. not hear it again. <laughs> it's so gross. Great, great song, but, uh, you know. It's a little too explicit for me. I don't know. It's, a, it's meant for Raymond from uh, Auto-Tune, specially delivered or something like that, is what oh. the announcer said, since he couldn't make oh. it. Tomorrow, $1,000. You're all mine, Luciana. Uh, is this for the uh the the gambling uh gambling oh yeah thing? we're supposed to be making a circle but so far it's just like a little line exactly where, where the congo lines work where the fuck is fucking marlo where the fuck is he hiding what is anything we're doing are we betting a certain amount and then doing this roll or you'll explain it have you ever done a death roll before? Oh, yeah, I have. That's pretty I simple. I didn't know if we were just all going to throw it in the pot like an entry fee. I don't know. Now cook me some dinner. This is arms are so messed up on this model. With the dress. They're like... Weird. If you're looking to make some big money today, put your money where your mouth is. Right, coming down to the library and get again. Hey, did you steal uh, one of your uh, Tim Cole? Oh, fuck, we lost people. My bad, homie. Yeah, you took too long. Alright, oh, let's, let's get everyone in the circle. You let's do? Get in the circle. Uh, let's, let's we'll get, get everybody in the circle. Do you have time if I reach out to him if he's available? Alright, last, 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 I'm hopping the circle. Alright, give me one second. I'm trying to reach out What's to him. What's up, Ellie? Uh, yeah? So let's make a circle, y'all. I know y'all probably in kindergarten at some point. Y'all know what a circle is. I'm a line. Well, guys, just perform a circle, guys. Stop ending. Hey, Benji, you gambling or what? You uh, helping uh, set it up. Ali, your pop is showing. Come on. <laughs> Oh my god, this is not Thank a good day. So you're welcome, Ellie. You're, you're welcome. Is that your daughter, Benji? Alright, everybody, we're getting the death rolls ready. Hey, Benji, Wenji, you wanna, you oh, wanna loan a couple thousand dollars? Uh, my head, my head, I got a fucking headache, bro. No, come on, Benji, Wenji, you good for the money. I got a fucking headache. Yeah, you both have the money. You gonna be okay, Benji? Okay, now I'm now I'm the celibacy again. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> you actually can't stop anything that happened there. Good job. <laughs> hey, Thank you very much. Look, man. Think with the other. Good gang. This is a rolling go, bro. Let's get a rolling go, Marlo. Let's go. All right, uh, let's do a circle. Circle. I believe in you. You. you Everybody, go, circle you up. Circle up. Circle you up. Game, Benji. Got it. All right. Yeah, I'll do a game. I'll do a game. I'll do a game. All right, get in there. All right, it's gonna work. Um, you can bet anywhere from a hundred dollars to a thousand dollars each round. Uh, we're gonna be doing a death roll roulette. So actually, we'll start off with Ben. Uh, he's gonna start off with a roll of a hundred once we get started. 
Um, whatever number it goes to, let's say he rolls a, a 26, and they show not how that one goes, the next person would then roll uh, a 26 and see what they get, so on and so forth. Once you get to one, you out of the round. You're just going to step back from the round, and then we're going to go until one person's left. <clears throat> uh, I'm going to come by one by one. You're just going to hand me the amount that you want to bet. Again, $100 increments or 100 to 1,000. Um, whatever you bet, whatever percentage you bet, uh, again, each $100 is 10%. Uh, that's the amount you were going to win in the pot if you were the last person standing. For instance, if the pot gets up 1,000, you bet 500, you'll get half the pot. You'll get $5,000. Make sense, everybody? Yeah. All right. All right. I will start with 500. 500 right there. Okay. So you guys tell me your bets. If you want to keep it anonymous, it's fine. Hello. Give me two cents. Thank you. I get the right amount of money. Oh, uh, uh, oh, uh, you need a hundred for sure. Yeah, at least that's the minimum. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Give me a dollar. Uh, it's fine. You can pay. That's my money anyway. Yes, yes. Thank you, Ben. Just, here you go, Marlo. All right. Last place, what? Alright. No, you have the best odds because it doesn't even need to reach you. Yeah. Oh, I just. Hello? Alright. <laughs> Here. Yeah, just hand it over to me. Five rounds at 100 each. Down. Yeah, maybe. There you go. I don't know how long we're going to do this, but. Uh, we're going to start off with Benji, starting off at 100. So once it gets to one, somebody's going to be out. Then there you we're going to start at 100. Oh. <laughs> right. wow. What um, the heck? We're going to roll of 99. That's what you call small roll. That's what you call small roll. Is my turn? Uh, if yeah. you uh, here, just wait. So roll, 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 one, nine, like, roll one, not nine side dice. He, he just said do a... Okay, Mr. Did, did, did it work? Oh. No, it didn't. Got this. She got this. Oh, I believe in you. Hey! There, there you go! go. Alright. Oh, did you lose? Oof. No, no you we get it right too. If you got one, then you lost. Okay, okay. Oh like, my god. Like how JK is about to lose here. Watch. I'm about to get fucked. Oh, oh god. Oh wow. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, GG. Oh, bro. Okay. Oh, okay. oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, that's not good for us. Oh, that's not good for us. Here we go. <laughs> oh, 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 it's not good for us. No. Kill it. Oh, 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 these oh, dice. Oh, I'm not hearing these dice rolling around on the. Oh. Oh. Is that a dice troll or? Hey, uh, Ben, yeah. you see you tomorrow. Thank you. Hey, baby. <laughs> that is hey, Benji that started is off with 100 again. Imagine. You jinxed yourself Crazy. asking if that was the words. I got it, I got it right here. Just no, no, that's six, fun. 86. That's um, fun. <laughs> you got me scam. No, it's not. It could have ended it's anywhere. Not. You just unlucky as hell. Oh, oh, no. oh, oh, no. oh, 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 the cage is set. Do you want no, to start back at 100? Uh, oh, we can move to the cage after this. Yeah, we'll Boom. move to the cage after this one. Okay, bet. Ooh. All right. Cut oh, in half. 
These right. deep cuts, deep fucking cuts. Oh no. Oh, oh again, 12. You're like 12, huh? Oh, this is rough, bro. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, no way. Oh, no. It's gonna be three to you, Ellie. Oh, oh, no. All right. Oh, uh, you guys don't go anywhere. We're gonna do another one downstairs in the cage, okay? Okay. Yeah, we okay. Have to do it more. Uh, All right, it's back to a hundred. Hundred, Yeah. Okay. Okay. Even a height. Safe, safe. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's not good. Oh, the north that's a fight. demon, bro. Oh my god. That's a demon. Oh, demon right go. there. Oh, God damn. Oh, Somehow we gonna get back to 12 again for Luciana. What the fuck? Oh no. Shit. Okay, come on. Come on, come on. Oh. Oh. Get out of here. Oh, that was rigged. So rigged. Oh, oh, oh wow. I still have that. Oh my, right. that was great. Ooh, cutting in half. Oh, I, oh. I shouldn't have that either. Oh, Thank shit. You, that, that, well, you know you want to. 12, baby. Oh, or not. Okay. Strong rolls from Lucy. Here, wait. I have an hey, idea. Hey, hey, uh, oh. Yeah. oh, oh, Jay. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Hey, oh, wait. damn. Okay. Uh, God, damn, Jay. God damn, Jay. All right. All right. right. Bro, what oh, is this guy? Bro, this guy in white, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> that is, by the way. Wow. Some crazy rolls. Oh, 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 oh my god! Oh my god! Tessa like the best fucking. Come on, Tessa. Oh, Come on, Tessa. It. Oh god! Oh, oh, wow! Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, Please! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! That you were call her El Teso. Jesus. Oh, come, on, come, hey. on, come on, baby. Oh! Ah, oh my God. No way. No way. I'm a killer. Three times in no a way. way. Oh, oh my God. Killer. Oh my God. Killer. That's the work of Oh my God. She is the demon. Oh my God. My luck only runs so far. Turn Lucy. Night. You said you weren't a gambler. Oh my oh. god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Baby. Oh, Lucy. Hey, hey. Oh, he hey, he's he's right, baby. Right right now. Two out of Come on, Benji. What are you gonna got? What you got? Oh, oh, my oh, god. oh, oh my god! 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 No way, no way. Yeah, what do you please. get? Give me a two for two. Oh, oh, oh. 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 wow. Yeah, me, Lish. Hey, 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 Demon, Demon time. Demon time. Are you doing a hundred or am I? I'm not you. Nah, you. Yeah. Yeah. All righty, all righty. Oh. Ooh. Half and half. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. god! Oh my god! god. god. Oh, no. oh no! You won't stop! Ah, oh, shit, here we go. Oh my god! Oh my god. This is gonna do me. Oh! oh. 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 Waves! The waves! Oh. Fuck! Oh! Yeah. oh. Well oh done, well God. done. That is my day. Right. So that was the day. first one. Uh, where's the uh, air? Here, let me in this piece. Thank you. That was close. All right, guys, everybody oh, head downstairs to the dance floor. The cage is up. We're going to do more rolls down there, all right? No. Remember, this is all Good dependent shit, on uh, how much y'all bet. High bets, low bets. It's going to depend on what you get paid out. Just keep that in right. mind. No worries. So the, uh, Let's go down there. Let's go down there. The Follow the security. You know, based on your bet, that's what you do. All good. Make sense? Yep. Yeah, well, it's very close. All right, perfect. That's crazy. All right. That was, so that was fun. <laughs> you have a lot of fun. No, no, no. They're going for the cage. Marlon, you get paid yeah. out? Uh, no, you don't. You lost, Ellie. Uh, no. I, I lost. Uh, I lost. Guys, I got to take the wire. Where's the rest of the money go? That money goes to the house. 
The house always wins. <laughs> Boy. That was so much fun to watch. You have ice in your veins. How you do that? Normally, I don't really get good rolls. I only got, I only bet, I only bet a hundred, and I got one forty out of that. <laughs> hey, you know what? It's still fun to watch. Imagine how much Marlo got. Good shit, know, Tessa. Good shit. Good shit, oh, Tessa. Else always good wins. Good shit, Tessa. Oh my lord, Jesus! Thank you, guys. All right, everyone, uh, form a circle. Form a circle again. Oh my god. <laughs> How much we get? We got a uh, hundred forty. You got first. Out. Definitely jealous. Yeah. Okay, I think. Who's gonna win this time? I think you will. Oh you will. damn! Okay, Are you gonna go again? Ooh. I'm, I'm thinking about it. I don't know. It was fun. Well, in the meantime, I will DJ and play music mm. of the people. Oh, sure, sure, do that. Yeah, I got you. Play a, play a oh. Benji song. Play a Benji you song. Need... Let, let me ask you this. How about this? Okay. I did earlier, but I'll do it again. Excuse me. Sorry. Yeah, play another Benji song. Play another Benji song. What would you like to do? Because okay. I had my... Uh, to be honest, I would be down to just end it on that because that was a high note. That was fun to watch. Yeah? Yeah. But it's up to okay. you. I think we call it there. Yeah, you know what? That, that sounds good to me. I, I That was great. That, that was great. Oh, Tessa, we prayed for times like this. Get back in there, yeah. champ. And what do you mean? Get back in there, champ. I don't know. I got, I think I should yeah. quit while I'm ahead. Okay, but it was... It was a high note, so you know? Oh. No, I, that run was pretty legendary. Yeah. That's yeah, a pretty I think it was run. Good. I, I'm not going to lie. That was yes, amazing. Yeah. I was your biggest fan. All right. All right, we're just waiting to see if uh, a couple more people come in. I think you no, should no, do no, a no, big no, one. No, no. How's the music sound? Nah, come on. This is all you. You win. But it's good. Good, good. All right, bet. If there's one thing I really don't like, it's giving someone a gift gang -gang. and getting something back gang -gang. afterwards. <sighs> but I, you've given me two gifts, and I haven't given you anything. Hey, you know what? You gave me your time. That's good enough. Let's go check on uh, Fiona Raya and I forget her husband name. Uh, not her husband. Uh, Carlo is. Hat, oh. Turn up the fucking volume, bro, because this but is a funeral for the fucking living. Sorry, I don't, really, I don't know. What are they? I don't know what they are, actually. Um, I'm not even sure if they're dating, but I think they've got a thing for each other. Who knows? So, it is a situation? DJ. Um, I think DJ. it's some kind of situation, but I don't know what to call it. Here, yeah, maybe we talk about this over here. That's my twin for real! I thought that, um... How do I say? I thought that her and Marlo were married. Oh, no. That ended a while ago. Like six years ago? Or yeah, like a long, ago? long time ago. I'm pretty sure he broke up with her over text. I don't know. Oh. Give me a second. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I wouldn't... I wouldn't bring him up. Yeah, you know what? I, 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 I won't. Wow. Yeah. I don't know. Ew. I don't really Ew. know the full situation, but... That's what I was informed, and I just kind of don't want to... Push it? Cause... Yeah, I don't either, but how, how do you not text? Like, not, I not don't a know. person? Oh, sorry, hold on. I'm not even sure. Have they left, do you think? Or do you think they're still here? Uh, I don't know. You could ask, though. What? Jasmine, stay open. Oh, thank you. Yep. Hi, um, where did you guys head off to? Um, we're just dropping Raya off, and then I'm not sure what we're doing. Oh, you're dropping Raya off? Where's yeah, Raya? We're dropping her off. Huh? Where's Raya? She's gone into the apartment. Oh, okay. 
Yeah, so I don't know if we'll come back or I'll maybe call you. Okay. We're just, okay. uh, I think we might be wrapping up. Okay. They're, they're doing, we'll come hang out. They're doing death rolls and stuff at the Liquid Library, yeah, but you've, we're kind of done with it. me in. Mm hmm Oh, okay. How'd your day go? Uh, we're pretty good. It won uh, $40 in the death roll. Nice, okay. Wait. Yeah. Four, Proud of you. Thank you. All right. I'm being well, a fun guy. Well, I'll see that's you okay. I'll let you go. All right. Bye bye. No. Oh. Bye. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. So, so you. I bet a hundred dollars, and I got a hundred forty back. So I won uh, forty dollars. Wait. That. That don't make. It. Yeah. Any sense? Marlo's Those getting. Are Horrible. A lot of money right now. Um, um, okay, you know what? Uh, uh, if he's going to do odds like that, I'm not going to work with him in the future. If he hosts an event like that, and you give odds like that, because you had to roll against, I think, 12 people. It was a good amount. Yeah, no, that... Yeah, I don't know. It, it's a little yeah, low, no, but, gonna... you know, I feel like he's just trying to make money. Yeah, but... That's you just can Marlo. Without being... No, but that that is, like, horrible. I, I've never... I'm curious how much other bad. people bet, because... I put in 500. Really? Yeah. I gave you what I was betting. If that is the case, I'm not going to work with him. And to be honest, if that's how we want to operate, that that gonna spread around really fast. That that is, those are horrendous odds. Like that is really, really bad. Like house always wins. Yeah, yeah. The house should get paid, but the house should not steal. Well. Well, you know what? No, I'm calling him. Hold on. I'm not even... No, I'm not even gonna do this. I'm gonna say to his face. Hold on. I mean, I don't want to make a fuss over it. You know, if it make you uncomfortable, I do it later. I, I gotta tell him to his face. Like, I, I know he's a businessman, but that is... That is gross. Like, I, I thought you said 1400 not 140 Yeah, he handed me $140 at the end. Because I bet 100 and the payout was based on your bet, I guess, is what he said? I don't know. I'm not a gambler, so I don't really know how all that works, but... That's kind of why I don't like gambling. Hello? Hey, how's it going, Desmond? I'm so sorry. I would love to play the game. I got something going on now. I, I really... I, I will like what you're doing. Any other time, I would say 100%. I'm so sorry. I, I will do it next time. I appreciate it. But you guys are doing something good. The timing just was really unfortunate. All right. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Well, if uh, you want to go do whatever that was, um, uh, I don't I do mind not. if you drop me off. I really do not. But oh, okay. is there something you would like to do, or is, do you have plans? Um, I have no plans. As a matter of fact, I don't have anything to do today. Other than, well, I guess, maybe check in with people, see where people are at, and what's going on. How about this? You need a chauffeur. Okay. Well, how about this? Who is first on the list? Um, probably Juno. Let me give Juno a call, see where she's at. All right. They were working security at the thing. Still working security? We just finished up. We're just depositing the money. 
cool. Did you guys do good? Oh god, it was something. It was something. Yeah, I saw the little tiff at the door with that girl. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know. It was loud. It was really loud. Yeah, we were all inside talking on notepads. Okay. And then I won a death roll. So what are you guys up to after Can this? Anything with? happening? Okay. Process. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, Tessa, I I don't know. Uh, something I believe in Eve, and then we're. I don't know what we're doing after, but I can let you know. I, I reckon we do probably head to the switchy. Okay. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, I'm not sure though, but I can I can call you back as soon as I find out. All right. Yeah. Let me know, and um, I'm around. I'm just riding around with Jay and checking in on people. Okay. All right. Cool. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. I'll let you know. I'll let you know. ASAP. Cool. Okay. Uh -oh. All right. All right. Love you. Bye. Love you too. Bye. Bye. I. Huh. What just happened? What did we hit? I, I crashed into this. This. Oh. Bottom of the car must be low. I guess Jasmine's ass is too low. Ooh. A crime scene. Tessa, you want to hear a, a very stupid fun fact? Okay. Now, when I tell you this is stupid... You gotta promise, you cannot laugh at me. I make no such promises. In fact, you, I'm already starting going, to laugh. I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you a story. And the only reason I'm sharing it is because... A lot about me has changed since this day. But... Okay. It, it is embarrassing. Can you at least hold the giggle in for like five seconds? I don't know. Get, for, come on, for at least just for I'm, five it's seconds. It's already funny. You already started making me laugh. Okay. Yeah, it might hold not on. Even be that funny. Maybe okay. you're gonna hear it. And all you're, right. You're gonna be dumb. <clears throat> I'm all right. I can do this. All right. Okay. You you see the spot we in right here? Yeah. So. About eight years ago, eight years ago, I decided I wanted to rob the vault for the very first time. And, and I don't know if I was having a bad day or actually, no, I'm not, you know, I, I don't even know why I'm trying to lie. I'm going to tell you exactly what happened. Okay. I, I had first moved here and I felt very insecure about who I was and, and, and how I operated because I was in a city full of so many very talented individuals who, who made me feel like I, I was not enough because people shine so brightly, I felt very dim. And so I was already kind of beating myself up, but I decided, you know, I'm going to rob the vault. You know, going to try it for the first time and I crash a motorcycle right here. Imagine driving a motorcycle, not being able to get away. Crash on the motorcycle right here. I get arrested by, Cl by Cletus Cornwood. And for whatever reason, I was so emotional, I cried. I'm not joking. I cried over robbing the vault. I, I know. It's embarrassing. Oh, my God. But I know. I know. It's, it's so embarrassing. But, you know... Funny enough, after <laughs> I, I crash out, I go to jail, I get arrested. Cletus decide, you know, he want to send his thoughts my way. And I, I just get flooded with perspective of how much things don't really matter in Los Santos. And yeah. at the time, to me, it mattered so much. Mm -hmm. Don't get me wrong, things matter here, but, you know, nothing really matters. 
That sounds very depressing. I don't mean it that way. No, no, I, I think I get what you mean. Yeah. But uh, every time I drive past here, I just I think about who I was eight years ago, and I'm like, wow. You are cringe. <laughs> every time. Oh, wow. You know, um, I don't know if you heard the conversation that... Oh, God. Um, Fiona and Carlo and I were having about adoptive uh, family and things. Oh. Did you hear it? I don't know. What, what was it? Oh, I, t I told... Uh, I told them that Jonathan, Jonathan Yolo, is my adoptive son, basically, but... They might have not heard in a very long time. Yeah. Um, he doesn't really visit the city too much anymore. I'm not even sure he lives here anymore. But, uh... He... But before, you know, we really had any kind of relationship or even a friendship... Um... Back in the day... And this... I'll tell you something, okay? This is longer than eight years ago. Like, much longer. Like, when I first came to the city... Back before they had, uh... No working trains. You just kind of... Walked to the city. And anybody off the street could just enter the city. Um... I got in a car with a friend of mine, and at the time, you know, I was very goody two-shoes, and I never did this, like, I, I never sped, I didn't break any traffic laws, things like that, and, uh, I got in the car with my friend, and I didn't realize that I had turned my speed limiter off, and I was merging onto the highway, and I got to... I think it was about a hundred miles an hour onto the highway before I realized. And... Honathan... was waiting... in a speed trap... at the start of the highway. And he pulled me over, and it was the first time I'd ever really been pulled over. And I was with my friend, and I just met my friend, really, and we were just sort of getting to know each other. And, you know, I'm embarrassed. But... The worst thing that could have happened, happened to me. And what was that? He gave me a speeding ticket. <laughs> and I'm gonna be honest. I couldn't handle it. And I cried. <laughs> and I had to go down to the courthouse, and I had to talk to Dennis Labar, and try to get rid of the speeding ticket. And I couldn't even speak. In the courtroom, I was so embarrassed. And I was... I was real shy back then, like, I didn't want to talk to people, I was kind of like... I didn't know what I was doing. And, you know, I was embarrassed, and... So... I cried. <laughs> and... I got rid of that speeding ticket. But, you know... I didn't... It wasn't like a... I'm crying because I want to get out of the speeding ticket. It was, uh... I can't handle this emotion that I'm feeling right now. So, you know, maybe we're both a little cringe. But God, that was a long time ago. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, that is a good one. You, you go from... That, I would say that's going on 10 years. 10 years? Yeah, that's going on 10 years. Damn. Holy. So you went from crying in front of judge to doing a lap dance and putting your ass in my face. Wow. <laughs> I've changed a lot. Yeah, I don't think I didn't notice. And what the heck? We were instructed. I, you know, I gotta follow instructions. What the heck is all those masks? Yeah, I mean, we followed them a little too well. And what? You were doing it too. Yeah, I know, but I was facing the other way. <laughs> well, I said well, spread actually, apart, guess, and everybody didn't. You know, pff, lucky me, I guess. What the heck? 
Uh, yeah, it's compliments. Actually, I probably shouldn't say that. <laughs> s s smile. You're so much prettier when you smile. Where's my hug? Ew. I, I'm, I'm, uh. kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, that's um something that happened to me that I don't really tell people because it's really embarrassing. Yeah, I don't know. There's something about being able to take a, a step back that is very interesting. I don't know how to explain it. You Sometimes know what's even I wish funnier? I cared as much as I did. Oh, yeah? Conathan doesn't even remember this interaction. Hey, you know, maybe that's for the best. And it keeps me up at night. <laughs> oh, yeah. You ever do that? You're going to bed and... Your brain is like, hey, ah, the thing you did in third grade. I and hate like, it. Like, <laughs> yeah, you want to remember that right now as you're trying to sleep? You gotta love that. Uh, it's a fun moment. City sure you has some... changed since then, though. Tell you what. I cannot imagine what you have seen. Because <clears throat> as you probably know, I, I moved here when, you know, people were in a really bad place. You think? Oh, yeah. You know... I think where we all used to live, you know, people needed to stay inside, and so we moved here so we could go outside. Oh, yeah. And I did not realize <clears throat> how magical this place would be. A little too much at times. You're telling me. Oh, yeah. I remember there was this, like, girl, her name T4. She was, like, awake for, like, four the hours in a row. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Freak. I don't know. I get past, like, ten hours and I'm in physical pain. I just can't. Oh, I gotta yeah. go home. No, I feel you on that. Some days you're feeling it, other days you're like... You wake up and you're like, Nah, I'm gonna go back to bed. Well, Ray told me he was... Going on 22 hours in the city, and I was like, What are you doing? And then he said he had to stay up for the party, and I was like, You should probably just go to bed. Because at mean, that point, are you gonna have moves. fun, you know? Like, I don't know, I would be dead. Yeah, well, I guess if you can handle it, sure. I think for some people, how do I say this? I guess talking don't hurt them as bad. Right? Oh my god. I know. Some days I regret the way I was born, but I would not yeah. be me. Oh my god! Ooh, ow! Okay! I tried I'm to break okay. I'm sorry. Okay, I, I, I got too distracted going down memory lane. Where, where is Miss Juno? Oh, um, she said she was gonna call me in a little bit. Uh, I guess they're roughing up. They just got their payout for doing security. And I think they're probably gonna have a little family meeting. Uh, and she's gonna call me when they get together. Alrighty. But I don't think you can come to that because it's like a... I don't know, they get real weird about that kind of thing. I would not intrude. So when, when she calls, I'll probably have to part ways, but... We can hang out till then. That is totally fine. 
So, what do you do when you're not at Senior Buns? Oh, there's Juno. Oh. You tell me where Hello. I drop you off. Hey, we're heading to Vespucci. Vespucci? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll All see right, you there. I'll be there soon. All right, goodbye. Bye. Okay, let me mark it for you. Alrighty. This place give you good memories or bad? Both. <laughs> There's a reason I'm not going back. Hey, you know what? I don't need to know. I respect your privacy. Well, maybe someday we'll talk about it. It's it's not something I'm like secretive about or anything. It's just uh, I had a very rough time at the very end uh, before I went to rehab and I uh, you know I I went and I explored the world because I I just couldn't handle being here anymore. Well, you know what? If you ever decide you want to get down to some. Less than legal activity. When I, uh, I get to a more comfortable place, maybe I give you a call. Okay. Speaking of which, my yeah. phone is actually missing something. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, my SIM card. I don't know where it went. It got robbed. Oh. Well. There's my number when uh, you get a new SIM card. You know, I was making a bad joke, but that, that is what I was asking for. Yeah, I know. I'm not dumb. Oh. Okay, that makes one of us. <clears throat> <clears throat> All right. This should I show be you good. A text. Thank you for going and being my date for the night. No, thank you. I had fun. Me too. And thank you for Money the barrel as the, well. Uh... Oh, yeah, of course. Money or not, the death roll was fun. Yeah, it was. A good time. I, I actually have never won one of those, I don't think. So that was fun. You thank you. you. You destroyed. It was a good time. Yeah. City doesn't know what's coming. Jesus Christ. Goodbye, Mr. Sa. <laughs> Maybe I should change. Ah, you look fine. I'm going to go change. I'll be back. <laughs> Yeah, that was a fun adventure. I'm glad I got to spend it with Christopher. Did, uh, did we give Christopher a shout out? Because he sure gave us one. And my car might still be there. Uh, Scooby, by the way, thank you for the 15 months. And then Rotwood, thank you as well for the gifted sub. And Kvitviv, thank you for the prime 33 months. Hello. This might be my car. Hello? There we go. Did 
Did I get a dono? Oh my god, my my feed doesn't show those anymore. It drives me nuts. Uh, do we know who sent it and how much it was? I gotta I gotta look. Let me go. Oh, thank you guys for the love. I appreciate it. It was a $5 dono from... Someone said Darth? Is that correct? I'm so annoyed. I don't I don't even know where to go to look for those. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Well, in, in a way, this could be a way to, you know, test them. Yeah. Put them into that position, right? So. Well, then, maybe, um... Hang on. I think that's... Or, uh, maybe you make all six of them, then. All of them? Okay. Okay. Well, that's what I'm saying. If you want to test them, test all six of them, then. Without, uh, you or me involved. Or you have me involved. Either or. I could phone Bobby, I could set him up, I could do all sorts of shit. I like the idea of you doing that. That's probably gonna be the easy... Well, the thing is, we don't want it coming back to us, right? Well, that's the issue too, yeah. So, the message was this with that dono. Hope the machine the guns are disabled on the Ardent. Then, uh, Speak from GTA up, Online experience. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure they're fine. You know? Yeah, I mean, it's possible they aren't well, disabled, but he probably won't be right? using them because that's number? like, uh, you know, not good. But thank you, Darth, for the dono. I appreciate you. No. Who's well, who's sure number? We could get it. Carmine. Uh, no, but I could probably get it. Um, where would you get it? Who would you get it from? Mr. K. Okay. Okay, if you could do that, that would help us a lot here. Um, we could Actually, do a, uh, Richard, I might um, be able to get it from. Richard would be more um, discreet. I feel like Mr. K would probably stir. Okay, okay. Not that Richard doesn't stir, but... So there's less... He's too dumb to do anything. Okay. <laughs> all right. See so if you can get that number. Uh, you have Bobby's number already, Joe. Right. So, all right. Let's put you. Let's put you here with them then. So it'll be you, Carlo, um, Mateo. Then we have the two Tommies and then Natalia. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Well, that's what we currently have. That's so. If, you, if we're gonna do it, then that's who we have to do it with. Unless you got yeah. any more suggestions. No, that's uh, that's what we have right now. Uh, if you can get that number, Tessa, then we could try calling Carmine uh, via payphone. See if he answers, just to make sure he's uh, you know. I'm not sure if payphones are working. Whenever I see someone on Twitter talking about an unknown number, and they say I can't answer it. You need a SIM card. Really? Fuck. Yeah. Okay. Mateo has Mateo has a, a a second SIM card. He could maybe he could maybe use that one. I'll start getting people together here so we can debrief them about the, or sorry, just brief them about the, about the job. Yeah. So, hang on. Mm -hmm. This uh, K, uh, connect thing. 
Right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Is Carmine involved in that? Uh, in a way, he kind of gets involved sort of indirectly. Mr. K lets him and Bobby and Richard kind of hang out in the lobby. Uh, I don't think they're actually employed. It's more so Bobby and Richard. Mm. Uh, but Carmine is very close to Bobby. And they used to be close with Richard, but they had a falling out. Um, they're not very serious people. Uh, they're hard to explain. Um, I would not say that they are technically employed, just people that Mr. K keeps around so he can abuse them. Uh, for lack of a better explanation, I guess. I don't, I don't really understand the current situation with that. But they're not employees in the way that myself or Chris or Tony uh, are. I'm just trying to see if there's any gonna, ever going to be any blowback on our end if shit happens. Uh, I, to be honest with you, I don't think so. Um, especially if it's in regards to Mr. K. Uh, they tried to break into his house yesterday. They pooped all in it. And he had them arrested. So I think he'd probably find whatever we're doing hilarious. All right. So there wouldn't be any issue with Mr. K uh, if he were to find out in any capacity. But um, I don't think he'd find out. Um, that's just my assumption, though. Okay, okay. Well, the idea is that this doesn't come back to us, right? We're yeah. We'll be doing this in a way that, you know, they, they won't know it was us. Um, they will unfortunately have to know that this is being done on behalf of Max because we're looking for some money here, a very specific amount. So they'll they'll probably connect the dots, right? But um, in terms of us doing it for them, they're, they're not, they're not going to know that. Now, if this does come back to Max, you know, is that going to be a problem? I'm sorry, what was that? If this does come back to Max, rather when it does come back to Max, is this going to be a problem? What specifically are you, uh, what, doing this? Taking mm -hmm. care of Bobby and, and, and Carmine? Yeah, uh, and getting the money, yeah. I mean, I, I don't think there's anything negative that, that, that'll happen when you guys spoke to him. Yeah, okay. All right, yeah. just, um... Making it clear, right? Because if we ask for a specific amount of money, they're gonna know. Because that's the money they took from Max. Yeah. Uh, if he goes back to Max, I mean, Max is Max. He knows the. He, he knows the. Yeah. I, I don't think it'd be an issue at all. No. All right. All right. Shave it. Shave it for tomorrow. We gotta wake up early tomorrow. I don't think he's around. Oh, you've been coming? Uh, well, Bobby. Yeah. Okay, Bobby, Bobby was around, yeah. He was at the party. Um, yeah. <laughs> Just so you guys know, uh... I, actually, I don't know if I'm supposed to say anything, but, uh... Bobby kind of got... got, I think, at the party. Yep. Okay, you're aware of that? What do you mean, yeah. God? People saw that. Yeah, that was that was Luch. Luch did that. Oh. One down, one to go. Well, the thing is, it's... it's it was unrelated. Uh, it was, it was a mean, different thing, I think. Cause, yeah. Yeah, he, he hurt Eve. Yep, yep. So that was completely unrelated. I mean... Mm. I don't I think just, that should deter us from doing anything else to the guy, I right? just tried calling him, he didn't answer. That's why I say that. Okay, well, regardless of if they're around or not, we should probably we should probably explain things to everybody that we want to get involved in this and um, come up with a plan, right? And well, then that, well that's, that's the thing. We can... We can but, the, but the people might change tomorrow. If yeah. Be in tomorrow, right? Yeah. That, that and I don't want it. I, I really don't fucking want to tell everybody and the mothers what the fuck we're planning. Because, truthfully, 
I ain't ready to trust everybody right now. What if I try and bait Bobby out? Would that help? Seems like well, an we unnecessary could risk. Okay. Could bait him out with Joe too, but then yeah. that's the thing. We, we we don't want to come back to us. And I honestly don't think it's, here, so. it ain't gonna be too hard to find them if we we do it the okay. old fashioned way. I meant. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's but fine. what do you what do you mean? No, no, no. I was gonna say uh, I was like uh, I was gonna mention like a phone call, but it's the same thing. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, at some point, someone gets hungry and has to go to fucking senior bunch, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a good point, yeah. Um... Alright, how about this? The people we want involved 100% regardless. Carlo Mateo, yeah? Can we say those two? Yeah. I also want to test some people too, I think we should do that, right? Okay. Well, uh, call Mateo, I'll call Carlo, see if we can bring him down, alright? Yep. Oh, he's, uh, he's busy. I'll take a quick leak and then I'll try again, alright? You answer your phone like that again. Not gonna like what happens. What are you doing? Oh. Um, uh... Yeah, come down this spot. Yeah. Come, come down to the spot. You know the spot. The spot we go to every fucking day. Yeah. All right. Uh, it does. It don't matter. It don't fucking. All right, all right, okay, all right, see. Stuff. I am in a mood. Oh shit! Oh, I, oh my god! I didn't mean to do that. Oh, oh, holy shit! That that was a horrible yeah. fucking timing. I am so sorry. I don't. I don't have any band aid shit. I do. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, oh, thank you. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. There you go. All right. All right. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna stand back here and say that again. I am in a mood today. There we go. That's better. Mm. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Glasses? You get your glasses? You're nervous about Max, aren't you? My what? You, you sound kind of... I don't know. Nervous? No, 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 no. I'm not sure. No. Okay. No, Why are you nervous? Because I'm watching my boyfriend with his zipper down. Mm. Ew! Just see the size of that thing. I hate it. Here. <laughs> yeah, me too. How's everyone's day been? Good. I got a barrel. Oh. And a rock. Oh, well, that's nice. This is my rock. His name is Jeffrey. Oh, my, God. Oh my God, Bundy. I can I can throw yep. him at things. Did you throw at someone? I 
think it rolled under my car. Oh, fuck. Throw it, throw it at the car. Which car? Which car? Wait, isn't that... Oh, okay. It's my car. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, it's under the... Where is it? Oh, it's I got it. Darkly. Okay. That's my rock. So, something is wrong, but it's not Max related. Okay. I'm gonna make it obvious. Vito, look at Tessa's rock! Is that a rock? Yeah, look at it. Hey, Carlo, where, uh, where are you right now? What the fuck? Oh, shit. It's my rock. Got a spider on your foot? My play? Yeah, you're gonna. Hey, you're all good? I thought you fucking crashed or something. Alright, um, you think. Fuck, we need to, uh. I need to talk to you about something. Um. It can, it can wait until tomorrow, though, it's not urgent. Um. No, no, not right now. Uh, in a, in a bit, though. I won't be around for much longer. Okay, we're at the uh, we're at the Vatican. All right, see you soon. Ciao, ciao. Where'd you get that rock? The hardware store. Oh shit! It's one hundred and seventy-five dollars, it? and it's yeah, a it's small okay. sized rock. Oh my god! Max punched me. I mean, not Max. Jesus. Uh, Troy punched me by accident. And my glasses broke. So the glass. Scratch my face. It's okay. <laughs> All right, let's, uh... Thanks, you look good too. It takes forever to be able to be picked up, so I don't know if it's gonna be good for sports. Like I hoped. Coming? Yeah, sorry, I was uh, messing with my pockets. Everything good? You guys need a moment? Uh, uh, we're good. We're good. Alright, Mateo. Yeah. So, we got a little bit of a, a job that we have to do, alright? Um, some dirty work though. And I was wondering, well, first of all, do you want to get involved in that? Absolutely. If it's dirty, I'm a cleaner. I love cleaning. What we, okay. What we doing? Good, good. We're going to rush some guys up. And maybe a little bit more. And we're also going to be getting some money out of them. If we can. It'd be a difficult job getting the money specifically, but we'll see what we can do. Um, but now, 100% in on this is going to be you and Carlo. All right, and the rest depends, I guess, on who's around and who's willing to get involved. But I didn't want to ask you if you had anybody in mind specifically you wanted to put to the test with some dirty work, some hands-on dirty work. Some hands-on dirty work. Mm -hmm. I think um, Tommy DeVito, you might be a good, uh, good kid. Get a sense of. Um, you know how how really loyal he's looking to be in the future. You know, not just to myself, but to uh, others in the circle. You know, that's one specifically that comes to mind. Okay. Um. Perhaps Natalia as well. I mean, she's she's been, a, in all honesty, a bit emotional lately. So I'd like to see how she would handle in a high pressure situation like that as well. Okay. Okay, Natalia. Anybody else that comes to mind, I'm not uh, too sure. I mean, anybody else who's around, you know, maybe like Lucia or uh, maybe Tommy Cuso, maybe if he's in that sort of thing. I mean, 
I'd be like that. Okay, okay. I keep those names in mind. Um, Carlo, Fiona. Yeah. Um, I just want to tell you guys about a job that we have pending. All right? It's probably not gonna, not gonna happen tonight. Um, because. Wait, is this people... in regards? Let me. Is this in regards to Mickey? Or no? Uh, no. Okay. No. He wants to talk to me and you, I guess, about something. So. What the fuck are you okay. Doing okay. Mm. Uh, did he contact you recently, like today? Yeah, I spoke to him today. He said, um. Did he be around for a bit? So I might go meet up with him. I don't know if you're sticking around, but I mean, I could get the details and relay it back to you. Um, I don't know. He just said he had work. I don't. I don't know in regards to what. So I guess we'll we'll see. We met him up. We we met him earlier at the hospital. He he's he did mention something, some collaboration he wants to do between us and, and him, but he didn't mention the details. So it's probably it's probably that. Okay. Uh, if that's happening anytime soon, yeah, I can I could I could swap for it. Okay. He also mentioned some gambling stuff. I don't know if it was the same stuff that was happening that. at the party because it may have been what was going on at the party. I'm not sure. Well, I'm gonna be real. Uh, I didn't really look into the blackjack thing, but if it's anything to do with what Marlo was doing, the death rolls, uh, yeah. I probably wouldn't recommend that you guys do it. Uh, wouldn't recommend. His, his payout was pretty awful. Um, I did a death roll against like Ten other people. I won it. I had bet a hundred dollars, and I got forty dollars as my winnings. What the fuck? Uh. What? Oh my god! Marla I mean, I got a hundred. People. I got a hundred and forty dollars out of it, but I, my total winnings were forty dollars. And um. he he very specifically was like, uh, it's based on how much you bet, and it's like, I don't know. I want to say it was like ten percent. House always wins, okay. but yeah, just so you know, uh, he's getting a lot of money off of that. And if you're in the mood to gamba, uh, probably not the most lucrative thing. Okay, well, it's good knowing that, I guess, if he wants to do stuff like that with us, and uh, we, we know how it works. Then. Okay, but yeah, uh, if he contacts you or, or me, I'll, I'll let me know, I'll let you know as well. All right, Carla. Um. Well, this other thing, this other job, we have a we have a, we have an opportunity to get hands on with a few things. And first questions I want to ask is, Carlo, Fiona, you want to get hands on with something? I'm talking about some dirty work. Oh, my light just flickered. I might not be the best flickered. part right now because chances are I have a warrant. So. Uh oh. But I am interested. Okay. Carlo. Yeah, I mean, I'm in for it. Okay. Have a couple of my guys stream to goes down suddenly, it's probably my power. Just FYI, they, guys. They owe somebody who's asked us to do this for them. I think you'll no, enjoy no storm. these people. Just sometimes we get wind and Doing trees it. fall on power stations and stuff. Oh, yeah? Hmm? Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, probably. Probably, yeah. So, in I, for I, sure right now, it's going to be Carlo and you, Mateo, all right? So, you two. Okay. Everybody else, we can figure it out afterwards. Hey, Natalia. Hey, yo. I'm giving us a moment. We're discussing something here. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, the targets are Carmine and um, Bobby. Fuck, what was his last name again? Oh, I know. I, I literally just saw him today. The, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Bobby yeah, Bollybrook. Charles. Yeah. Charles, that's it. Charles. Bobby Charles, all right? Uh, mm -hmm. Now, these two people stole some money from Max, who's the candidate that's probably going to win the mayoral, ele mayoral elections, right? He wants us to get that money back. In return, not only can we keep the money, but he's uh, willing to offer us some sort of offer, or I, I guess favor or something, uh, when he gets into office. This could go a very long way, very, very long way, if and when he wins, okay? Right. Now, the difficult part is going to be getting the money back. It's about, um, how much was it? $3,200, $3,400, more or less? Yeah. 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 Now, the only way we're going to get that money off of them, unless they have it on their person, is, I don't know, somehow forcing them to get it out of their bank, which is going to be a difficult thing. The other part, roughing them up, that's going to be a simple thing. 
in addition to this mm. job that we got from Max to do this, it, it's, it appears that um, it appears that there's a hit list out there with Juno's name in it. So this goes a little bit farther than just doing this job for Max, all right? Specifically, this Bobby Hey. Hey. Specifically, this Bob Bobby Charles guy is the one that had this hit list, correct? Do you know? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So specifically him, I want this motherfucker gutted like a fish. I know he was already gut like a fish today, but I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> That's basically the job. Now the problem is we don't want this coming back to us at all in any way. We ask for the money, it's obviously gonna go back to Max, but it doesn't need they don't need to know that it's us doing this for them, for Max. They don't need to know, obviously, it's us doing it because Juno's on a hit list. So we need to come up with a plan, a way to do this, so we can lure them out, do what we got to do to them, and also find find a way to get the money. I so got some ideas in mind, actually. Um, some connections that uh, some of my uh, the people I've been talking to lately, they, uh, they're on pretty good terms with uh, Carmine. Might be able to work out an angle right there. Okay, okay. Looks like everybody's got a fucking in on, on, on Carmine. Oh, well, Bobby as well. Yeah, there was another option with uh, Joe thinking about maybe learning him out, learn Bobby out specifically. So, I was gonna say, like, we have a lot of options. I mean, if, like you said, getting them to a bank might be hard. But if there's any potential way that we can get somebody to, I don't know, set them up for like some sort of sale where they bring that amount of cash, or I don't know, what whatever it might be, then that might be another way to go about it so that way they have the cash with them. Getting them to a bank, one, it's going to be difficult, and two, it's, I mean, it's risky if we run with, you know, a lot of the banks are in hot, popular areas, you know? Oh. Yeah, yeah, indeed, indeed. It's, it's going to be risky. It's going to be very difficult to do as well. Um. Okay, so yeah, we got to come up with a plan. But before we come up with a plan, I do want to have, um, I want to have a team clear, right? A team ready to go. Hey, guys. How are you? Hey, you. What have you been up to? Myself. Not a lot. Uh, you know, been, uh, been doing a whole bunch in uh, trucking here, so been good. You know, certified founder, just uh, looking to lay down some groundwork logistically and supply chain. It's, uh, you know, hoping to, to feed what the, the city needs here. Cool. And I went to a party today. Oh, beautiful. All right. And I found this rock. Oh, outstanding. See? Wow. It's a nice rock. I named it Jeffrey. It's nice oh my god. I and I can... Like a llama I can't... Or something. I can throw it. I know somebody else that does. I mean, I've seen... I've seen... I've seen... Yeah. I'm gonna throw it at people's heads if they make me angry. Oh, hell yeah. That is... Could she packs a punch? I know that. Funny. Yeah. I got into a fight yesterday. We had a fight night. And I fought, oh, I fought a guy and I lost that one. But then I fought Carmine and I won. I made him run away crying like a he little baby. Like a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you. Yeah. I think I'm going to sign him up for cat facts. Oh my god. Please, yes. That's a good thing, yeah. That'd be so funny. But yeah, the party was fun, although, I don't know, I'm not too happy about the gambling stuff that happened afterwards. Yeah. yeah. It's a little, um, I won, but I didn't really win yeah. that much. Oh, yeah. Tell me the whole death gamble thing on the roof. Yeah, it was a death roll. First time I ever won a death roll, but Dude. the winnings were a little time. low compared to how much I think the house won. That. Okay, then, huh? Yeah. So just be careful. If you're going gambling and Marlo's running everything, I'll oh, steer clear. Oh, yeah. Uh, for me, I, I no gambling over here. No going at all for me. Yeah. I mean, it was only $100. I, I only put $100 in. So you're not really going to get too much back, but hey, it's a you'd thrill, expect you know I mean? a little more. Absolutely. Then. Uh, no worries. I'm just glad that... Uh, my gentle ears are finally relaxing. That was really loud in there. We had 
a bunch of us had notepads out, and we were talking in the middle of the room with our notepads. Mm -hmm. Carlo was drawing wieners, though. Of course he was. Yeah, I crossed one of his out, and uh, he turned it into a flower. Oh. I tell you, huh? Other than that, not much going on. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Into the vanilla. Beautiful and lately. That's nice. No. I only go when there's something going on. That is. That is. Well, admirable. You know. You gotta enjoy yourself when it's an enjoyable time, man. Yeah, yeah. I heard Pilbus won his court case against that Vivek guy. Oh, hell yeah. I'm kidding, huh? I think if there's, you know... If there's anyone that I'd be okay with uh, as, like, a runner-up, if not Donnie, I think it'd be Pilbus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's good. So you've been working on anything that does? Uh, honestly, not today. Um, you know, I've been working with Mr. K on a lot of stuff, and I think mm -hmm. my my job with him is probably really promising if I keep at it. Beautiful. I've been hearing good Just things. Gotta been up. keep saying yes to him, you know, and working my way up the corporate ladder. There it is. Yeah, yeah. Well, Miss Tess, um, if there's anything that uh, the Cuso Truck and Co Limited can provide or do for you, hey, I'm always here. All right. All right. Well, I appreciate yeah, it. Course. Absolutely, yeah. Also, um, yeah, I'll be looking uh, at some uh, paralegal work here as well. So. Some what? Some uh, paralegal work here. Just, um... Oh, paralegal work. That's okay. right, yeah. Yeah, just trying to, uh, you know, keep the businesses out of the courtrooms, you know what I mean? Fair. fair yeah. Fair, you know? Honesty and awareness. I think it's a good thing. Well... Did uh, anybody tell you guys about the academy Juno and I want to plan? Oh, no, actually, no. Didn't. Okay, so I'm trying to get the word out because uh, there weren't many people at the meeting. So, basically, what Juno and I would like to do is uh, a little sort of like school session on mm. your basic rights. Like an orientation, right? Or something? Uh, yeah, you could say that. Um, we're gonna do it at the university, so you guys will sit out on the bleachers, and we'll, we'll make it a whole track and field day kind of thing. Beautiful. Um, it was planned for tomorrow, but I think we're pushing it back, because there's some big, uh, protests going on at the same mm. exact time, so... Oh, yeah, I don't want to... I don't want that to get interrupted. Mm. So, Absolutely. I think we might push it back, but... Uh, it would love to have you guys there. We want pretty much everybody who can show up, show up. Sure thing. Is yeah, this yeah. going over? Because it can benefit. I can benefit everybody. Oh, yeah. Legislation, rights, uh, kind of what to do, what not to do type of thing. So. Yeah, like, there were people who were a little confused about frisking versus searching, which oh, yeah. can lead to some problems. And of so, course. Juno and I think that It'd be beneficial just to kind of go over that stuff with you guys and Absolutely. make sure everybody's up to speed. So Absolutely. you're doing paralegal I, I do work. Some, uh, yeah, I, I've got some. Uh, I've got some knowledge. You know, I yeah. know my rights pretty well here, and um, just studying and uh, looking into any new laws that uh, you know what I mean? that we can uh, just be aware and potentially benefit from. I mean, have you seen these police officers lately? They just—I uh, don't even think they know their own damn rights. You know. Well. Yeah, I think the uh, current PD leaves a lot to be desired, but uh, yeah, I'm not a part of it, so yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Kind of trying to come to terms with that, I think. Is um, I was, I was telling Michael yesterday, Michael Simone, oh, yeah. that I gotta like, I gotta come to terms with the fact that I'm not in control anymore of that kind of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And if, hey, I mean, if police officers are in, doing dumb stuff, I kind of have to just put up with it. Yep. Right. But, it doesn't mean I don't know my rights, and it That's doesn't right. mean I won't mm -hmm. be petty. That's right. True that. I mean, basically, you know, enough reasonable suspicion, you know, with the probable cause there, you know, and then kind of saying, you know, staying and being arrested there, and, um, you know, basically, don't ever 
ever, 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 ever consent to anything there. All right. Yep. Ever. The only thing that you should be having happen with the police is things that they force upon you. You do not have to say yes to anything. You do not even have to talk to them. Absolutely, then. Yeah. Absolutely. Some ominous uh, individual running from right to left. Who's that? I uh, seen from the, my peripheral vision somebody had ran from right to left and went black. No mask though. We're, we're okay. Keep an eye on him. Oh yeah. Ah, no worries there. Yeah, so Mr. Yeah. Johnson, I mean, you looking uh, at like a, you know, opening a flower shop or, you know, something, something adventurous, you know, or something, uh, you know, something that'll fulfill Miss Tess, you know, waking up in the morning one day, you know, months to years later saying, you know, it's time to, time to, you know, fulfill my, my dream, you know? I don't know what I want to do. Right, right. I'm kind of in a weird spot right now where I'm like in limbo and I don't know where I'm at and... Absolutely. What I want to do, because I mean, I could open the driving school, but do I really want to do that? I don't know. Yeah. I mean, through the proper delegation, you know, then again, you know, something uh, so uh, securely tied, you know, with the PD, then, you know, they start putting pressure on there, then again, you might be put into a situation you might not uh, want to be in, you know, having to deal with all the bickering and. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or, you know, they, they know that you have great instructors, you know, perhaps they uh, certify, you know, your instructors and, uh, you know, then they've certified and, you know, they can't really go back on it, you know what I mean? Maybe something uh, worthwhile. I've been thinking about it. Not a bad thing. It's a necessity and a staple, that's for sure. I have really been liking the, uh... Boy, the wind really picked up. Yeah. Uh, I've been, I've been really liking the... Connected telemarketing stuff, because it's sort of... Low pressure, it is a little bit of money on the side, and... and another, it's entertaining, right? you know? Oh, yeah. Is it, uh, not your personal number, right? You're, you're doing it, uh... Oh, no, no, I, I use beautiful. a SIM card. Beautiful. That's great. Yeah, heck no, I'm not using my own card for that. Yeah. <laughs> God forbid, Miss Tess, keep that hair, you know, nice, bright, and, you know, nice and bright, you know, try to avoid them more from graves, you know? I'm sure people will kind of figure it out, but, you know, that we're not really doing anything uh, that's not above board. Absolutely. So, I'm, I'm kind of okay with it, but, oh, yeah. you know, if people... People got an issue with me sending them cat facts once in a while. I don't know. Maybe they're just too sensitive. Yeah, of course. Yeah, no worries. I mean, sometimes things change. Numbers change. People, you know, maybe you can't, you know, get up uh, up the apartment sick or something. Never know an individual situation, you know? Mm-hmm. No worries. No worries. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I, I do see you as a form of instructor, you know, you got your patience, you know, I think you, uh, I think you have a good intuition, uh, judging folks' is, uh, intellect, yeah. You know, you're like a, you're like a neutral, overlooked, uh, very smart, brilliant individual here, Miss Tess, you know? Thank you. Yeah, of course. I've got a lot of avenues opening in front of me, and I just, I haven't really picked which way I want to go, so I think I'm... Yeah, absolutely. I'm okay being in limbo for now, just until I figure out where I am, and then yeah. what direction I want to go. Beautiful, beautiful. You got but it. I'm gonna go check on them. I don't know what's taking so long. Sure thing, sure thing. Can't wait to see you find folk there. This is for America and its freedom, so he'll fucking be there. Him and Bobby, probably. Yeah, but there's gonna be a lot of police there. Yeah, but there'll be candy, chaos, and anarchy. I mean, you could fucking slip. Yeah, I'll bring my uh, I'll bring my AR-15. Oh, there you go. Huh? Yeah, it's crazy. But I'm saying, you know, good area to stake out them, right? Because you'll know they'll be there. 
True, true. I mean, you could you could be you could be there with them and then follow them out, right? Mm. Something like that. Oh, I mean, I think the crowbar see. is actually a really good idea. It's a good I idea. I do think that is a good idea, and you guys could get a picture of one because you, you know, right? You got access to possibly getting a picture of one, which is perfect. Now the thing is, we would have to have somebody that. I mean, this can't be just a random call that they get. It'd be like, okay, crowbar from this random unknown number from this person I've never met before. Why would they call me? So that would have to be, it would have to perhaps be a face that they know. That's where the problem comes in with that, right? Because a face that they know would right. make them more comfortable. They would be, okay, I know who this is. Let me go, let me go to them and see what they have. Hmm. this case, it'll have to be at the Joe hmm. or Mateo, I'd say. A face they feel comfortable with? You know that uh, DeVito's on... The, 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 I mean, DeVito and Carmine are like friends, right? I mean, I could talk to him and maybe try to set him up, you know? I think DeVito will be down for something like that. Yeah, why doesn't DeVito just play along with it? Like, yeah. he's getting held up too. That's true. That's kind of what I was thinking would be maybe a interesting plan is if maybe I got in the car with them somehow with the connected stuff. Uh, and then, I don't know, I I text Juno you know, a, a thing or something, a, a sing, signal that I got them and I'll, I'll drive them somewhere and you guys get the drop on us or something. I like that. It's customers That's good. Them. I do like that. I do like that. Okay. Okay. Good shit. Good shit. Good planning. All right. You sure you want to put yourself in that position? That's a... Well, how many people are going to be involved? Because if I'm involved, then I'm taken away from one person. So maybe not. Yeah, sure. Uh, I mean, if we do that way, they might not have the money, right? Yeah, we would need them. Oh, to have yeah, them. okay. Maybe I didn't know the full plan. I think the crowbar is the best bet in them having the money. Okay. Or, I mean, unless they're interested in another market, but I don't know what the, what they get into, so... Maybe something for the thing tomorrow. What do you need yeah, to storm a, a building? A gun? Battering ram? <laughs> Fuck, I don't even know. Um, Maybe a gun. Gun would be a gun. A gun. They, they, they would 100. percent I know Carmine would buy a fucking gun in a heartbeat. Offer the offer it as help for the thing they're doing tomorrow. Maybe we can get Devito to uh, call him on one off. Be like, you know, hey, you know, Carmine, I got my hands on something. I, you know, I saw you doing this thing, to, you know, tomorrow or today or whenever he talks to him. I don't want my hands on it anymore, you know, you want to take it off my hands or whatever. So, I don't know. Yeah. I'll, uh, after we're uh, done here, I mean, I'll, I'll give him a call and uh, meet up with him, you know, try to talk to he, him. He, yeah, he's got to be nonchalant about it. Like, he can't just call and be like, hey, I want you to buy this gun. Like, he's got to like, hey, man, I don't I don't really want this anymore. It's, you know, and I saw what you're doing. You're going to the fucking to the town, or city hall tomorrow. It could be a use to you, you know, just trying to sell that. Y'all lay it out, though. Yeah. You said that he's close with Carmine, yeah? Friends yeah. with Carmine. They're, you don't they're, think they're he's going to have a problem attention. doing this, right? I think this... I think him wanting to become, of, uh, become a part of this is way more important than any uh, friendship that Carmine has to offer. So, yeah. I think it won't okay. be a problem. Say, I think it also, I mean, Carmen, Carmen's friendship is just, it's like a one-way street, I feel like. Yeah, you're probably right. But measure him up a little bit, Mateo, all right? Ask him about his relationship with Carmen, right? Just 100% sure of it. Because I don't know this guy very well. I don't think anybody here does. You know, we need to be sure. No, absolutely. I'll, uh, I'll ease it in. It's no problem. Okay. Okay. So we're going with the we're going with the gun plan. Say a gun or a crowbar. One of the two. 
One of the two coming through the veto. Mm. Yeah. Yep. All right. Then it's um. Then it's settled. That's the way we're going to approach it. Those are the names. Any questions? Any concerns? Um. I guess we got to decide day of where we're going to bring them, but because I guess it depends where we take them. But definitely, should probably head up north or something. Somewhere up north. Yeah, definitely outside the city, if possible. Yeah. yeah. Figure that out on the day of indeed. Okay, that's it. Then I need you guys on standby. All right. Tomorrow, oof, unless it's really late, Mateo ain't gonna ain't gonna be involved. Um, not. Then it's gonna have to be Tuesday. However, if we do find an opportunity before that, Mateo, we're gonna have to swap you out. Okay. That's no issue at all. No problem. All right. Talk to the veto uh, right now if you can. Don't take him anywhere up in Polito. Very busy up there right now. Yeah, yeah, with the hunting, yeah. Doing good, doing good. How you doing, man? Several places as human lives, as a quarry, as great seed, or as sandy. Quarry is so cliche. I don't know. Well, I mean, you could even take him under a bridge down the south side, like near the docks. Yeah, yeah, we'll figure it out depending on where we grab them from. Because what I'm thinking is if you take him, if you take him all the way down south around the port of Los Santos, there are so many roads that mm -hmm. interlink with each other. There's going to be overpasses, there's going to be the Elgin Fields Freeway. So on the off chance that there's a report that comes in with the police, such as a 1010 or a 1011, 1011 being a deadly weapon, a 1010 being a fight in progress, then they're not gonna, the cops aren't gonna be able to tie an exact location. They're gonna be confused as to where it is. Tess is really bothered by how they're excluding Natalia right now. Low, it could be, yeah, one of the roads. Okay. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Yeah. Specifically for the people that are being tested, um, I'd like I'd like to keep a very good eye on them and try to put some responsibility on their shoulders. See how they do under pressure with something specific, you know. Um, for example, uh, whoever's going to be cutting cutting Bobby up, maybe it should be one of them. I'll let you all decide that together as a group. The people that are actually getting involved here. Okay. No, she's not excluding right, herself. It. She was that's told it. to that's step what, away. That's what I want to talk to everybody about. Um, I didn't include Natalia because, well, I, 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 didn't, I wasn't sure if we were going to include her uh, in, in the group, but we are. Uh, she should be brief on the day of, right? And, um, yeah, like I said, put some pressure um, on her a little bit with the group. You, you think you could just kind of fill her in a little bit? Like, hey, we got something coming up we might need you for, just so she knows that... Yeah. A reason to just kind of put in time out. I'll do that. I'll do that for sure. Just do it right now. All right. Anything else? Any other concerns about this? No. Okay. No. Then, Eve, I need to talk to you and and Joe briefly. Yeah. Yeah. So if someone stops by City Hall, can you check to see if I have a warrant? Uh, yeah, sure, Tessa. Yeah, I can check. Yeah, I can. Donnie, oh, that'd be awesome. We could all go. The veto. Yeah. I just, I also want to make it clear, she didn't say anything to me. Uh, I just felt a little bad for her. Yeah, I kind of felt bad for her as well. Yeah. Uh, especially because she was like the only one. Well, Tommy Kuzo was there as well, but uh... That's why I stepped away. I went yeah. to go just sort of chit chat i just want to yeah. make sure that you didn't think she's like upset or anything because i don't think she is 
Yeah, okay. Appreciate that. That's the thing, right? I panic, but I do get myself out. I know, I know. But you not go? I haven't run for too long. Uh, it's not that crazy of a warrant. Did, did I think you know they went leave? to the... I think they oh. just went to the city hall real quick. Okay. So where did you lose him at? Um, down here. It's the famous Naki. Hello. Hi. Did you have on you three? The matrons on standby. Ah. Interesting plan they have. I didn't realize they wanted them to come with the money. I thought maybe they were gonna threaten them and and tell them they needed to bring money. But it sounds like it sounds like the plan is to trick them into bringing money there, and then kidnap them, <laughs> which is funny. So to tell you, how you doing? Doing well. Yeah, yeah. Are you in bed or? Uh... Yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> Just a Jay fanboy. <laughs> I think Tessa is too. She likes Jay, but, you know, oh, she though. is in fact a lesbian, so I don't think it'll ever go anywhere. <laughs> what? You know what Naki means in the Netherlands? I know what it means in Finland. In Finnish. It means little sausage. And I find that hilarious, and that's why I actually kept the name. I liked the, the way that it sounded. Huh? We got a question about okay. what's happened. I know we're having the school thing what? tomorrow, but... Uh, so... We were dealing with, um, you know, some stuff. I, I was at a... I was trying to uh, jack a car from somebody's house, and Fiona was parked down the street in... Were you in someone else's driveway? Or were you on the yes. street? Yes. Okay, so she was in someone else's oh, thank driveway, you for the not prime. at the house that I was at. The dog woke up and started barking and the car alarm went off and the police showed up and I, I got out out the back on foot. I got out of the area and the cops pulled up to Fiona and were threatening to trespass her from the house, the garage she was parked, or the driveway she was parked in. Are they able to do that? If they didn't get a call was, from that house specifically? She was parked in a different driveway? Yeah, mm -hmm. like a driveway down the street. Um, I mean, I guess technically if she didn't own the property and she was on it, she shouldn't have been, but trespass, I don't think the officers know what that means. Uh, cause I had an issue yesterday with Mr. K where Bobby and Carmine entered the premises of his house. They, they walked in the unlocked door and they took a dump inside of his house. And the officers charged them with trespassing uh, and vandalism, which trespassing typically, all right, you have to inform the individual that they are trespassed and then you can trespass them if they either continue to be on that property or if mm -hmm. they don't leave uh, or if they come back later. Leave. So like I was like, yeah. So you have to give someone the opportunity to leave if, you know, especially if they're not aware that they're trespassing. Um, you know, you could have been stopped there to check your text messages, right? It's not well, something that you need to coffee. be... Yeah, or sipping your coffee. Um, you know, if you're asked to leave, that's one thing, but the owner probably wasn't present, am I correct? Yeah. The owner didn't call the police, am I correct? So, no. The owner up the street did, correct? Yes. Yeah. So, in my opinion, no. Like, they never even saw me running away or anything. Well, they, like, they did mention that so, whenever they get these calls, there's always someone waiting down the street. 
So I think they were trying it's... to press me for that reason. That because doesn't when matter. They tried to... When they tried to get me for trespassing, I was telling them, like, yeah, I'll leave. That's fine. Like, I, I don't even be here. I can move. They weren't allowing it. They didn't allow you? Well, like, no, because they were, like, detaining me. So they wouldn't let okay. me leave. So they... Okay, well, so if they had you detained, if they told you that you're detained, um, that is something where you, you cannot leave until they tell you you can leave. Mm -hmm. Um, however... Them charging you with trespassing is not acceptable. That's something I would fight. Um, because... You were not trespassing. You were, you were on the property, yes. But you were not informed you were trespassed. Uh, you were not asked to leave. You were not even allowed to leave when the police showed up. So, any yeah. attorney worth their salt is gonna win you that case. I just, uh, I don't even know if there'll be a case on that, because I evaded. Did, oh, well, you know, that isn't good, but, um... Were they going to arrest you? Um, I evaded, so I, it's, it's confusing. I saw someone running down the street, and I panicked because I thought something was happening with the job. I, I didn't know mean. Carlo had... I didn't know Carlo had left. Like, I had no idea any oh, that was happening. Oh, so you kind of got confused. So I wanted to check on him to... Yeah, so I drove forward very slightly just to see what was happening. And then they said I was under arrest for evading. How slightly so are we I, talking? Like, a couple inches? Like, or several no, feet? No, 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 no. Yeah, like, several feet. Fifi. Okay. Yeah. Got news. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Bad. Why is it bad? It's really bad. It actually states the charges on there. Yeah. Wait, what are the charges? Yeah, it's crazy. Oh, what? it's bad. I don't, we don't want to. Yeah, you would. You really don't want to know. Just kidding. Don't you don't know. have a warrant. I knew it. You <laughs> sickos. That's mean. Are we sure? Are we sure that that did that this public, like the warrants are displayed publicly? It yep. was. Yeah. Cause there was they only should one be. On yes. There. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. What was it that you did? Because I was one for. Was it street racing or something? Yeah, I, could, uh, <laughs> I couldn't even find her profile. I have a profile. I don't know, dusted three cop have cars been, in a, in a sentinel. Arrested, have you been arrested before? Ify? No, but they made me a profile they, when I got pulled over once. They took my picture and shit, and okay, yeah, I've seen it sense. in there. Uh, yeah, it says uh, negligent driving on your profile, that's it. Mm -hmm. So yeah, um, I know you got spooked and... You can still and... get one, right? You can still what? Sorry? Like, get a warrant. Like, they'll stick his little file for that, all right? Uh, I would check in the next couple of days, see if you... If they maybe are delayed in putting it out. Uh, I wouldn't be too worried about it, because if they don't put it out within the next 24, 48 hours, then they don't have enough evidence to push against you. Okay. They definitely yeah. do. Were you unmasked? Yes. She gave them her ID. You, potato. <laughs> don't do that. Wait. Oh my god. I need the... I need the drive. I need the school, okay? The, yeah, yeah. But listen, like, yeah. because I, I thought I could talk my way out of it, right? And and everything was going good. And then when I saw someone running up the street, I thought I needed to help. Oh, no, she dumbass. thought it was me. She basically thought it was me running up the street, but I already escaped on foot. And so yeah. she went to drive up to that person thinking it was me to help me out, but it wasn't me. It was some random mm -hmm. person. Oh, no. I thought then, she was trying then, to evade. And then yeah, they and basically then... were saying she was under arrest like right away. Yeah, they said I was under arrest yeah. then. Because I, I told them I'd off. pull over immediately. Like, I told them, like, what? after I drove, I was like, okay, I'll pull over, I'll pull over. And then I was going to try and talk my way out of it. And then the police officer was like, you're under arrest. So I fucking did. Yeah, you really got to be careful with detainments. Because if you no, no, if you are detained in any capacity, okay. even if it's just a traffic stop, because a traffic stop I is... was Andrews, okay? He's intimidating. I know. I, and I get it. But he's actually <laughs> really easy to talk to. Um, yeah, I like Andrews. So, I think you got spooked, and that kind of screwed yep. you over. There is a chance that someone is... Okay, actually... I don't think you're gonna get a warrant. Really? Here's why. Why? It was Tony Andrews. Well, it was Andrews and Cornwood. Oh god, and there's, yeah, that, there's that, reason number two that then. you are getting a warrant. Nothing is getting put up there, then. There was other cars. <laughs> It was other cops, but I don't know. Yeah, um, I'm pretty sure I saw some reports from Tony Andrews, like, from years and years back, a long time ago. Mm -hmm. That just had, like, one word 
and it was like penis penis. <laughs> so what? I wouldn't I wouldn't really Wait. worry. Okay. And cornwood. It's cornwood. It's not cornwood. I'll I'll lay low a little just in case. Yeah, I would yeah, still lay low because they might remember you. They might remember that you have you should have a warrant, right? Because they can retroactively uh, chase you if you know Tony Andrews sure. sees you today and is like, "Hey, she evaded earlier." Just because mm -hmm. he hasn't written the warrant doesn't mean he doesn't have the right to pull you over because of that. Okay. So he can write the warrant anytime within like 24 to 48 hours, but I very much doubt he will. Uh, he may have changed, but I... You know, uh... <laughs> <clears throat> I think you're okay. Nice. Just pretend like you're not. As soon as that dog started barking, Fiona, I literally sprinted in, fucking jumped over the back fence and made it by like, oh, I was like two feet within getting my leg ripped off. That was like added to my panic because the dog fucking ran away from the house and I was like, did this dog fucking eat you and then run away? Dog. Good thing you called me and told me the cops came because I was about to loop back go. to the house after the dog yeah. left. <laughs> Right. Threw my tool right. on the ground at well, fucking car rentals take it because easy. I was coming to pick right. you up. Right. You I, it out. I mean, it had oh, it was it was phone. like it was like it was almost fully completely broken. Well, but I just I you know I just didn't want to be caught with something like that. If I came to help you, I didn't know if you were gonna need a pickup or what. It's okay, I cooked. Yeah, I don't know how you lost them in the Seminole. <laughs> what the fuck? Because <laughs> I'm a good driver. I think it's that their cars, cars are terrible. Her. Maple was telling me that they don't exceed like 80, or they didn't at one point. Mm -hmm. I wasn't even like going fast. I was just taking a lot of turns. I'm going into a lot of little alleyways. Yeah, well, good shit, good shit. Yeah, I, I wouldn't worry too much. Fuck, like that. What mm -hmm. happens now, you know, after you, if you fail the fucking hack one time, the alarm goes off and that's what wakes up the dog. Oh, shit. I failed the happen? first time because honestly, I was, Oof. I was not, I was not ready. I was not ready. Yeah, that's what happened. Like, even though you got three tries in the past, like, realistically, you only got one, because on the F, if you found the first one, like, the cops are coming. Makes so, sense. you really, yeah. Can't fuck up next time. I don't know. I was not, I was not ready for it. I want to try it, but I'm scared. It, 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 even though I, like, I got down a little bit, like, it is still, like, I mean, I just failed it. I mean, it's... It's just so quick, you know, if you're not 100% ready, like I was kind of, kind of fucking not fully with it when I fucking picked the fob, like, yeah, <laughs> fuck it up. Yeah, I think I think the cops need a lesson on how trespassing actually works, cause that's <laughs> not it. You actually have to inform a person, and they have to violate that for it to actually be trespassing. Yeah. Huh. You don't have anything that you wanted, did you? No. I think you got a lot to learn about how I am around cops. I saw it. I literally Apparently saw it. I, no, no, no. I literally saw it how you are <laughs> that one day when we almost got arrested for the fucking stabbing. I did fine with that, though. You were freaking was, out before the camera. I was partially fucking though. with you, though. Because I, I, you, were, you were telling me the alibi, and I was joking around that I didn't remember it, but I did. 
Like, I was partially mm -hmm. fucking around. But usually, yeah. usually, uh, you know, I only fuck myself over. I don't talk about it. Yeah. I would have got away that day if that fucking guy didn't grab onto my wrist. Mm -hmm. Well, in in our city, like for the longest time, the the kind of trespassing kind of laws have been like, uh, there After either needs to be area, signage, I was just running like like posted, with on, with a, or mask, and I just they need to be like in informed. And I was like, by, and I was like, That's how I was it's like, always worked. Give me a ride. And. If there's something that changed with that, then it needs to be defined in the legislation. Named Veronica. But it seems that they're not really doing it that way anymore, which is confusing. Because I've met them in my life. That that means a cop can stop you anywhere on any property and just be like, "You're trespassing. You're under arrest." No matter where you are, and that's kind of problematic. Did any cops see you? Veronica Westfield in the in the yellow pages, Deputy Chief of EMS. Okay. Nice. Um, did any of the cops see me? Mm. No, no, I was I was literally gone before you even called me. I was already I was already like five houses down before by the time you called me. Why didn't you tell me that? I literally was going to I literally I called you. I called you first. But I had to get mm. out of the area first myself because I was on foot. I was I'm also panicked. running for the dog. Can't just open my phone and fuck it. Well, I've got a dog coming at my ass. True. Well, at least you got away, though. Mm hmm. I want to bring Raya to a job. I don't know if she'd do very well. You said she got away from the police earlier. What the? Really? Jesus Christ. Oh, okay. Yeah, she was, um, what was she saying? She was cream, she was cream, pie, creaming people. No, creaming. She was creaming people. Uh, did anybody notice there's a whole bunch of new houses on the market? Are there can I see? Can I see? Uh, Where Fudge at? Lane. The All the houses on Fudge Lane are available now. Was there only some of them before or what? Yeah, there's only like two or three. Now there's like all of them. Could I see? Uh, yeah, one second. Thank you. And just, uh... uh I'd, rather, yeah. I'd rather sit on a cactus than fucking live in Fudge <laughs> Lane, though. A whole bunch of Bro. Mirror Park, Bridge Street. Holy shit. Those that Mia Park house is fucking massive, man. Those are really nice, yeah. Nine hundred thousand dollar ones, Mia yeah. Park, Bridge Street three and four. A those whole are... garage, a balcony. Oh my god. Okay, guys. All right, listen. Uh, <laughs> the one I like. The one I East like. Mirror and I Drive. Buy. Wow. Yeah. There's a lot more. The one I like is um. Wait, where is it? Wow. Like. All the houses in Mirror Park are available now. Mm -hmm. uh, the one I like in Mirror Park is uh, Mirror, Mirror Park, Mirror Park Boulevard 6. I like that one. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Trying to scroll the I way down. I don't have a tablet. Uh, Polito. There's a lot more in Polito now. Oh, there's one in Polito. Oh! Junar. The houses. Oh, my huh? God. Junar. Mm. Yeah. Don't go buy tablets. No, I want to save money. That's okay. I don't need it. Okay. Well, I could buy you one. Like over 150 the bucks. water. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I want one. Which one? In Pol in Polito, the house mm -hmm. is looking over the water. There's like four door garages. Yep. Yeah. Uh, although I heard right now that uh, these houses, when you buy them, the garages are bolted shut. Oh yeah. I mean. Obviously, for now, but I mean, you know what I mean? Long-term thing, I'm thinking, you know what I mean? That yeah. would be beautiful. So, you know which one I really like? The fucking... Mere, Mere Park, West Mere Park Drive 8. Seems good. It seems like a nice house. The 440. Like one of the cheaper Mere Park ones. Yeah, that is cute. 
Um, West Marin Drive, you said? Judo, keep the one. Tess, you want to come get one real quick? I okay, just want yeah. to look at it. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. She wasn't picking up my hint. <laughs> I can't believe how many houses are available now. It's beautiful. Yeah. Honestly, I feel like even even if we wait another week or so and we keep saving, there's going to be even more on the market. Like, I think we wait until some Vespucci housing opens that's up. That's right. Right. It's what I would wait for, but... I don't have a lot of money, so I'm not gonna really dictate what we do. <laughs> no, that's all right. That's all right. I really want an interior decorate a house, but I think everybody uh, else does too. too. There's a lot of people who really want to. And Mr. K needed all that stuff yesterday, the uh, the tubes and stuff, to make a mm -hmm. staircase. I guess they needed some framing for it. Oh, probably for their place they did. Yeah. yeah. For him. They boom fast. I, well, actually, he said he got a second house today. Um, They've been pooling their money together and doing all yeah, kinds of stuff. I would assume they are. And also, I just saw on the other pages, like, someone's doing um, uh, rentals. Like, they bought a house and they're renting that's, it out now. I think that's what he's doing. Genius. Genius. Very, very smart. Like, oh my god, look at all the goddamn trash. We're gonna I know, do, what uh, the heck? What's it called here? Sanitation. Oh my god. We gotta do some sandy here, making money. <laughs> you got money for it? Yeah, I do. I'm good. All right. Got him. No, we didn't give him any more money. What? What? Yeah, that, that doesn't matter. That's what we, uh, <laughs> the real way to dry weed is to buy a PC and now. play Crisis 3. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you see him busy, you know what I mean? A lot of talk shit that go on. Oh my god. That, that guy was tired. <clears throat> what do you mean? We did trucking the uh, first whole week. <laughs> oh my god. What's up? Mm, no. These are the Polito houses. I really don't like the ones in Polito. Oh, yeah. Like, some of them are cute, but I just, I don't know. I don't vibe with them. They seem... They seem kind of run down and also, uh, like... <clears throat> yeah, I haven't, uh, I haven't seen them yet. Small. Oh, uh, yeah, he's probably taking the night then. Oh, big group. 
Uh, yeah, just got back down to. Uh, Ooh, okay. Hustle! Tonight, and you said to Hello. me, Hello. Months. Oh my goodness. You look as beautiful as ever. I love your hair. Thank you. Hey, yeah, I, you were. Did I bite your ankle? I'm, I'm gonna be. I said I'm gonna be. Yeah, you did. I'm really sorry. I was concussed. Well, I had a concussion and I didn't really know what I was doing. Um, look, I was very proud of you. You rocked that fucking ring. So, oh, thank you. Know you. It was probably adrenaline, concussion, it was, it was everything, but you know, you, you know, I, I don't hold it against you and that, I don't know, you're just so fucking cool in that ring. I mean, I didn't want to fuck with you either, I feel like you would have done what my dad does to me, you probably beat the shit out of me and break my visor again. Oh, well, yeah, my dad likes to beat me. I'm sorry. It's okay, it's Ray. That he doesn't add love. makes sense. What, what do you mean it makes sense? It doesn't add a love. Uh, I mean, I make less of a fuck a wucko. At least he does it on the helmet. Absolutely. He has really strong hands. Chaos, chaos. Same with you. You have strong teeth. I'm sorry. You bit right through my jeans. Did I damage them? I'm sorry. I'll buy you a new pair. No, 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 you didn't damage my jeans, but like, I, I had red teeth marks all over my ankles. And <laughs> You, you didn't let go. Yeah, I don't remember a lot of what happened afterwards, but um. Look, look I'm gonna say right now, your grip strength was the the yeah, same amount as a face yeah. hugger off Whoa. of like the Alien vs Predator movies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I couldn't shake you off. Absolutely. I'm sorry. It's like a little gremlin, I think. I don't know. Yeah, okay. I don't, no, there's no need to be sorry. I don't know what you're going through, but I feel like, you know, you are no longer fighting your demons. I think you took your demons out on everybody else. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Especially Karma. Yeah. He deserved it. That was so funny. Not really. No. Yeah, y'all got me out of But yeah. What brings you here, Tesso? Yeah. Well, I'm just hanging out with my friends. Oh. 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 Are these all your friends? I got yeah. That's awesome. Oh yeah. I'm, wow. Everybody's so close. Well, listen. It was a We're pleasure so again, Natalia. Oh my God. I love this. Pleasure to meet you, man. Absolutely. Hello. And I'll, uh, I'll send you a text today with my number. You know, What's everybody else free. doing here? We're on a de-stressing walk. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Hi, Eve. Siobhan's taking me for a walk. I've been a pleasure. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. She's awesome. I'm an unpaid Hello. intern. Hello. This is gonna be cool. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Well, best of luck with that, I guess. Hopefully, it's a new direction in life for me. I don't want to go back to the streets. <laughs> I don't want to go back to the streets. Oh, I'm sure you'll be okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. My hands are so soft, I can't do hard work. Break into a fucking church and pull out all their damn Bibles. I don't know how to make my hands harder. Thanks for the tablet, Bunny. I appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. The last joint oh my God. Rob rolled up was with John three sixteen. Man, I ain't gonna go pee. Oh, I love oh, okay. this. Yeah, I'll be right back. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Don't look. To read your Bible oh, more, but it's some weird shit. That's fine. It's fine. Ooh. Right here I go. I just can't oh, you're... up here. Oh my god. Here you go. Wait, 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 wait. like the barrio and like all the wait, south side areas. Oh god, look, I found pizza on the floor. Give me a second. Oh, no. Eh? Mm. I said Fax, not Max. Oh, look at Max. I look like a mean pizza off the floor. What are you? I'm broke. Ew. I'm broke. What's wrong with you? I gotta do what I gotta do! I got I soft hands! You nothing. Uh, okay. I got soft uh, hands! Don't slurp near my shoe, Max! <laughs> You almost stepped on it. That's not. That's not me. You that's a you issue. Oh, I mean, it's a good pizza. Yeah. Anyway, mean that. 
Oh, thank you. Oh my god. Odd that those oh are considered god. Bridge Street still. <laughs> I'm a little <laughs> gremlin! <laughs> 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 wow, this is, this is this is the fucking life. Why are you? Why are you? Why are you like this? What do you mean? Why am I like this? Because I am my very own person. I don't want to go back to being homeless, like how I first started, and then it got me into a gang, and, and it was like Gang Life USA, but every gang wanted to jump you. Hello. Hi. I got really overwhelmed with noise. Oh well, that's... Yep. Actually, it wasn't that bad, it's just with my thoughts and then the noise combined, it was... It was... A lot. And my heart hasn't stopped beating really fast for the past, like, hour. And I don't know how to slow it down. You wanna talk about it? Um, you wanna sit yeah, in the, can. you wanna sit in the really rainbowy thingy? No, cause I wanna see if anyone creeps up behind oh, us. Okay, that's fair. Yeah. If anyone else is what we were talking about? What were we talking about? We were talking about my date with, uh, Jay. Your date with Jay? Okay, tell me about your date yeah. with Jay so I know about your date with Jay. Um, he bought me a barrel, and he gave me $500 to gamble, and we danced, and we exchanged embarrassing stories about our past, and, okay. um, a situation where we both cried. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then, um, let's see. Um... What else did we talk about? So, well, I mean, when it comes to lies, sometimes they have too much detail. So, it could be one of those things where, you know, I give a, a gist of it with us. And I'll say, yeah, it's, it's, I had a date with this, some guy called Jay, which is funny because she's a lesbian. And they, if they ask to elaborate, then I say, ah. Oh, it gambled. There was a barrel involved. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then they'll probably be like, oh, okay, what else do you guys talk about? And then I'll be like, the notebook story that I still want to open up, get your plans, such as getting a house in Polito. All that. Okay. When I talk to you, my heart rate just like immediately just calms the fuck down. Just immediately just calms down. Uh, we were at the local library and Penny was like, like saying, you know. Hmm? Oh my god, thanks. He also gave me melty ice cream. Oh, it's like a milkshake. Don't look at me while I do this. <laughs> okay. Well, we... Vito and I and, and a couple others were running security at this ev at the event, you know, you were there. And then near the other tail end of it, Penny approached Vito while I was next to, next to her, or next to him. She was like, did you make her pancakes? Did you make her waffles? Have you eaten her out? Blah, blah, blah. He goes, Vito. yeah, yeah, I made her I made her pancakes. And I was like, oh my god, did you actually? Because I was really excited for some pancakes. I mean, that's a, that's a sweet gesture to me. So then I was like, let's go to the apartment, so I want the pancakes, so we go and I check the fridge and there's mold. 
from the pancakes. Ooh. And I I ask I ask him why he lied to to Penny and why he lied about the situation and to me and I was super calm during it, like just the way that I'm explaining it to you, if anything I was way more subtle with my voice. And then he goes, I'm not doing this, I'm not arguing with you. He just got so defensive out of nowhere. He's like, I'm not arguing with you and he, he began to walk out. I'm like, I'm not I'm not arguing, I'm not arguing, I'm i I'm I'm sorry, I'm not arguing. Like I'm not doing this. I was like, okay, it's fine. It's it's all fine. We're, we're we're good. This is this is fine. And then when we got here, I was like, are we okay? He was like, yeah, yeah, we're we're okay. We're good. It's not the man that I fell in love with right there. I don't know what the fuck that was. So we were having a laugh at the liquid library, he was dancing, we were flirting, we spoke about music. So I began writing some stuff and he was genuinely interested, it was good, and then this? So you you were just joking around with him about Penny, right? It was, it was just like, friendly... No, I mean, like, he, he, he like, I, I asked him why, why he, no, I wasn't joking around, I was serious, but I wasn't arguing. I, I, I literally told him, I was like, I just want to understand why. But, like, the way that I explained it, like, this is your veto, and this is what I was like, I was like, I, I, I asked him, I was like, why, why did he lie to, to pet, like, why, why did he lie about it? That, that was it. I never once raised my voice, ever. I didn't get argumentative, I wasn't defensive, I just genuinely wanted to understand why why he did that. And he was like, I'm not doing this. I'm not arguing with you. Well, I just, I don't get why you would think you'd be mad over pancakes. And I wasn't. I, I wasn't. I just wanted to ask... Like, I was simply just, if I was mad, I would have been like, why the fuck did you lie? That's what I would, that's how I would have responded. He knows me well enough to know, to know that. I wasn't angry, I was, I was disappointed for sure. Like, why would you do that? But that, that was it. That was it. I wouldn't understand where his mind was at with that. Like, why he did that. It wasn't anything bad. I'm just trying to... He's a closed fucking book. I can't read him. If he just simply said it was just a joke, I would have been like, okay, cool. Yeah, alright, no worries. Just, you know, maybe don't lead me on like that. This big joke, honey. Hi, Joe. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to update you on some stuff. Um, I kind of told Rito about it, um, but the best person to speak to is Tiny, but I'm, I'm happy to talk to you about it. No, um, I mean... Doesn't, I, I don't know. Mm, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm happy to tell you about it. Okay, uh, give me five minutes and I'll, I'll be back. I can go off to the side. Alright, okay. Alright, bye-bye. How long ago did that happen? It happened about five minutes prior to you arriving down here when we were with... I was going to... when it was just Joe, jo myself, and Vito. Hmm. Okay. Had anything else happened before you guys started nope. talking about Penny or anything? Mm mm. Nothing. Nothing. Besides what you know about, like, I guess him being jealous, maybe? Question mark? Yeah. And I don't know. Did he respond to your text? He didn't. Oh. But he called me and he was like, he said, I completely. 
forgot that I was asked to be security during the event. I was like, oh, okay, um, cool. And then he was like, do you want to do it? And I was like, yeah, sure. You know, time to spend with him. And to be honest, it worked out for the better. It was so fucking loud in there. <coughs> yeah, it was, it was pretty awful. Yeah. Nothing, nothing, nothing happened. I was a little worried I set something off, because uh, I, I checked in on him, I didn't ask him anything about you, but I asked him if he's doing okay, because he called me to ask me if uh, there's people running up on us, by the way. Um, he asked if I would run security, and I, I declined, but I said, are you doing alright? And uh, he seemed kind of surprised, and he's like, yeah, why? And I said, I'm just checking in on you, I don't think anyone else is, so... Um, or well, I, I didn't, I didn't say it like about. that. I said, I, I don't know if anyone else has been. So I just wanted to know, like, okay. how you're doing. He's, and he, he seemed he's fine. If he's getting suspicious, so we, we have to keep this between us. I don't, I don't think that's the case, because it was, like, hours later that he snapped at you. Okay. I just... I didn't know uh, if, like... Well, if he if he questions you further and you just check in on him, maybe you can just give the excuse that Juno's been seeming extremely anxious lately, or something like that. But maybe that even... No, I don't... Give it away. He didn't even... He didn't question it. He was just like, um... I think he was surprised that... I... I gave a rip. Um... Oh... It was more like that kind of thing, not like, I'm suspicious, yeah, why? Oh. So I, I don't want you to feel like it's it's that, because it didn't, I mean, that's not what came across to me. I wouldn't be surprised if no one's asking him how he is. Probably not. Maybe that's, Nobody maybe does that's that to people in leadership. Maybe that's why he snapped at me. Yeah? Maybe he just didn't want to deal with... A potential argument. Well, when we're dealing with the rest of the family, maybe it's that. The way he went about it was really fucking shit. I just want him to be honest with me, because he can still be honest with me about how he feels. And he's just choosing not to at this point. Possibly he doesn't really know how he feels right now. Or he hasn't he given himself a minute to think about how he feels. And he doesn't want to address it with you right away because he hasn't even thought about it. I think he's thought about it. I think he knows exactly how he feels. However, I don't think he thinks it's part of the equation. Because he needs to be an example for other people. I don't want Joe to get suspicious or whatever. Okay. Um, can you stay here for five minutes? Pretend you're yeah. on the phone or something? Thank you. I'm sorry it has to be like this. I don't care. I love you. I love you too. Okay. I'm gonna throw my rock. Oi! You gonna skip stones? Hell yeah! <laughs> I wish you could hotkey the throwing. What happens if you drop the rock before it leaves the inventory? Uh...
Let's find out. Oh, okay. Throw it pretty far. <laughs> Hello? Hi. Can we talk? Yeah, I'm throwing my rock on the beach. <gasps> what did the rock do? Well, his name is Jeffrey and he likes to fly, but he's a rock, so he needs help. Is that you over there who looks like a small ant? Probably. You look, you look so tiny. So what did Jeffrey do? He's just... Are you going to pick him up again or are you just going to leave him there and see if he's there like next I'm, week? I pick him up. Oh, you, oh, so you're playing like fetch with yourself? Yeah. I don't... Maybe oh. don't say it like that. I don't know. Kind how of, I, feel. I just that's kind of yeah. That's kind of what it know, is. That's kind of what it is. I just was. I don't know. I just felt like throwing him. I guess. That's actually wait. Where did you get the rock? The hardware store. Oh, all right. It's a that's small kind of sized cool. rock. Oh, that's kind of cute. I'm gonna throw, gonna throw it at me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw. Go long. Probably not too long, though. Uh, oh. oh, that was a very long... <laughs> Jaffrey, I'm coming! I got you, little buddy. Hi, Jeffrey. I got him. Wait, do I need to throw him back? I'll throw him back. Yes. I don't want to hit you, Tessa. You probably won't. It's hard to throw him. Oops. I just threw him on the ground. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jeffrey. He'll be okay. He needs a minute, though. You gotta give him a minute. Oh. That was almost. Yeah, I was telling Juno about him because uh, I went on a date with um, Jay, and it was oh. it was awkward. Well, listen, <laughs> he knows he's barking up the wrong tree. It wasn't really like a date <laughs> date. But he's a pretty nice guy. Um, he he bought me a barrel, and then uh -huh. uh, I bought a rock. And then I bought another rock for Ray, uh, so she could have a birthday present. And I told her she could throw it at somebody's head if they made her mad today. Um. So yeah, I bought someone Jane. a rock. Did they like it? Did, wait, did, did you give it to her? Uh, she seemed to like it. Oh. I don't. Well. Initially, I walked up to her and then I was too shy to say anything, so I just handed her a rock silently and then I walked away. And, I, and then I had to go back and explain the rock because I gave someone a rock for their birthday. I think it's a I don't know. Comes. I thought it was thoughtful, and then once I handed it, it to her, I was like, well, it's a rock. I think it's very thoughtful. Jay is a good egg, though. He used to be, he was my first roommate when I moved into the city. I he told got me loans about from that. All my friends, yeah. And then he was the last last puzzle piece. The last what? The last puzzle piece. You were a puzzle piece. No, he was a puzzle piece. Oh, he was a puzzle piece. Yeah, he, he was the puzzle piece to complete the, the, the house. Oh. Okay. 
okay. He was a good roomie. He gave me moonshine. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, how have you been doing? Um, I mean, I've been alright. Just been, uh, doing a lot of work with Mr. K. I've been doing connected telemarketing stuff. He wants me to make a jingle. <gasps> Can you he, sing Tessa? Uh, well, I'm not a great singer, but he wants my voice anyway. He money's gonna do the jingle, like, sound. And I'm waiting on that before we write the lyrics. So, eventually we'll get it done, but it's taking a little while. So what do you do exactly there? Um, mostly consulting. I, I talk to the people that come in about their advertising needs. Um, like we've, mm -hmm. we've worked with Mosley's, um, Mr. Nino's tow company, um, Goldman Talent Agency, uh, the, I want to say a couple of the mayor candidates have put through some requests as well, but Mostly it's just advertising stuff, like they talk about what they need, and then we tell them what we can offer. And it's basically just a text message ad that we send out. Oh, so you just send it out to a bunch of phone numbers and then they get yep. that? We have a huge database, mm -hmm. like 400-something numbers. That's crazy. Yeah, we're working with Miss Andy, and uh, she's got all those phone books. And we also do, like, SIM card cloning, so, like, say you lose your SIM card, um, we'll just give us the names of all your contacts that you want, and we'll, for a fee, we'll put them all on there. Okay, okay, I kind of like that, so they, they'll just, oh, so you'll just, so if I lost my phone, they'll just mm -hmm. give me the new numbers on it, that's amazing. Yep. And if you want to do it, like, right now, say you want a copy of your SIM card, we can do that, too. Okay, I love that. That's amazing. But you don't keep the same number, unfortunately. That's not something we can do. Yeah. Ah, uh, hold on a speedo. Hey. All right. Okay, that's perfect. Sleep well. I'm happy that uh, you're working on something that you like, Tessa. Do you miss um? Do you miss the PD? No. That's good. I was I was telling uh, I don't even remember who I was telling, but I think I just tell whoever would listen. It just it's not something I want to go back to because it was just a really bad point in my life, and it's mm -hmm. not really worth my time right now and. It doesn't seem like they're doing well. Yeah. I think that they are drowning, I think. But I see, I feel like they're trying, but they're still drowning. But yeah, I, I have no uh, interest or desire to go back. Um, if anything, I, I want to help people kind of protect themselves against them, because I've seen some strange stuff going on with, like, uh, trespassing. Fiona just had to deal with it. Yeah. Um, they, they don't seem to be going off the same definition of trespassing as they used to. And they're, they're basically just deciding that people are trespassing if they're on property that doesn't belong to them. So, by their standards right now, if we're standing in, like, I don't know, the little uh, cubby at the Venetian, I don't want to call it a cubby, that's cursed, but uh, if, if we were standing in there, technically, by, by how the cops have been deeming people trespassing, we could all be trespassed at their mercy and arrested on the spot. Which I don't like. Yeah. So, yeah, in the past, that's been a very specific thing, and for them to just change that, it's, it, uh, it's well, not right. Well, you need to tell someone they're trespassing and give them the opportunity to leave. To leave. Unless it yeah. is otherwise posted, like if there are signs 
posted that are very well documented and, and clear, you need to warn someone. You need to tell them, hey, this is private property. The owner has requested that you leave. And then if he, the person doesn't leave, that is when it's an issue. But I don't think that's what's been happening. Hmm. Do you ever think of become a lawyer, Tessa? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm happy to help people with that kind of stuff. Because, yeah. um, I don't know if... Were you aware that we were going to do an academy? Uh, like here? Oh, well, actually, at the uh, university, no. me and Juno no. are planning an academy for the boys mm -mm. to teach them their rights, because... Did you hear about the incident the other day with the weed run? I did, I did. Uh, more than just what Luca did wrong was wrong with that situation. Yeah, everything, yeah. And Vito didn't seem to understand that, and that concerns me. Mm. Um... He, you know, I called them all ding dongs, and Vito was like, "No, Luca's the ding dong. He, it, nothing of that would have happened." No, no. And I, they should have corrected you know, him. I didn't really know the full scope of it until later, but um, once I realized what actually happened, um, I, I actually realized that Vito was the reason I think that they got in trouble because he ran into the cop while he panicked and sped away. Oh my god. That's what he said. He he ran into Barrick. Hmm. Cause the cops showed up immediately when the when the local called nine one one. And so he panicked and drove off in a reckless way, crashed into the cop, and then evaded. Jesus. And so Luca, you know, obviously he should not have had what he had on him. But yeah. they wouldn't have even been in trouble. Had Vito not sped away, had they been driving like normal human beings and exited the neighborhood or wherever they were, uh, I don't, I don't think that would have been so bad. And they might have just gotten like, I don't know, a failure to stop ticket or something. They may have been questioned about what they were doing. But unless the cops actually saw a handoff or them doing something with marijuana, all they had was kind of circumstantial. Yeah. Yes. So, them not knowing their rights, them not them. knowing yeah. cops can't search them, uh, you know, if they're just a passenger in a car that evaded, that's important because... Some of them consented to searches. Some of them with illegal stuff on them. And it could have been real bad. And I'm, I'm actually shocked that it wasn't. But I think the cops right now are just... short-staffed and, and not pushing a lot of hard yeah. charges right now. That's good, though. It's good and bad. Because... Now we're They're on, on the list. Radar. Right? Yeah. They they have mm -hmm. a documented case of those guys being involved in not only marijuana distribution, but growing. And that's like really bad for future stuff. Um so I don't know, I'm I'm a little concerned about that kind of thing, but I mean, it, it is what it is at this point. Thankfully, they didn't get charged with it, but it still is a problem. So, I we're think, gonna I do... Think a, a little academy would be good. Yeah. Just, for, just to teach them their rights. Just the basics. It doesn't have to be really in-depth, but I would like to tell them, like, when they should and should not comply, and... When is a good time to run? When is not? Uh, cause they, they don't... They panic. And it leads to some not so good things for them. I think it's a good idea, Tessa. I 
I um I wanted to also check in on you and um make sure that you are okay because I haven't had a chance to talk to you after I came back. I wanted you to have a chance to let me know if you were okay and if you were not okay that I can have time to talk through it. Well? Hello? Um... I'm... I'm not really sure how I feel about things, because... I was waiting on you. And... I'm gonna be honest, the day you came back, I was really hurt. I, I found out hours later that the whole family knew and nobody bothered to tell me um it's Fiona you can take it I'll tell her I'll call her back Um, I don't know, I was, I was informed by Fredo many hours later, and it was only in passing because he was calling your name, because I guess you were hanging out with him at the time. Um, and that, it just bothered me that no one said anything. But. It also bothered me a lot that you didn't say anything. Mm -hmm. Um. And then later that day, you were on a sanitation truck. And you said hi to me like nothing happened. And you kind of went back to doing sanitation. Like nothing happened. So I, I didn't really know what to think. Well, I wanna I wanna apologize for doing that, Tessa. My intention wasn't to hurt you in any way at all. I came back and I had called people immediately because I flew back really, I f actually flew back the previous day and I'd only spoken to Luciano and we went to sleep. And then the next day when I woke up again, I made a bunch of calls and not a lot of people were around, like only two people were around. And um, I uh, started sending text messages, but then I got really busy and um, it's not an excuse. It really isn't. But um, I kind of just try to forget everything that I went away for and the reason I went away. Because I never meant to hurt anyone with my decision to fly out for a bit because I was still trying to deal with, you know, Luciano not being around as much anymore because he decided to do something else and that was still weighing on me. And a way for me to cope with that is just be busy. The less, the less time I have to think about things is just better for me. So just going to work is just better for me. It's still not an excuse to have not tried to call you or try to speak to you or try to let you know or just even send you a text message to let you know I was back. So I do apologize for that, and I apologize for hurting you, because that's not my intention at all. I love having you around here. I really do. It's one of my favorite things to see you here and see you smile and see you be happy around people who actually care about you, and I care about you too. And I really am sorry that I made you sad, because I don't want to be one of those people who make you sad. Oh, 
I, I appreciate it. I just didn't, I didn't know how to process it, because I just, I was already struggling with a few things. Not really feeling like I fit in and, um, there were some issues after you left that I, I sorted, but it was, um, confusing for me and I, I was working through that stuff and then, you know, right when I thought I'd fix it and that you were going to, I just thought you'd reach out and I didn't want to reach out because I wanted you to process whatever you were going through. And I, I didn't want to be conversation number 246 about why Eve messed up, you know? Because I know other people were upset. And I know they wanted to talk to you. And I think they have. But I didn't want to corner you into that. Yeah. I it, it has been overwhelming. I figured, you know, when you wanted to talk, we could talk. But I, I guess seeing you on that trash truck just... I ran and I hit around a corner. Far am you, far am you, to your breed, your place, your clan be true. I, I don't know how I'm feeling right now. It's okay. I still feel kind of out of place, but... I'm, I'm trying to fit in. I'm trying to make sure the people who have been sort of left out of things feel... Yeah. Not left out. You don't want them to feel the same as way as you do? Yeah. Yeah, I get that. I, I recognize that too, and I see that too. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Sorry, we're having emotional uh, terrorism RP. I'm sorry. <laughs> appreciate I don't it. Don't expect you to be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome, raiders. Just, just don't give up on our relationship. Okay, that's all I ask. I never intended to. I may have been hurt. I, I figured it wasn't, um, it probably wasn't intentional. I would never intentionally do anything to hurt you. Hope you have a great stream. Thank you. Appreciate it. I hope you had a wonderful stream. Hope everybody's having a good night. And then, um, a sort of a compounding issue was, uh, I, I did hear about, you know, well, I guess I noticed it first. Um, you took up a position. And, uh, I was, I was worried because I didn't know if you were ready for that kind of thing. Or maybe, 
Maybe it's more that I'm worried that if you were still sorting through your problems and hadn't reached out to me, how do I reach out to you for things? How do I so, get comfortable with that? That's very valid, and I haven't... I haven't officially taken it up yet. My first task was to make sure that this, this exact moment was okay, that all the, all the things that I've, you know, all the ripple effects of me leaving and coming back has been addressed first before I, I'm okay to step into that position. That, that's, that's what I'm doing right now. I've been, I've been trying to reach out to everybody in, uh, in my own time and it's been difficult, but I'm trying and it's kind of giving me a look into what it's going to be like when I do take up this role and I do want people to be comfortable enough to come to me and open up to me to be able to go through this. So I'm, I'm glad that we can talk today. And that's also a very valid concern. But I also know where my limits are as well, because I would, I would tell Vito when it is too much. Like I said earlier, I am I work best when I'm busy. It might not be healthy, but it keeps me busy. That's kind of what I'm afraid of. You're a little too much like me. <laughs> yeah. I was a workaholic because I could not function without having something else to focus on. And I sacrificed a lot of stuff for that. Friendships, relationships, family. It helped me a lot in my professional life, but in the end, it kind of destroyed a lot of what I had. A lot of what was me got thrown into a bucket. Or, I don't know, maybe chained up to a wall or something. And I just, I worry about that for you, because I don't think that is healthy. And I'm going to be honest here, and I, I don't want you to take this the wrong way, because I don't, I don't think you were wrong to do what you did. I think if you needed it, you needed it. And that's the end of the story, and, and no one needs to question that. But my concern would be, how does it look to other people who don't really know you that well? When the going gets tough, are you going to leave again? Is that going to be a concern that people need to have? And you don't, you don't need to answer that. It's kind of rhetorical, but it's something that you need to think about because what happened left an impression on people, not just myself. I, I'm, I'm trying hard not to judge you for what happened yeah, because yeah. I understand. And, uh, you know, I gave you space. I, I really didn't want to... It's one of the reasons I didn't send you any texts or anything, because I didn't want you to have to think about this place. Mm -hmm. um, but it, it did leave an impression, and I worry about how people are going to look at you for the future. Is, is that a concern that they need to have, you know? And I, I don't have an answer for that. Maybe you might. 
and you don't have to give me one. But I'm sure you realize it, and maybe I don't need to verbalize it. But if no one has, I do think that someone needs to say that to you. And I, I mean it with as much respect as I can give. I know. I, 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 it has crossed my mind that it's the easy way out. And at that point, it just felt like if I didn't do that, it um, something more drastic would have happened. Yeah. But I, I do, I do understand where you're coming from, and I know, and I hope that every time I think about doing that, I can now see the repercussions and the ripple effect it leaves on people, and I won't do it again. I hope I won't do it I, again. I don't. I, I have thought about it. I don't need you to promise me you won't do it again because. If you need to, I want you to. But maybe learn from this experience and communicate with people a little bit. Try to, um, I don't know. The, the secrecy was a killer. It was brutal. Yeah. It led me into a, a place I didn't want to be. Thinking things about other people that I shouldn't have thought. And there were a lot of conversations that needed to be had that shouldn't have needed to be had. So... I think that's all I'm trying to say is maybe in the future, if you need it, do it a little differently. I will. Because that's for you as well as for everyone else. I will. Thank you, Tessa. What do you think you need to, um, to feel better about, you know, where you are right now? I'm not really sure. I think the biggest thing that I'm dealing with right now is, um, I, I feel like I'm this, this dog that's been chained in a yard, unable to leave, unable to do anything that I want to do. for a really long time and coming back to the city I felt like um, I broke off of that chain and there wasn't anything to hold me back from a lot of the stuff that I want to do. And I'm worried that as I'm running to this gate of, you know, freedom and fewer responsibilities or fewer concerns for other people, someone is going to step on that leash. Maybe 
Maybe it's a metaphorical someone like being tied down to a group. Mm -hmm. Because I had a I had the talk with Vito about you know how my actions affect other people. Mm -hmm. And that's how I had to think about the PD a lot of the time. You know, I had to worry about what I was doing all the time. And now I'm a little more free and I want to do things, but I find myself having to stop because I don't know how it's going to affect the group. And that scares me a lot. Because it, it feels the same as that leash that kept me in the yard. And I don't know how to feel about that. Because I, I don't want to say you were, like, your group is holding me back, or this group, or mm. my group, you know. No, I but wouldn't think that. I wouldn't think that. You know, I'm, I'm worried that if I go do something with someone... You know, things might happen, and it'll take off someone or another. And I just... I had a taste of freedom for a minute. Yeah. Tessa, at the end of the day, you should do what makes you happy, truly happy, what makes you feel free, and if you don't want to be tied down to something again, then just think it through. Is this what you want? People are still going to love you nonetheless. All of these people adore you dearly. And that's why it's hard. You won't lose that. I don't know. I just, I think I just don't know what I want. That's okay. A lot of people don't know what they want. A lot of people are unsure of most of the decisions they, they do. I don't know what I'm going to eat for breakfast most days. It's the little things sometimes. Oh, it's the larger picture sometimes. But just know that you have so many people that love you and support you and will be happy to call you and hang out with you and do dumb things with you and just be in your presence. Just know that. No matter where you are in the city, no matter where you go, that's important. And I don't think anybody's going to fault you for that. The, um, the, the you know situation kind of was set me off a little bit. In what way? Uh, I, I think Lottie wanted to hang out with him and, you know, there's obviously issues going on with the uh, GG stuff and... Yeah. 
I don't know, I just... I was, I was blocked behind red tape for so long. And if there's somebody I want to hang out with, I don't... I don't know what I would do if someone told me no. I don't know if I can handle that. That's okay. I think um, situations like that and actually feeling strongly for or against it is, is important. It makes you human. And I think Lordy probably feels the exact same way you do. It doesn't mean that we're going to love you any less. It's impossible. I really wanted to make things work. A lot of ways I still do, but I've just been on this roller coaster, and I'm I'm going back and forth between what I want and what I don't want. And I don't know where I'm gonna end up. I don't want to lose anybody. I don't think you're going to, Tessa. You might just be looking at it in a negative light, but I don't think you're going to. Thank you, you know, we'll balance each other out. You can look at all the cons and I'll just look at all the pros, okay? Because I don't think you're going to. You're not going to lose me. I'll still be. After today, I really want to make time. I really want to make time for us. I want to put some of that worker bee syndrome I have, and I want to put that into you. Spend time with you. And that's, that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where you are, who you're with. What if, I don't know, what if somebody I'm hanging out with does something really dumb and I don't know. That, that's, that's a what if that we don't know yet, right? It hasn't happened. So you shouldn't worry about it. I, I was looking at too many hypotheticals and it was kind of the reason I left too. And I, I feel bad as well because um, everyone's been working towards making me feel more welcome. I've gotten real close to a lot of people. 
Can I? I want that. But my nature is. I don't know, to, to be friends with a lot of people, to float, to be. I don't know how to describe, maybe like a free agent. Just to go do things. I can, you can still do that even if you're not, you know, here 100%. You can still have those friends that you made here, this relationship you formed. Just need to ask yourself what what you want, and it's okay that you say you don't know what you want, Tessa. Just take time. Just take the time you need to make that decision. I don't want you to be end up being unhappy. I don't want anyone to feel like, um, they did anything wrong. It's kind of a me issue. I'm really scared of being tied down and having to, um, Consider everything carefully through the, the lens of the people. Yeah. I wanted to, but I just, I don't think I can. Take your time, Tessa. I don't have the answers for you, and you might ha not have the answers right now, but just take your time, okay? You'll probably feel better tomorrow, or feel differently, or feel indifferently. Just, just take your time. I'll always be here. And I promise I won't run away again. You don't have to promise me that. But you do gotta promise you'll text me. I promise I'll text you. I'll call you. Or I'll send a messenger. Somebody just keep me in the loop. I'll do that. And I don't know, I'm not fully out or anything, I just... I don't know what I want. And I don't, I also don't know if there's a problem with that. Me not being sure. I don't know if I should distance myself from things or... Do exactly what, but um, I just 
feel like one one foot's out the door, one foot is in the door, and I... You're not the only one who feels that way, Tessa. There's other people who also feel that way. You also have to make big decisions. And, um, I can imagine it's not easy. Just know that there's people around you who can offer the support that you might not think you need or want or deserve. But just know that they are there if you seek them. I know you said you sometimes just leave people alone anyway. You don't want to bother them, but... Maybe you should, because maybe they have the answers you're looking for as well. Maybe the people you see who are distancing themselves, who you think are being left out, maybe those are the people that you can find solace in. Maybe. I had a lot of ideas at the start. I thought, you know, I could get into some business things or I don't know, just hang out with random people that I never got to hang out with before. I'm just so worried that's going to be a problem. My strength lies in that agency, that ability to float between groups. But it's hard when you also want to belong. Have back up. I got a, a little peek at that with some stuff Tony and I talked about. And I never had that. And it, it's nice. I do think the cost is a good chunk of my agency and my freedom. And I really need to decide whether or not that's acceptable for me. You guarantee, Tessa, you still have, you know, people who go to bat for you, even if you weren't in a group like this. Those people still care for you. It doesn't change a thing. Are you sure? I am. Because I, I worry about that. Like, what would they think of me? Maybe you should go to the people who you worry about the most and have this conversation with them.
talk to some people and see. said you have a whole support system behind you even if you don't realize it you really do somehow i i just you doubt it i don't feel like vito would see it that way and his is the vote that matters. I didn't, I don't think, um, I don't think Vito would see a lot of things a lot of ways, but recently he, he's changed my mind on a lot of things, Tessa. Just give it a chance. He'll understand. I feel like I've been a wreck for a while. I, I think one thing specifically that I was sort of thinking about is, um, Mr. K called me yesterday and told me about how people are up there hunting and it's all unregulated and there's just a massacre up there and he asked me if I wanted to go up there and hide in a bush and do some crackhead stuff with him And I wanted to say yes so bad. But I knew that a lot of our people were interested in hunting. And if we crossed paths with Mr. K, or if they did, I guess, and, and me and I was there and something happened I, I don't know what I would do but There's, there's just a lot of, um, repercussions that you were thinking of. Yeah. Yeah. Or, like, if he did something to somebody that was a friend of ours, or... Just all kinds of things that could go wrong.
I think these are all concerns and questions that are very valid and it's okay to go through ahead and uh, it is probably with everything happening recently you know probably rules for thee and not for them kind of situation if you you know if nothing were to happen but you still went through with it type of deal but it's also okay to wonder like what is going through that right because I think you can still approach and have all these questions when you decide if you want to you know stick close by or stay fully you can have these questions and set these boundaries I don't think it's I don't think it's so black or white I'm still gonna be here to support you in whatever you do, okay, Tessa? Even if I go up north in a ghillie suit and hide in a bush with a knife and yell at people? You could go do that. I think it would be really funny if you did that. You know? You can answer. That's right. Maybe she's in trouble. <clears throat> What if I hurt somebody? Do you want to hurt somebody? Did anyone tell you about the situation with Carlo? And the bunny? Um, briefly, I think. I think I was told about that with... I can't remember. I, I talked to so many people in the past two days. just made me think about some things. I don't know what I'll do if somebody hurts some animals in front of me to push my buttons. I don't know what I'll do if somebody brings a deer head to my face because they're going to do it. Inevitably, they're going to do it. And I'm worried that I'm going to have to think about the impact of what my reaction is. Because I'm not going to apologize for my reaction. Even if it's a friend of the family. I talked to Vito about it. 
but I just... I don't want to have to think about it. Sometimes you have to, to make sure there's a, an outcome that you can kind of control. <gasps> Thank you, Christopher. I think I have a lot to think about. And I don't know what me telling you any of this means. Just think of it as a, an outlet for your thoughts. But your thoughts are safe with me, Tessa. Always. You're not going to tell Vito or Joe that I'm... job right now was to make sure that me and you were good you know I'll have if you want to have that conversation with Vito or Joe I'll let you do that because I don't think that you need people pressuring you right now Okay. Sorry, it got kind of heavy. I just... It's okay. I haven't had the heart to tell Juno about any of it. She's the most likely person I'd tell, but... I'll try to figure out what I want. Take your time, Tessa. If you need another talk, let me know, okay? I'll be here. Okay. How are you doing? I'm okay. I'm actually okay. Come to town. Are you with sure? Stuff. Yeah, I am. You're not just meeting with people and ignoring your own side of things and putting it in the back burner because you're a workaholic. 
It might be a 60-40 situation, you know? Half and half, kind of. I, I am okay, though. Like, I've... I dealt with a lot of my... my things back in Italy, and... I talked a lot about boundaries and goals and everything with Luciana when we got back and it's been better. It's just um, to see where it's just living life day by day. I just don't want to think too much about anything in front of me. It might be sad because it seems like I'm just trying to survive the day, but it, it gets me through the day, I guess. Is there any way I can help? You just did by actually reminding me that I need to also ask myself how am I doing. So just keep on asking me how I am. Hey. If you need anything, I'm usually around. I appreciate that. Like I said, I'd like to make more time to actually spend with you and Lodi and um, Fifi as well. Just actually spend time with everybody. Well, you're usually going to be uh, able to join me in whatever I'm doing, depending, because, yeah, sometimes we get a, a big group together and we gotta, like, split up, but, I'll try to remember to include you in things, I'm, I'm trying to remember to include everybody, so that no one's feeling like they're left out, or, stuck by themselves. I got some serious abandonment issues that I'm sorting through. And a part of the way that I cope with that is making sure other people have a place to go. And sometimes I can't reach out As I'm coping with it myself, then I get a little petty and I don't reach out. Yeah, I can see that. Because you get into your thoughts of like, if they're not trying, why should I? Is that how it is? Maybe a little bit. Yeah. Or, I think more for me, it's like, I think they don't want me around. So I, I don't impose myself on them. And I'm working through that. But I'll, uh, I'll, I'll put you on the, the list as well, of people to include. I love that. Carlo's on that list. It's weirdly enough. Carlo? I'm trying to mend my relationship with him after the bunny thing. I'm happy to hear that. I hope that he still isn't the same Carlo as back in the day where he 
or somebody tells him that they don't like something and he goes out of his way to do exactly that. That's what I'm trying to prevent. Okay. I want him to respect my boundary and with that I need him to respect me because I can't just loudly walk into a room and say respect me and have it happen. He needs to know why he can or should. So I need to include him and I need to make sure that he knows that I care about it. And if he ends up caring about my feelings, then he won't push that button. Because I, I told Vito that that is my hard line. Um, I can't be in a group that does that. I can't be heavily invested in a group that does that. Yeah. Makes sense. Or, I guess at the very least, I can't be involved with that if I can't. Make them regret it in a way that matters to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's, it's good to set those boundaries between people. I think sometimes people are just afraid to communicate with each other. If you can't communicate with somebody, um, there's, there's just no chance for anything there. I'll try to talk to some people about it. I appreciate you, Tessa. I appreciate you. Thank you for hearing me out. I know I rambled a lot. No, it was, it was needed and it was worth it. So I'm happy this happened. Me too. I should probably check in on Juno. I need to call Carlo back. And then I'm gonna go to bed. I'm tired. Okay. Do you need a ride anywhere? No. I've just been, uh... I'll, uh, I'll walk back to the apartment so I'm good. Okay. Hope you have a good night, Tessa. You too. Hey, yep. Hey, Tessa. What are you laughing at? Uh, I'm missing your buns and Adam said something funny. I was like, do you want to hang out with us? I, I ran into Benji and his friend when I was at the pier. Um, it was actually kind of funny. You want to hear something? 
I was really confused by it. It was like, do you know, whenever I, I've seen you, you'd come up to the car and you'd be really, really emotional and crying. And I was like, what do you mean? I've never cried in front of you. He's like, no, you would. You would. I was like, no, I wouldn't. He, and then he goes, he, he pauses for a second, for a few moments. He goes, oh, fuck. I think I got you mixed up with someone else. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, we're at Senior Bruns if you wanna if you wanna come on by. Yeah, I'll come by. You okay? Yeah, I just had a talk with Eve. Okay, um, you wanna meet up and talk about it? Just no. I? no, I don't. No. Okay. I wanna come to cool. Senior Bruns and... and have a laugh. Yeah. Yeah, we can do that. Alright, I love you. I love you too. I'll see you here. Okay. Bye bye. 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 Wendy, thank you so much for the tier two 53 months. Welcome back. And what's going on? Thank you as well for the 44 months. And Yosef, thank you for the gifted. Uh, to Mattbot. So yeah, Tessa's been having some doubts in her mind about things again, because uh, she just, she doesn't know where she wants to be with things. Because the, the, The shackles that a group represents are something that she's really resistant to right now. And a lot of what Juno's been talking about, a lot of what she's been seeing with um, other people in the group. Hello? Yes, uh, Hi, Chatterbox. You... You don't... I mean... I'm so... <laughs> Oh, do you, do you have a- you have a job, right? Um, I've got a few jobs, why? Oh, uh, okay, you don't... You don't work at the VU, right? No, I do. What do well, you do there? not technically work there, but sometimes I dance oh. there. Um... Like... <laughs> like, to the music, but not up on the... That weird... Pole thing, right? Well, no, there's not a pole up there. Oh, there's no pole dancing? No, I don't think so. There might be one at the back, but I never use that. Oh, so you don't do that weird... Okay. Oh, well, I, oh I people dance. kept coming up to you saying, Chatterbox, I see your mom at the view all the time. I'm like, what? Yeah, I'm just making sure what the... Oh, Mr. Ratchet, some gang members. Jeez, I was worried there for me. I was like, oh, I thought I got the wrong idea. Okay, I feel a lot better about this. I, I thought it was, I thought it was something bad, you know, like, oh. Well, no, I, I go up there and I dance and I'm fully clothed and it's just oh, fun, okay. you know? Okay, 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 gotcha. Woo! It's for fun. Woo! Okay, yuck you both of you, yuck it, idiot! Okay, I got, I got another, uh, question. I okay. saw somebody on Twitter, they had a picture of you and were trying to... Are you on a dating site? No, that's Carlo, and he just was joking around, making me. Oh, so uh... it's not real, huh? No, no, I was. Oh, okay, I was good, 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 good. Okay. I was looking so, so you for. Said Carlo? Yeah, I was looking for a plus one to go to the party with me, and I got somebody to go with me, so I'm good. Okay, kill Carlo. Okay, okay. Thanks, Tessa. No, you no, have no. a great rest of your Chatterbox. night. Okay. Chatterbox. Yeah. Yeah. Do well, not. Well. Do not kill Carlo. I will not do such thing. Do not hurt Carlo. He's a friend. He was joking around with me. It was funny, okay? It's not an issue. I'm not upset about it. Uh, you know, he was he's making a joke. It was a it was a funny thing, right? 
Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, I won't hurt him then. Okay, if it was funny, I won't hurt him. Yeah, I thought it was funny. It was, um, I was okay. joking around on Twitter and I said, stop, you know, but I, you know, it was a, it was a playful thing, you know, we weren't, okay, so, we weren't so upset. Nobody, anybody calling you trying to go on a date? Uh, no, actually, nobody called me. I had somebody no, no there that uh, w went with me and we had a lot of fun. Nobody came and bugged you after that? No. I was hitting on you, Tessa, right? No. Okay, good, good. Okay, there okay, was that Tessa, one okay. guy. Wait, which guy? Oh, some guy, he came to me at Senior Buns. I don't even know what his name was, but he sang... Look like? He sang Hey There Delilah to me, and then I told him what? I was a lesbian. And then, uh, he... Well, actually, no, he sang the song, and then he said, Hey, baby girl, how you doing? What? Or something. And then I told him I'm a lesbian, and he was quiet for a really long time after that, but... Um, I want, I want, I, uh, what do you look like? Clothes? No, I, I oh, sound I a little weird. Like any, um, any little details you can tell me? Because I, no, 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 no. We had red hair, I think. Red but hair? Okay. Um, I, uh, what was I he wearing? Really like, didn't, uh, I didn't care enough about this individual to look at him in any meaningful capacity. So I wouldn't worry about him. I don't know. I couldn't really give you a good description. Okay, okay. No, that's okay. Kidnap everyone. Okay, I got no, it. Okay, no, Tessa, no, thank no, you no, very much. You have the green with you. You can date me. Any other boy you can You call me, all right? And I will, you can take care Chatty. of me. And I see something with red hey. hair that I got to go take care of really quick. I got to go say hi. Chatty, I'll have tell you what. Night, I'll tell I you what. You. Chatty. What? <laughs> like the Super Mario, like the tunes from Super Mario? They go, boom, boom, boom. I don't know what that is. You got him, you got him. Oh, I'm blind. Adam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I don't know. He hey, doesn't really look like me. He kind of looks like... Hello. He kind of looks like Michael Wait, Sarah. I think that's your actual real mom. Um, Excuse wait, me? Yeah. Adam, that's your real mom, Mom? Whoa. No, mom. I'm, not mom. Mom. I'm not your mom. I'm not your mom. Oh, okay. Guys, I'm starting to think you guys might not know who my mom is. You just nope. keep pointing at people and saying well, that's your mom. Well, we got a couple guesses. I mean, they were First it was guesses. her, then it was him, then it was her, now it's her. I don't her. know. I don't think a son of mine would put my Crocs in sport mode like that. Sport mode oh. means you're going to go fast. Okay. I got places shoot. to be, all right? My little feet take me places. Okay. I don't know. It. Do you know this guy? This guy? Yeah, that's Ryan. Okay. Um, I'm Ryan. I feel happy. like I was just uh, given some pretty incredible news <laughs> and then it was quickly taken away from me and I am just still trying to deal with the fact that I was hit by a car earlier. <laughs> how do you get Are hit you sure by a car? You, you sounded like you really, it was like travesty. How, how do you get to, hit yeah, by a car? It sounded like it was well, crazy. Okay, <laughs> I don't, I, okay, so I laid down in front of the car um and i have a friend and um we just thought maybe we could get like 200 bucks you know oh wow Ooh, Ooh, so how much did you get? um nothing they just ran me over okay wow okay did you get that removed uh, oh he hey that on him. i don't know oh, oh okay oh my value yeah, went down surgical dang it it was 15 earlier today. Wow, only this five? This guy's creeping wow. me out a little bit. Ooh, who's He's your up? son. No, that, you gotta cut. You keep huh? shooting babies out of my old vagina. Nah, and I, this I don't this, is, this is his brother. No, nah, this is his brother. That's I my flower crown. You can't have brother? it. That's your brother, he man. Look like you. Yeah. That's your long lost yeah. brother. Good to see you're doing well, That's, brother. Uh, that's you guys got some weird okay, Targaryen maybe you lineage bullshit going on here. No, don't Who give me flower crown. Honking, bro? No. I'm gonna go I stab whoever's no. honking. I can't lie, though. It way past the company. It's set to the company. Wait, 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 Oh, wow. Shit. You gotta put in more That's work, bro. Good. 
Ooh, like. Please give him something, bro. Give him something, man. Is you know what's great you about flower crowns? Ah, okay, all right. Let me let me try. It. Just you just go pick oh my flowers God, and what? make more. <laughs> That low? What oh the fuck? God, That's okay. Food, yeah, listen, I, I'm Thank good you. for I'm Foxy good for the, the quarter. Go I was like good last time I checked. Here, brother, take this. We can make daisy yeah. flower crowns for each other. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bro, he's so stunned right now. He's stunned right now. Bro, what about her? Maybe you can take her. You know who this is? Scan her. No, don't scan me. My value scan isn't. Her. Scan her. Scan her. Isn't valued by points. No, I think it could be though. Wow. No. Ah. Oh, nice, Rod. Oh my oh, God. Sorry. <laughs> Benji, That's you go. Oh, no. You go oh. five, man. You go That's five as well, buddy. How? <laughs> I've hit the quarter first. Oh, you, didn't, you didn't have to question what about me? mark though. Sorry. I don't want everyone to know who I am. What about me? Yeah, why, why, it's not a competition, it. you know? It's not a oh, competition. That's crazy. Not Everything's a competition with you, Benji. No balls. Wait, really? That's you think crazy. so? You think I'm like that? No, no, no. I'm Just not, blank your area. Oh, God! Why did you hurt oh, grandma? That's Adam's oh, mom! Five, no! no. Ow, oh, you... This fucker way. finds me no matter where I go and runs me over like a bulldozer. Not true. My name is not Brad either. Ah, uh, shut the fuck up, Brad. Shut up, Brad. I'm so sorry. Shut up. Oh, he said he was sorry. Yeah, get oh. out of here, man. Get him. Oh, my oh. God. Oh. Yeah, fuck you, Brad. Watch oh. this. Nice oh. throw. <laughs> Look at that idiot. I think this is our group quota, guys. I think y'all... Listen, I've contributed. I've, I got my ones. God, I have so much stuff on me. Well, I haven't. I haven't, I haven't given anything. I'll, I'll to what? Give the quota? Yes, the quota. Uh, I have forty-eight thousand yeah, dollars. Is that enough? Hi. Forty-eight k. Is that enough? I'm wanting to tell you something. What? Oh my God. Watch out, there's a pole. Do you know? I'm going to tell you something. <laughs> Just come here, I'm going to tell you something. I'm getting stressed. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh my god. I was just memeing around, but also I actually do, do want to tell you something. I contacted Pixie for, um, some anti-anxiety meds. Oh, okay. You think yeah. it'll help? Yeah, I think so. So, it's, 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 it's a lot. So I want to be able to, you know, help relieve it in some way. Cause I don't rely on you all the time. Especially if you have your own stuff going on. And, um, I think it's unhealthy to rely on one person. Or on an... A person in general. Well, I think that is a good move. I hope that, you know, you also can address the issue causing it. But, I, I think... This could probably help you, at least see things a little more clearly. I agree. But I'm glad I'm, I'm glad you're uh, getting some help. Yeah. But I'm still here. You need it. I'm here for you too. Whenever you're ready, okay. Fine, cool baby. Uh, hello. You probably should call Chatty. He just stabbed a pig. What? You probably should call Chatty because he just stabbed a pig guy. A a pig guy? Was it yeah. a pig or a pig guy? I don't know. He's running around saying, "Oh my gosh, I stabbed a pig." Okay. Um, I'll give him a call. It might be fine. I'll give him a call. All right. 
Okay, bye. Okay, goodbye. Oh, I need to save his number. Who was that? It was Lily, uh, calling me about Chatterbox. Sorry, who? Lily calling me about Chatterbox. Oh, okay. I just want to check in. Oh no. He hung up on me. Uh oh. Oh, my, my hand. Oh. Help. <laughs> Help. Oh no, Pixie was right. We have to go to the hospital. She said it gets stuck to my face. She told me that earlier today. I need help. Help me. What? You know. What? I, can't, I can't put my arm down. Help me. Help. Why is your hand stuck to your face? I don't know. Okay, Help okay. me. Okay, point. Current point. <laughs> I can't. Help okay. me. Um, try hug me. Maybe see if that helps. <laughs> Juno. Uh. Oh no. Um. Uh, Help me. Uh, um, um, I gotta go talk yourself? to Pixie. Where is tackle she? Yourself? Tackle yourself. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Easy. Oh. I'm a life saver. Oh. Oh God, I need to listen to Pixie more often. <laughs> I'm just gonna see you one day off in the distance, just, just hitting the ground face first. <laughs> <laughs> Because your hand's stuck to your face. What is that? Uh, uh oh. What? Uh oh, what? What? Am I... Am I... I'm drinking? <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> no! <laughs> Juno! <laughs> Juno, help! <laughs> help! I try, try dancing, try dancing. You don't know. Oh, good night, Tessa. I love you. I love you too, right in the butt. Play control. Or else. <laughs> okay. I swear to God. Stop twitching like that. I'm twitching? Oh, no, you're not. Oh, well, now you are again. <laughs> oh, how am I twitching? <laughs> <laughs> how am I twitching, huh? You're, your hand sucks you. Oh no! What is she doing? <laughs> She's flopping around. Oh my god. I don't know what just happened to me. Oh, that was too funny. It's a sign. A sign of the end times. Well, we'll see.
All right. Well. Finally, an even Tessa talk. Yeah, I think, um... Tessa's biggest issue right now is that she just she just came back from her situation where she was tied down with the PD and she got kind of a little taste of freedom and, and you know being being able to do anything that she felt like uh, and then things with the family started kicking off and she realized that like there's gonna be some stuff that she needs to come to terms with or reject um also swift thank you for the prime uh so her her big thing is that when things happen like things go down for example, the you know situation, or uh, I don't know any any future situations, or whatever Juno was doing with uh, the twatter beef and and things like that. Like, uh, she's afraid of being restricted in that way. Saturn, thank you for the raid. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. <laughs> oh my god thank you so much for the raid welcome everybody we're just kind of having a talk about the eve stuff um yeah somebody show the clip <laughs> so uh you know tessa's in a weird spot because she is afraid of what will happen if she's told no and she defies that because Right now, if something happens and she decides to make a decision on things uh, and it impacts the family negatively, can she handle being told no, number one? And can she handle the repercussions? Some of the repercussions she's seen for negative activity in the group have been bad things that she doesn't want to have to go through um so she's she's not sure exactly where she wants um <clears throat> Yuno is doing a completely different thing than Tessa is, than t than what Tessa wants to do. Uh, Yuno is chaotic to a fault, like extremely chaotic. Uh, you know, Tessa Tessa doesn't do stuff stupidly. She's not. She doesn't want to be. I, she used the term crackhead, but she doesn't want to be a crackhead. She just wants to be able to make a crackhead decision here and there. Um, you know, is more of the do this thing right here, right now. Don't think about anything until later. Like he's, he like, <laughs> he's very, um, too much chaos. And that's probably why he had trouble. Um, Tessa is more in the vein that she wants to do things with other groups. She wants to do things with JP. She wants to do things with Mr. K. She wants to be able to do things with Yuno or, um, you know, the clowns or the HOA. Uh, like anybody that invites her to things, she wants to be able to go to and not have it be an issue. If there's a problem that arises that prevents her from doing things or makes her have to say no like Lottie had to say no to you know when she wanted to do things with him uh Tessa had a hard time thinking about that because 
what if she wants to say yes she doesn't want to have to get permission from people she doesn't want to have to ask for forgiveness from people um Well, so Tato, there's the thing. She's been told that it's okay, but everything that she's seen from the group tells her that that's not true. It's not okay to to be kind of chaotic. It, it, your actions impact the group, and she's scared of being pinned down like that. Tied up and having to watch from the sidelines while certain things happen. Like, if... I don't know, maybe the clowns do something stupid one day and Tessa, you know, doesn't like the overreaction that's bound to happen. If she can't de-escalate that situation, she's going to be in a hard spot. Um, and it's, it's more harsh when she's tied down with a certain group because... I, I don't know, it's it's hard to explain my thoughts on it, but Tessa, Tessa wants right now to have her cake and eat it too. And that's what she's coming like to struggle with. She has to figure out which one she wants. Because she can't really have both. And she, she sees that, she knows that. So I, I don't know where I want her to land and I don't know where she wants to land as a character like I and you know I don't want to have to say no to certain things either because it's more fun for me as well on, on certain things um so we, we need to think about these things kind of early while the stuff is still developing, right? Well, I don't think she wants to have that spice of being told no and having to leave afterwards. Like... She doesn't want to be in a, a situation like Luciano was, where, where he stepped away and everyone was, like, devastated. Because she doesn't, she doesn't want to leave them. She, she absolutely still wants to hang out with them and, you know, have relationships with them, like, close, very personal relationships with those people. Um, but... It just is like, to what degree does she want that? And that's that's what I have to figure out, and that's what Tessa has to suss out on, on her own as well. So, it's a little bit of me and a little bit of her, I think. Because I need to figure out where I want her to go as a character. And what's, what's more where I want to go as well with things. Yeah, maybe maybe the associate route is a better better concept for Tessa cuz she like she certainly wants the backing of certain people, but she also would recognize, you know, that would not always be the case. And there's, there's people in that group that I think she could probably always rely on to a certain degree. Like Juno, I think she could always rely on, but at the same time, Juno might have to say no to certain things too. 
And like if Tessa needed Juno's help on something while not being in the group, would Juno have to get permission? You know, and that that that's kind of another one of Tessa's issues with it all. And I, I kind of enjoy the free agent style of, of playing, personally. I think I think it's more fun to be kind of uh, in between. It's, it's rough on Tessa, but I kind of like that. Because that brings some, some spice of its own that I personally enjoy. So, I don't know. I think I think joining the family is the easy route, of course. But is it is it exactly what I want? I don't know. But I do know the role play with them won't end if we don't um go all in with the group. Definitely would not. So I, I don't know where I want. I don't know where I want to go, but I'm <laughs> tiny troublemakers better still hit licks. Yeah, <laughs> that's that's kind of the energy I'm after is like doing random goofy stuff with random goofy people and seeing where that goes. I don't agree, Jimothy. I think Tessa's always been a free agent. She's always been that way. And, and respectfully, you didn't see the RP back in the day, I don't think. Before we were a cop. Before we were anything other than Tessa. So, I don't know. Trust, trust the process, maybe. Um... Because it could lead to something interesting. Because before before Tessa became a cop, she was pretty pretty strictly a free agent. She didn't have any like particular group. She didn't have any um you know thing that she stuck to. And it worked for for me and for her. And I do I like the idea of a group in some aspects, but I also think it can be <clears throat> eliminating in its own way. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot of different directions I can take it, um, but I need to figure out what I want to do. And I know some of you guys have your hearts set on certain things, so I'm sorry if it disappoints anyone if I make a decision you're not, you know, super keen on.
And again, the the RP with the Italians would not end. Like, at all. It would definitely still continue. So I don't want anybody to think that that is what I'm getting at either. We'd still have time to, to hang out with Tony. We'd still hang out with, you know, Juno. Like, everybody, really. But, you know, maybe we wouldn't be in their meetings. We wouldn't be stood in the circle. You know? And that's not a huge loss for me. I don't think. I, I don't know. And yeah, there's no rush either. I think... I don't know if there will be a spot for me later, but there could be if what we choose to do doesn't work out. We could probably find a group to settle with. Could we could if the Italians don't want us anymore, I'm sure we could find a group. I think I think we'd be able to find some place to hang out and and find a home if the the whole freelance thing doesn't work. And Tessa is extremely good at mending relationships with people too. Like if if damage gets done by her choices in in the future, whatever the future holds, she can fix a lot just by talking to people. So, I don't want anyone to think that decisions made now would be just permanent and nothing ever would come of anything else ever again. It's just a final decision and oh my god, she's... She, all her avenues are closed. You know, because that's not the case. And yeah, she hasn't even chosen yet, so we, we might still decide to stay. I don't know. So I, I don't want anyone to doom and, and think everything's going to be terrible from now on. But I kind of wanted to just explain. Max can turn Tessa and Juno into Terrace. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, and maybe, like, maybe they won't make her choose, you know? Within the next couple weeks. Maybe she can take her time. Figure out where she feels is right. But, I don't know. I'm, uh, thinking about a lot of stuff and where I want to go with the RP and, and the, the newness of 4.0, because I have been enjoying everything so far. Like, a lot. There hasn't, there hasn't been a day where I've been like, man, today sucked. <laughs> Which is important i think yeah and ziggy hanging out with ziggy and uh you know there's a ton of people that i'd really like to have rp with and and focus on Yeah, and a Divines group could be fun to be hanging out with for a while, or, uh... Any new groups we encounter, maybe we can have fun with.
<laughs> Ziggy with the Italians, yeah. I don't know where Ziggy has been kind of falling, but he's, I think he said he was in Polito doing stuff, so. He's probably got uh, some stuff going on up there. I, I would imagine he's probably hanging with the HOA. Or people adjacent. But. Yeah, and I think the important thing is I'm, I'm really enjoying it just not being a cop this time around. And that's like... Honestly, that's enough newness for me to, like, be comfortable with everything else. Just not being a cop right now is... ...a blessing for me. Because I'm, I'm getting to, to do things that I haven't been able to do in a really long time. Or ever, to be honest, so... A lot of it's been fun. A lot of it's been really, really enjoyable. So, that's kind of where I'm at, and, uh, you know. Being a cop seems fun, but also seems like a lot of real work. Uh, it can be. I don't know if it is now. I don't know how it was, like... I don't know. Yeah, even just speaking unfiltered is something Tessa couldn't do for years. Yeah, you're right. She has she has dropped a lot of her guardedness, and it might come back to bite her. But we're uh, we're experimenting. Now is now is the best time to experiment and see what there is out there, because other people are willing to accept that. They're open to it. They're open to having strangers come knocking at their door. And uh, bringing, bringing people they wouldn't normally along. And, you know, several months from now when people have kind of settled, that's going to be harder. You know what I mean? So... I'm interested in seeing where things go and, and what I want to do and how much fun it can be. So that's what we're going to do, I think. But, uh, yeah. Tessa was a cop for a few months at the end of 2.0. And then all of 3.0, she was a cop. But she was she was very shackled to her job in 3.0. And so that's I think the biggest issue that she's got right now is that she's so incredibly averse to having literally any resistance to anything she might want to do. She's so freaked out by the idea of someone being like, no, you can't do that. This will it's bad for this, that, and another. You know, she can't handle that right now. And that's a really bad thing for a group. So it's kind of, it's kind of where she's at mentally. Yeah, we'll see Tato. We'll, we'll talk to him and stuff, but I think Tessa would do good from a talk with Andy. Yeah, we we will see. I think uh, I think I am done for the night, though. I'm kind of tired. 
I was, I was trying to decide whether I wanted to get back on, but I just, I don't feel like getting into anything more. <sighs> but yeah, let's find somebody to send all this gosh darn love to. Yeah, give give somebody exposure. <laughs> Who we raid? Actually, I think I know. I think we're going to raid Chatterbox. Our clown son. But anyway, I appreciate you guys. Thank you so, so, so much for hanging out with me and for putting up with, you know, my sometimes whiplashy desire to switch directions with my character. So, uh, I appreciate it. And I hope you guys enjoy the ride. And, uh, you know, stick with me. Let me cook. Trust the process. I promise it'll be all right. And, uh, I will see you all tomorrow. Remember to take care, be kind to yourselves and one another. And, uh, yeah, happy Friday. Well, now I guess it's Saturday for most people, but, you know. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye.